The YouTube stream has started. We're on three platforms simultaneously. Oh boy. Oh, YouTube added a delay ads button. You can delay ads for 10 minutes on a stream if something important's coming up. That's actually kind of nice. You know what we need? We need an open standard for streams and the stream deck. You know what I mean? We need like a YouTube Creator Studio Elgato collab. So like, let's say there's a button I could press on my Steam Deck. The, or Stream Deck, sorry. Then I can delay the ads manually by just pressing a button. That'd be nice. I, I would like that. Do you guys agree? Prepare for normal profile, refine mithril prices to skyrocket more. I'm so glad I already prepped before all this. <laughs> I agree with everything you say. You should be careful saying that. No one's perfect. What's up, doors? Do you guys like the new, uh, the new game music? Yo! Poker Face himself, thank you for the T1 resub. Jaden, thank you for the T3 sub for a year. Damn! Knotted Alpaca, thank you for joining. Becoming a member. As well as the super chat for two bucks. 30 has been forever, what the hell? I'll explain. I always have an explanation, but this time I think it's a good one. Rexu, thank you for the Prime sub. Togski, thank you for the resub with Prime. 30, my friend just randomly said you were going to stream now, entitled Update Day. He was so close. Yep. Even after a month of no stream, Update Day is enough to get me back. Us Skyblock YouTubers are like Tamagotchi. Is anyone in the audience old enough to remember what a Tamagotchi is? The Skyblock admins bought us when they opened the game in 2019. And every update is them checking in to feed us. And if they don't, we die. They gotta feed us content. The return of the king. Pengo YT, thank you for the prime. All right. I think it's time. I think it's time for us to get on with it. it I think everything is functioning currently. We have 300, almost 400 people on YouTube. Hello. We have 200 people on Twitch. And we have... How many people on kick? Do we have one person on kick? Now's your chance, kick viewers. There's not a lot of yous. And by the way, for those of you that do not uh, care about the morals of which platform you're on, hint, all of them are bad morally. So honestly, just pick whichever one has the best user experience for you. I would say if you have Prime, Twitch is probably the best. YouTube is a close second. Actually, that's not even true. Kick might have the best experience for people that don't pay any money. If you don't pay any money, you get no ads. Obviously, that doesn't make me complicit in gambling. But it's a good alt stream for people that are annoyed by ads. So if you're annoyed by ads, in the description is my Kick channel. Oh, what's up, Fearless? Okay. Last thing, I swear. Before we start stream, I gotta do my YouTube shoutouts for the members. There's not a lot of you left. Because I'm dumb. And I... Hold on. Oh, hello. 
godly draw thank you for the eight dollar super chat welcome back thirsty videos how you been personally i've been dying from two full-time jobs in uni i can honestly relate so hard to that uh, thank god i'm free from my second job yeah that was me during my college years not gonna lie monkey man thank you for the two dollar good to see that lobby long long ago might be true i don't know what you mean by that um okay we're gonna shout out the members and we're gonna get started all right, so shout out to Coleosis and Crazy Kid. You are the two, you're the last holdouts of botnet general or leader. Thank you both. I swear the streaming situation is going to change very soon and I have a good reason for it. I say this every time, but this time I really mean it. All right, let's do it. I think we're just gonna skip the rest of this song because we've been... You like the thumbnail, by the way, on the YouTube side? That thumbnail is from four years ago. <laughs> and it somehow applies. Okay. Let's do it. Hello. That was that was a sudden transition. Is it music? Wait, wait, wait. There it is. Hey guys, I'm back for another stream and welcome to Hypixel Skyblock. I'm finally back after a month and a half. 30 Virus is alive. He's here. He's making content for all of you wonderful people on the internet. And I have my caffeine in the form of Diet Mountain Dew. Not sponsored, although I wish I was because I, I am honestly a fan of zero calorie Mountain Dew products. A oh, monkey man, thank you for another two dollar. Unless these, oh no, well, thank you again for the previous two dollars. It just didn't catch up. Drac Z underscore Z, thank you for the prime. DC XDZ, thank you for the T1. I, <laughs> so many of you guys, holy crap. Zombie killer, thank you for the prime. Growly, thank you for the prime resub. Finally, a stream. All right, let's get into the brass tacks. We are here because today is update day. The Glacite tunnels are a thing, or at least they're gonna be in probably an hour or two. <laughs> Sorry. Ugh, soda burps. So why am I streaming so early? We're still in maintenance. If you try to log into Skyblock, there's only 80 people in there. Oh wait, did they literally just open it? They just, no freaking way. There is no way. That is the craziest timing. Thorny, you missed my resub. Oh, you're true. Thank you for the resub relic. M much appreciated. That is so freaking stupid. The game opened as soon as, okay. Here's what my plan was gonna be. We were gonna do the tier list. But I guess we're in the game now, so it's time to play the update. I guess we'll we'll play with the... I guess we'll do the tier list later then. Okay. Um, here's something for the YouTube chat uh, enjoyers. Take a... Or um, keep a lookout for a bot called Bot Tricks. It's what I'm currently using to have like a multi-chat on my monitor for all the platforms. You guys can't see it. Only Twitch shows up on screen. But, um, yeah, if you guys notice the bot in YouTube chat, I need to mod it. So, much appreciated if you spot him. Um, anyways. S Zab, and then several underscores. Thank you for the prime sub. Kiri, thank you for the prime. All right. Well, here we are. The update has just dropped. Welcome back to Skyblock. Let's take a look. My Skyblock level seems to be unchanged. Oh no, something happened. My global ranking went up by 10. Why? Oh, they added so much progression. What the frick? What is it? What is it? What is it? No. They added stuff. They added so much Skyblock XP. They added, okay, okay. Peak of the mountain now goes to 10. Fossil research and okay rock milestone Okay, so I got it would look like three levels from joining we're level 
382 right now. I wonder what else changed. Anything else here? Doesn't look like in there. Is there any new essence? Doesn't look like it. No dungeon tasks, obviously. Events? Nope. 5503, thank you for the five pounds. I quit Skyblock two years ago, but still watch your stuff. Thanks for doing what you do and greetings from Germany. Hey, I appreciate the fact that you're still around. Third in new collection. I didn't play alpha, no. I did not spoil myself for this update. Um, Yes, let's go to recipes. Let's see what's new here. I had every recipe unlocked before this except for like one thing from fishing because i need like 500 or no i need like 50k uh magma fish mining recipes let's go to collections actually that would make a lot more sense tungsten umber glacite <laughs> wasn't there like peridot or something wasn't there the farming one there was the farming fortune gemstone. I don't see it in here. Combat collections. Still chili pepper missing. This ain't fair to normal players, bro. No, stop. This debate is as old as the game itself, bro. When they first made spooky festivals, people were... Save the nons has been a movement for longer than you've known this game has existed, bud. This doesn't happen often. Deal with it. Wait your extra few hours. We It's update day. The game is so starved. Just let us have our update. <laughs> out of here five ads someone tell that guy he can go to the kick stream the alt stream that has no ads uh, not an alpaca thank you for the month of membership all right let's see what else is new um speaking of i just did a mining fiesta last night oh dude there's so much stuff that you on oh my god okay first of all Look at all them coins. Look at that money. Look at that cash right there. 1.6 billion with a B. I made so much money. We were struggling to keep the one bill for Greg and now we're at 1.6. Why did this happen? I attended two mining fiestas and if you go to the garden, this might blow some people's minds. I actually made a real cactus farm. 30 viruses position 135 on the net worth leaderboard for Iron Man players. Hell yeah, did. Yes, I made a real cactus farm. And if you go over here, I made a real pumpkin and melon farm. What is that copper? Yeah, yeah. That's a big hint as to what I've been... The reason I haven't been streaming the past month. That's a huge hint. This might be a little spoiler territory, but... um, I think we're pretty close to Max Garden. No, Spaceman V2 isn't even an inaccurate thing to say. It has been that much effort. I have done so much farming, so much farming. It's disgusting. As soon as I clear out my pests, I'll show you. Check Magma Lord armor. Why? Oh. They added a gauntlet? No. Is Has this... I don't remember if this was a thing or not. Provides immunity to nether magma. I think that's been a thing, but on an equipment piece is nice. It's the gemstone slots. Okay. I've never used magma lord, so I'm a bit of a, a dumb in that department. But yes, there's a new gemstone slot. I've never seen that symbol before. Oh, thank you for another $8 godly draw. Not even 10 million coins who I pour. Yeah, man. This is the first time on this profile... I've ever had an abundance of money. This has never happened. I feel so rich right now. I could just buy a second golden dragon and it wouldn't even hurt my damage. Like that's insane. 
So what's the update? Tell us, Mr. Virus. Well, first I gotta kill these pests. Which, by the way, this is Max. Oh, for the record, Fezzi, you're gonna have to skip what I'm about to say and what I just said. But the, the rest of it we can leave in. We could say that I've been in the garden a lot, but let's not spoil the whole video premise. Uh, oh, and Monkey Man, thank you for another two. The old bug, the ice cave you found, now real. Well, that was supposed to be the the mist in Dwarven Mines, but it looked so similar. Okay, the reason I used the thumbnail I did on YouTube is because someone else made a video about Glacite Tunnels and they stole my old thumbnail. <laughs> and I'm like, you know what? Good idea, random person on the internet. I will also use this thumbnail from four years ago because it looks, it looks relevant despite not being at all. Okay. Now I want you guys to see this. This this is crazy. Here's a jump scare for those of you that don't keep up with the videos. You ready for a jump scare? See that visitor count? Oh, it just it hurts. It actually hurts to look at. It hurts to show this. This is genuine pa pain. This song is awesome, by the way. One of the best songs Real Heroes ever made, and we never put it in a video. This is what the this is what the tribute to Skyblock video is gonna have in like a year and a half, two years. Okay, so there you go. That's the visitor count. Bestiaries maxed. You go into the Skyblock level up screen. We are at 94.3% crop milestones. And then composter. We only have like 50 XP to go. And most of the crops are already handled. Look at look at the taters, the nether warts. We're already done with melon block. All this cactus green is great. And the pumpkins. We actually are getting an abundance of stuff now. When I sell the access, I'm gonna guess another roughly 300 million to 500 million coins. So we might hit over two bill just from farming. But anyways, today is not about farming. Today's about mining. So let's get into mining, shall we? Let's talk about it. Let's see how this works. I should probably switch into mining gear. That would make sense. Let's get out our glistening stuff, which... You know what is funny? This is not the best anymore for Mining Fortune, but it's the best we have now. All right, let's buy... Oh, there's new dialogue. Hey, someone special has been asking to meet you. I'm not quite sure what he's doing back in the Dwarven Mines. It's been years since I last saw him. Anyways, yeah, yeah, I've already... Okay, when I say that I haven't played this on Alpha, I did play the start just to get in. But I did not actually perform any gameplay, so... I'm gonna I'm gonna speed run the start here because who cares? Here's the dude. I can't talk to Dublin. Oh, is it? Oh, is it broken? Is it broken? He seems like he's functioning to me. I could sneak you in, yes. Yeah, it works. We're chilling. We're chilling. I don't know why everyone else is having problems. By the way, I just, I hate, well, I don't hate, but I try not to point out viewership on streams because it tends to break it. 1,600 viewers on YouTube. Hell yeah. We are so back. How many people on Twitch? 500 on Twitch? Hello. Now we're going to get depressed when we look at the kick stream. I think I have to refresh it because it's not showing the actual view count on there. 22. Hey, just a reminder to the over 2,000 viewers on other platforms. If you don't like the ads, kick has none. So just saying. Doesn't benefit me at all. But if you hate the ads, you have a way out. Not an alpaca. Thank you for the two. Imagine starting Skyblock with 12. Skyblock and 12 with infinite free time. Oh, at 12, I think is what you meant. Yeah, yeah, that'd be stupid. That'd be crazy. Um, Anyways, 
How do I do this? Forge a railroad pass. Right. So, luckily for you guys, I care about, um... I care about the entertainment value of my streams and my content, so I already went and prepped everything required for this update except for the worm membranes. There it is. Look at that. We already have the materials right here for a secret pass. It wasn't even that bad, honestly. I mean, granted, I have a max mining setup minus the Devondro. It only took me like maybe five hours to actually get everything for the update. Okay. Hello, Forger. Let's get these refined diamonds back from last night. Boop. We are going to forge. Let's make a pass, shall we? Ooh, there's so many new items now. This is exciting. We haven't had this in years. <laughs> Whoa. Okay. That was that was a noise. I apologize. Where, where's secret pass? There it is. Only takes 30 seconds to forge. Good. Secret railroad pass. Nice. It requires one flawless ruby. Two refined mithril and eight corleonite. Yeah, let's go. We're going to make our last refined diamond. And I should probably start working on... I should probably start working on gold plates. Yeah, let's do that. All right, gold plate. Should I leave a slot open just in case? Yes. Actually, this is gonna, that one's already done, so I can leave the slot open. <clears throat> Secret railroad pass acquired. And now the rest of these materials we'll put back in our preparations chest. And we'll deal with that later. We have a secret pass. Let's go talk to the guy. Oh, by the way, if we're gonna be mining, probably should set my power stone to bizarre. <clears throat> we'll refraction them back, we'll see. Hey, here's a reminder. 30 virus will be around. I'm never gonna officially quit YouTube. If things get stressful, I'll just upload less. L mining, we want primal. I have a feeling that you're in the minority there. Primal dragons was a very not well thought out update balance wise. <clears throat> okay, secret railroad pass. Here we go. Well, I'll be. You've got a ticket after all. Let's make way. There's plenty to do. Thanks for true. Thanks for choosing Dwarven Railco. We operate 24/7 across the whole mine. Now, please climb aboard before your cart leaves without you. And this is as far as I got in the Alpha Network because. Right about here, it would not work. And this time it did. Here we go. Dwarven base camp. We just got five skyblock XP for the quest. Nice. Talk to... Okay, there's a bunch of people to talk to. Primal dragons are a good idea. I hope they don't abandon it. Respectfully disagree. But anyways, that's not why we're here. Um, This is exciting. Oh, the Panda XV. Thank you for that resub with the Prime. I'm going to be in content mode for a while, so your donos might go um, missed for a little bit. But I will get back to it, I swear to you. I will read them all. All right. Uh, and Dark Hosto, thank you for the T2 resub as well. The one time I can't play the update comes out, that's how it goes. All right. So what the hell is all this? Wait. <laughs> Wait, 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 wait. Are you telling me that's Dwarven Mines? Wait, is this Dwarven Mines from the other side? If that's the case, that's actually really funny. Is this a, how does this work? Is this a different instance? This doesn't look like a different instance. This looks like we're still, hi, <laughs> hello. <laughs> what is this? It's the other side of the wall, hold tab. 
Oh, Soupy's here. Hello, Soupy. It's the same lobby. Oh, interesting. Okay. Really weird. Okay. Who do I have to talk to? Who else do we talk to? I guess we just explore now. Scardius. I've still... My muscle memory is still, for some reason, locked in with farming. So I have to get used to not pressing left click to jump and vice versa. All right. Now we are fully in mining mode. Our mining fortune should be like 20 or 2000. Yes. What do you have to say? Scout or not? I never, I'm never leaving the safety of the campfire again. Okay. I've heard about this. Campfires have a, there's a cold mechanic, right? There's a cold mechanic and the campfire will keep, I, I, I have a feeling this isn't the same as the campfires you can place, but that'll keep you warm. Fossil research center. Okay. So this is where the new pets are, right? Ooh. So we can supply it with suspicious scrap. Hello, Dr. Stone. Here's one of the people we have to talk to. If you're so rich, upgrade scale them. Not quite. I have a plan for that. I've been able to set fossils up down here for a short while in research of rare fossils. I know the risks of doing so, but I love research. Cool story, bro. Very cool. If you ever find scrap, you can go to the excavator. Okay. That's fine. Um, where's the gameplay at? <laughs> I want to get to the juicy stuff. I want to get to the goods. I want to start breaking some glass. Oh, what's up with their monarch? What's this? Wait, how did I get a chisel? Oh, it just got given to me. I see. Fossil donation. Does it work with the legacy? Um, for example, ammo knight. Can I just give it an ammo knight? Like, would that work? I don't know how that works. Cause I have like an entire chest of helixes. It works. Oh, good. All right. Let's go back to the private island, grab a helix, and we're going to give it to the guy and see what happens. Let's get two. I have a feeling. All right. Uh, helix, helix. Yeah, I got a lot of helixes. All right. Now, how do I get back there? Would it be... I have to talk to the guy again until I get a travel scroll. So I have to go all the way over here. I'm sure there's another quicker way to access him. Yeah, I know there's a travel scroll. I just didn't see how much it cost. All right, we have two helixes. Let's give one to you. Now, how's this work? Do I just click it? Ooh, it's got 20,000 glacite powder. Nice. 5,000 Heart of the Mountain experience. Oh, that reminds me. Heart of the Mountain. It goes, peak of the mountain goes to 10. So it costs glacite powder? Whoa. It gives... Wait. It gives... It gives plus one pickaxe ability level? You're telling me that you don't need blue cheese anymore? Oh, sorry about the burps, dude. The soda. You don't need blue cheese anymore. You get a forge slot, a commission slot. Oh, that's nice for nucleus runs. Oh my God. One base mithril powder when mining mithril token of the mountain Two base gemstone powder when mining gemstones. Thanks. Hypixel could have used that earlier. Um, wow. Okay. So we need a million glacite powder. You already have that? Oh, am I dumb? 
Oh, I'm dumb. That's what I currently have. Oh. <laughs> wow. You can tell it's been a while since I've interacted with this menu, dude. It's been like over a year. All right. <clears throat> so let's ignore all that. So we get plus three base glacite powder when mining glacite. That's the upgrade. Okay. Let's get back down to earth here. That's what farming did to you? Bro, I think farming has done irreversible damage to my psyche. And I'm not even done with it yet. So what do I do with the fossil now that I've donated one? How's this work? So like, do I... Uh, fossil dust exchange? How do I do this? Start excavator, place your chisel and a suspicious scrap. Oh, so would this not work? So that wouldn't work. How does, how does the helix work then? Oh, you like the look of the helix? That's a very fossilized ammonite, still completely intact. Are you gonna tell me the entire story? Cause I really don't care. Speak to the girl. Who? <laughs> Where? But I already... I don't get it. <clears throat> it's not. 30, please. It's in the forge. I mean, I already have ammo night pets, so I really don't care. But I'm just curious how the system works, you know? I'm trying to I'm trying to learn, okay? I'm aware I already donated one, but I heard you need to donate one and then use the other for crafting. I just don't know how to actually do it. Go to forge and craft a pet. So just like pre-update then. Fred, why why does your phone suck? Okay. Let's see if anything's changed from... Oh, there's a mole pet. Look at that. Claw fossil, 300,000 coins. And there's ammo night. <clears throat> it requires a helix and 300 can. Okay, good to know. All right, we're done with that. Let's put that away. But yeah, we have a chisel now. Okay. So I guess that's the fossil system. We're gonna come back to this once we have more suspicious scrap. Who are you? Are you 30 virus? Yes. Nice to meet you. Sure. <laughs> are you about to head into the glacier tunnel? Yes. <laughs> Yo, Thunder, thank you for that prime sub. Jaden, thank you for the 100 bits. Real quick, just my opinion, they shouldn't have released Mining V3 before Mayors. It didn't make sense for them. They clearly had Mayors about ready and mining is missing like half of its features. Hey, I'm not complaining. I'm just happy that we have something. <laughs> like they shouldn't have released, they should have released Mayors today. Hey, you know what? We have video content. That is what matters at the end of the day. Try to watch your step. Right around here is that there's a lot of old glacite mine shafts hidden around this place. If you ever get too cold, you can always warm yourself up at the campfire. Okay. Glacite tunnels, new area discovered. Here we go. I get it. Yes, I get it. While you're in glacite tunnels, you will get cold. As you get colder, your mining speed will decrease by up to 50% and your speed cap will be lowered. Use certain items or heart of the mountain perks to keep warm for as long as possible. Collection unlocked glacite, I figured. Okay. I just got 300 from breaking two blocks. Are you serious? <laughs> Wait, I got three. Oh, coming soon. Yeah, this is where we get a lot of... Okay. Enchanted Glacite. Cold Resistance Potion. Just straight up Mining Fortune. Glacite Amalgamation. I remember hearing about this. This is required for the new kinds of plates, I believe. All right, you know what? Let's... Let's start this off. 
with a little bit of this. Okay, ow. Michael H, thank you for the five. Not me trying to skip forward to see the new content. <laughs> you can't do that on a live stream unless you are a time traveler. DTSS Spider-Man, thank you for the one. Oh, Diamond Goblin, hello, hello. Diamond Essence. Mineral Armor, does that work? I should have tested this. Does mineral work here? So far doesn't look like it. No, mineral does not work. Good to know. If you want to be truly efficient for Ruby, you need two six five fives. No, it's getting cold in here, but you've got to keep moving. <clears throat> so, all right. I'm guessing that's Amber. That's um, Jade. Yep. Where's the campfire? How, how does one get warm? I'm guessing the torches aren't going to do crap. They patched blue egg swap, so you need two drills of the same type now. Nah, bro, that, nah, that's not okay, bro. What happens when I upgraded Devon? Am I just screwed then? No, there's no way. No, they didn't. It's for a single ability, not mining speed boost. It still worked when I tested. Just put Blag on main drill. Well, hold on. Now I have to test it. Uh, okay. Let's check my mining speed. I think they... Yeah, that looks low. That looks low. I don't know, man. That's scary. Because you're cold? Oh, you might be right. I think it's because I'm cold. That's exactly what it is. Okay. Okay. Woo! Just got a skyblock level. Alright, so cold resistance potion. Nice. Look at the text in game. Rexu, you're not gonna be able to direct me around. I'm too fish brain. Do you understand how important this update is? I haven't uploaded in over a week and I had no content. I'm at maximum levels of fish brain curiosity, not being able to notice things mode. Okay, I think we need to get out of here. What's the maximum cold, 100? Mining speed's kind of dying a little bit here. Yeah, this is bad. Okay, how do we leave? Where to exit? Oh no, my navigation. My navigation, we're going deeper into the caves. This is bad. I don't know where I am. Chat, help me. It's a new gemstone. Aquamarine, I don't even know what that does. I think it's probably the sea creature chance one. Look at your heart of the mountain tree, by the way. Yeah, they added new levels, right? Yeah, this requires tier eight though. I, I really don't care about any of this until I hit tier eight. So are there, okay, I'm guessing there's commissions here, right? How do we get, how do we get back? I think we should look into the travel scroll because I am so lost. I'm so lost. 
How do I... How do I get... Remove efficient miner? Oh, true. You're right. I am lost. Your movement slows to a crawl as the cold threatens to take over. Time to get out of there. Yeah, how? How do I leave? Where is the exit? I don't know how to get out of there. Do I just have to warp? I guess I have to just warp. I don't know. Let's call Fred. Let's see the recipe for the um, travel scroll. There's no reception in here. Great. I guess I just have to leave. Because I just can't find it for the life of me, bro. Alright. Ooh. This mode is temporarily disabled. No! No, you didn't just do that. No! You did not, Skyblock! No! Stop. This is not how this... No, you didn't just do that to me, Skyblock. There's no freaking way. There's no way. No. You know what makes me really sad? This error message means that the second I leave Skyblock, it's probably locking me out of the entire mode. All right, well, I have to use the bathroom. I'll be back. Ooh. There are so many people saying egg in chat. Okay. Hello. Assuming I still can't warp. I can't. I had an idea. Let's call Fred from here. Because we have reception here. Let's see how much the travel scroll costs. Oh, it just requires an onyx. That's not bad. That's actually really easy. Once we can go back there, I'm sad. Bro, what are we supposed to do? They're gonna fix a bug and it might take a... Mm. Mine's gonna be disabled for like two hours. Well, it's a good thing I have a backup plan. Look at that. I'm <laughs> using big brain strats here. Oh, let's actually read some donuts. It's Gwistin, thank you for the prime. That's Druid, thank you for the Prime. Purple Dragon, <laughs> thank you for the Prime. No way, we're getting mine B3 before foraging. Anyways, hoping you stream a bit this month because my last Prime sub was wasted on someone else who proceeded not to stream for the month. Yeah, okay. So here's the official status on that. Actually, can I warp to other islands? I can. So it's just mining that's disabled right now. Um, Yeah, farming, blame farming. That's the reason I haven't done anything for the past like month, month and a half is because I've been so hyper focused on maxing this stupid part of the game. That's the entire reason. It doesn't even, it's not even that deep. I literally just saw the task of farming and was like, I must annihilate this. And I just threw aside everything else. Ah, it's so annoying, bro. But yeah, once this is over, expect a lot more streams from me. And we're like less than a week away. Niljin, thank you for the T1 sub five minutes ago. It's Chia Pet. Thank you for the, the Prime sub as well. Love your work, Dota. You've really helped me out from a dark place. You guys have helped me out of a dark place and continue to do that. Um, did I miss any? 
Did I miss any super chats? Let's see. The Ridge. I think I already thanked you. Oh, no, I didn't. Thank you for the T1. Surge Aqua. Thank you for the Prime. Holy crap. You guys are so many donuts. Michael H. Thank you for the five. Not me trying to skip forward. To, oh, I already read that one. Okay, so I think we're caught up. Toronto with Prime. The Booter. Thank you for the T1. If I skipped it, if I skipped your message, I am so sorry. But I think we are caught up. Merc 115. Backward pen. <laughs> XX Smoke Dragon XX. Hennes G. Otin. All of these people have given me Prime subs or T1 subs, so thank you all for that. All right, we're caught up. So what do we do while we wait? That's not what I meant to... <laughs> so nothing. Okay, so here's our backup plan. We're gonna do the tier list. Just let me know once things open up again. All right, chat, you, you ready for a really weird and jarring transition into a live YouTube video recording? Cause that's what's about to happen. I'm still curious about the kick stream. How many people are there now? 25. <laughs> I love the fact that I'm streaming to YouTube to nearly 1,800 people and kick has 25. <laughs> All right, guys, you ready to share your opinions on armors and iPixel Skyblock? <clears throat> oh, what's up, Ezzy? All right. Let's do this. Let's do, let's make the content, shall we? <clears throat> Uh, I need to pull up the tier list. I need to turn on the color source. Ah. Then we just have to... Here we are, chat. This is a familiar place. Now, hold on. If I turn... Wait. I'm confused. Shouldn't color source be... You guys don't see what I... <laughs> you didn't see that. Um, I'm trying to remember... I have to set up the actual appearance of the... Hold on. If I do that... I don't remember how I did this last time. How did I do this last time? Does anyone remember how I did this last time? With the tier lists? Did I do this? Maybe. That was such a late notif. Yeah. Here, hold on. Let's set up our stuff correctly. I don't know what's going on, to be honest. Okay. Um, let's put that above that. And then we, uh, there we go. That's better. Ah, we're getting somewhere. Okay. Now the problem is I have to do this, but if I do that, then it screws with the tier list. I guess we're just going to have to do it like this, which looks really jank. I don't remember how I did this last time. All right, well, this will have to do, I guess. Okay. You guys ready? Crop out the tab bar. Yeah, I don't remember how to do that. Ah. God, I'm such a boomer. Oh, that's not bad. So then if I do this, ooh. That'll do. And then I can move the ugly part off screen. No. We're going to have to keep the ugly part on screen. That'll have to do. No, if I full screen it, it's not going to be centered anymore, which is bad. Top right, click the three lines and hide tab list. Hide tab. No. Doesn't matter. 
I think we could just leave it as is. This will this will do, right? <laughs> this will do. I think. Control plus you can zoom in, I guess. No, that's fine. Okay. Let's um. Oh, maybe I could just do a Chrome capture. That would be so much easier. Hold on. I think that's what I did actually. Now that I really think about it, I think it was me recording Google Chrome or not Chrome, but Opera GX in this case. Wait, if I turn that on, nothing happens. Okay, we're just gonna leave it at is as is. It'll look a bit jank, but it's fine. Okay, you guys ready? I'm gonna record the intro now. We're recording a YouTube video live, so I will be in content mode. So I apologize if I miss your no no for a little bit. Okay. Here we go. Time to say hello to YouTube. All right. Hey guys, I'm back for another video and welcome to High Pixel Skyblock. And today I'm finally here nearly a year later after making it. It is time to make the long awaited, long requested Hypixel Skyblock Armor Tier List. I am live currently, as you can see over here. If you want to stop by my streams, I'm on YouTube, Twitch, and Kick. So any of those three platforms at 30 Virus, you could join. Also, this goes without saying, but if you are going to purchase something in the Hypixel store, use code 30 Virus. It gives you a discount, gives me a kickback. Everybody wins. So. It is time to rank every single armor set in Hypixel Skyblock from F tier all the way up to S plus. And the way this is going to work is that I am ranking these armors not just on, oh, is it the best in the game? No. How useful is this armor at the stage of the game that you get it? Is it something where it's going to be a huge push for progression? Is it something that's going to help you even if it's not the best? And I'm also including not just armor sets, but helmets as well, uh, boots in some cases, anything armor that's interesting. So here we are. Welcome to my beautiful uh, tier list here that was made with the assistance of AI. That's what the little text is here. Same case as last time. If you missed the weapons tier list, I'll put that in the card once this becomes a video because that one was sick. All right, it is time. So where do we start, chat? Where do we start? Oh man, what's the first armor we're gonna pick in the tier list? We're gonna have to get through this, dude. There's so many. I mean, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, times one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, basically 13 times 12. So like 144, one, it's almost 160 pieces of armor here. So. I think it is time to start with, let's start with the heads. There's a lot of them. <laughs> okay, chicken head. This is only useful for Bingo and or Iron Man. And even then, it's pretty easy to just kill enough chickens for one minion, put that minion over a hopper, and then just collect eggs that way. So I'll give it a D tier out of respect for how it used to be, but at the current moment, there isn't really much of a purpose for it. I might even put it at F, actually. Let's put it at F. Let's, let's, yeah. All right. I think it goes without saying the rest of these. I don't even know what they do, but they're irrelevant. Clownfish, F. Creeperhead, F. Uh, Blaze hat, F. <laughs> Where's some other hats? Ghast head, F. <laughs> Cowhead used to be useful because of Arachne with the poison resistance. I, I'd give it a D because the poison really doesn't matter anymore, but it's kind of helpful. Arachne is just not a grind that really matters. So Cowhead slightly better than the rest, but it's all right. All right, are there any other heads? Oh, Fish Hat. This is how you open the UI for the Viking. And just for that reason, I'll give it a D tier, but no more. Blobfish gives like health regen, right? Or is that ghast head? I don't remember what Blobfish does. 
Unless anyone argues that's also going F tier. But blobfish in S tier. Fun fact, in real life, blobfish don't look like a blob until you take them out of their natural environment. Otherwise, they just look like a fish. All right. Uh, salmon hat. This is a memento to the old days of Skyblock. You can't obtain it anymore. Um, for the century event, they gave these out. But as of now, still no purpose. It's the only helmet I know of with Aqua Affinity on it. It's cool. It's a memento item, but it's still not useful for progression. Same with Magma Cube Head. I'm not even same. That has no significance. I'll put Salmon Hat to the top of F just because it's interesting. Magma Cube Head, no. All right, any other heads here? I think we're good. Oh, Zombie Head. Again, completely useless. All left here. This is off to a great start. Salmon above chicken is... Okay, 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 fine. You know what? I'll upgrade chicken to D. D tier. There, fine. We're keeping it like that. That's the start of the tier list. All the, the heads. <laughs> A rabbit, right? There is rabbit hat. Okay, this one actually has a purpose. Rabbit hat is used for jumping in places you're not supposed to. For example, trap room in dungeons. So, for that? I'd give it a B. Oh, it's useless because pearls now? Okay. Down to D tier it goes. <laughs> Damn. That is unfortunate. Well, it used to be. Used to be useful. Okay. Uh, for some reason, Precursor Eye caught my eye. Haha. -ha. Um, from what I'm aware of, this is used for DPS on Kudra. It's also used for stealing kills with... Um, rain Slimes. It's really annoying to face. But I will acknowledge that it is a useful item. I'm not sure if I would give it anything better than an A. It's good. Everybody should definitely get one. But not the greatest value. I've yet to get one and my profile is pretty dang strong. So we'll leave it at A. Maybe even B. Chat wants B. I kind of agree. Okay. I missed one of the heads, by the way. The hats. Dude, how did I forget about Slime Hat? Oh my god, dude. Slime hat. <laughs> this is one of the most troubled histories of an item in the history of Skyblock, dude. Every time they tried to fix the slime hat glitch, it caused some game-breaking bug. Anyone remember the Pigical dupe? Does anyone remember that one time when you could put any block on your head, including backpacks and anvils to make it look like you have a mohawk? They tried fixing... For those that don't know, the slime hat has an ability that negates all knockback. And there was a, there's a series of bugs that allow you, that used to allow you to basically equip the slime hat, switch to some other helmet, and then you regain the knockback resistance, which obviously, I think they finally killed it recently, like in the past six months. So as of now, there might be some utility but in very niche circumstances because we do have um we do have shelmet so i think we're gonna give it a d right i mean eh, it's very niche maybe a c Th there might be scenarios where you can use it I, I, I feel a little anxious about C, but whatever. We'll leave it. We'll leave it. Okay. Next. Oh my goodness. You guys are donating like crazy. Pregus Monster. They give it the prime. Yo, what's up, Best Centennial? I, I, I acknowledge I'm saying your name wrong and I always have, but at this point it's tradition. Thank you for the T1 for 16 months. Hello, big boy. <laughs> yeah, let's just forget that ever happened. That uh, thing. It's... Jojo Dog, thank you for joining on YouTube. A eh? three zero Payet Payetki. 
Thank you for the prime. <laughs> Lemur Memer. <laughs> Thank you for the two. That's a that is a goaded name. Thank you for the two hundred bits. Milky Money. Okay. <laughs> Thank you for the prime. Mr. Cocas. <laughs> <laughs> These names, dude. Thank you for another prime. Max1315, Chief Gabriel, Looter, V3R Fix, Grogu2526, Reese Waffle X. Bro, so many primes. Thank you, everybody. Jeez. All right. Back to the tier list. Do we start attacking some actual armor sets? We've been mostly going for helmets. Let's 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 do some armor sets. <laughs> Uh, okay. Oh, dude. I mean, all right. Armor of Devon. I don't even have to consult with chat on this one. Like, really? It just is the best armor in the game for mining. And it's not even that expensive. The chambers suck, though. Getting chambers is terrible. But I will acknowledge best mining armor in the game. I've made billions of coins with this armor set. It only makes sense. And it also makes me kind of want to find mineral armor. Here it is. Luckily, everything's alphabetically sorted, it looks like. Mineral armor, this might be a hot take, but also S tier. I think mineral armor also deserves S. S plus. S plus. Here's why. Mineral armor, stupid cheap. You can get it pretty much immediately. Like it's It costs nothing. You can use it for one of the best multitasking grinds in the game, and that's Mine of Devon Gold. So Mine of Devon Gold is great because it gets money, 20 million coins an hour. It also gets you to the you know, gold collection for Golden Dragon. I'm going for a bill right now, we're halfway. And it's useful for spawning Jerry's during Jerry Festival. It's useful for getting a lot of ores quickly. It's just a goaded armor, armor, armor set. Honk, thank you for joining. Spiky, Puggle Wuggle. What are these names? <laughs> and Lemur Memer with another 200 bits saying 30 to go. Thank you, thank you. Another 100 bits from Starblades95. Slime Hat deserves S plus tier just for the amount of times it broke the game in our advantage. I think C tier is more than enough. <laughs> All right. But yes, that might be a hot take. I think Mineral... I still think S plus, dude. It's a permanent addition to my wardrobe. It just It's just a goaded armor set. And I think they should... Personally, I think they should make it also work on Red Sand, Mycelium, and Flint. But that's just me. Maybe even Sand too like excavation blocks. I think this should be the excavation armor set. I think that's what that category of blocks should be called. So there you go. Next. Ooh, crystal armor. This is a really good one. This is an interesting one. So crystal, in my opinion, is baby's first mage armor. Actually, this is perfect. Dark goggles is right next to it. This right here, three-fourths crystal with dark goggles, is how you start mage, and I'm going to group them together. You're not going to use it for long. When paired with a Dreadlord Sword, this will get you through dungeons decently well, up to like maybe floor three. And it's pretty decent when paired with, for example, Voodoo Doll, Aurora Staff. Like this will... You could probably kill Crimson Isle mobs. You'll struggle, but you can. So honestly, for how cheap it is versus how good the return is, it's useless because of Dragon Shorpo now. I disagree. I still think Aurora Staff would do better. I think this deserves a solid A. The both of these. I think this is a really good progression skip. And I still to this day think Mage is a really good way to start the game. Although Shorpos are nice, definitely. Crystal B... I think I'm going to keep it at A. Uh, this is my tier list after all. This isn't chat's tier list, although I will still listen to your opinions. But at the end of the day, it is my choice. Oh, Magma Fish Hat. Whoops. Missed that one. F. <laughs> um, okay. What else do we have? Glacide Armor. Um. 
Hmm. Glacite, Glacite, Glacite. It's your first mining set. It gives like what, 50 mining speed per piece or something like that. I don't remember. Um, this is what you're going to use up until Yogg. But it's kind of annoying to use. It's really annoying to drop all the pieces. I get flashbacks to how long it took to get one stupid Glacite helmet. And now that bow swapping is dead. Ugh. Ugh. I don't tend to like this one as much as I like Crystal. Ah. Uh. I think I'll give it a C, B, C, somewhere in here. Mm. Okay, B. Uh, I kind of want to give it a C. Let's give it a C. Uh, yes, yes. Let's give it a C because it's no longer the go-to early game, just armor to use in general because of there's other... Yeah, let's give it a C. Annoying. Uh, Emerald armor. F tier. <laughs> I mean, it's it used to be the best armor in the game like a long, long time ago, like before the end update, but now it's not. Nothing else to say about that. Uh, Crown of Greed. This used to be the best damage helmet in the game, technically, but it costs coins to hit mobs. And it's, uh, I don't know. It's just not good. I don't think I want to, you know pay 300,000 coins per hit to kill a mob. If there was an F minus tier, Crown of Greed would go in F minus. Oh, by the way, some of the textures were not in first guy, so creeper pants is cactus pants. Don't worry about it. Uh, <laughs> let's see. Kalhuiki mask. That's another one I missed from the massacre. F. You missed hats? Yeah. We're just going to slowly find them over the course of the tier list. Enderman Mask, it's, it gives you negative intelligence. And I, I've yet to see anyone use it. I think it makes it so Endermen don't attack you, which is completely useless. So, uh, F. Okay. This one's slightly interesting. Fallen Star Hat. This is given to you when you find a secret spot in Dwarven Mines. And I believe it's like... Once every seven skyblock days in the morning hours, they have a ritual that gives you basically free beacon fuel. For those that have like notifications set up and just go and do it, it's pretty good. It'll save you like maybe 10 minutes of grinding treasure hunters. It's not as big a deal as people make it out to be. So I'd probably give it like a C. It's, it's inoffensive, but I always forget to use it. I, I'd say it's C. It's not bad, but I don't think it's up to precursor eye levels of usefulness. Uh, let's see. Cactus armor. I mean, this is completely useless. I remember when Time Dio used cactus armor to AFK gas back when that was a thing three years ago. F. There's going to be a lot of F tier armors, by the way. Just letting you know now. Armor of growth. It's like the precursor to Mastiff, and you're never going to use it until it's Mastiff, so F. Speaking of Mastiff, now we can get somewhere. Okay, let's, let's, let's consider Mastiff. It is a really good um, survivability armor set. It's great. For, it's pretty much required for fire trial. Pretty much required for killing ghosts before you get any decent damage. When paired with Shaman slash Pooch Sword, you actually can do really good damage if you have high magic power and you use um, the crit damage one. I honestly really like Mastiff Armor. I used it in my first few runs of Kudra as well, and I still every now and again find a purpose to pull it out again. So you know what? I mean, Mastiff? This is making me question my Crystal Armor placement a little bit. This is making me question, okay. I kind of want to move things. Okay. Mastiff gets A. Precursor gets A. Crystal Armor and Dark Goggles get B. I think that's better. I think that makes a bit more sense. Yeah, let's do that. 
that makes a lot more sense in my head. All right. Let's see. Mithril Coat. Okay. Mithril Coat is an item that basically maxes out your damage that you take. So if you get hit with a billion damage, infinite integer limit damage, it'll max out at 40% of your max health, which is good if you tend to get one shot, which only really happens in a few cases. For example, let's say you're killing an Enderman Slayer and he throws a beacon behind a wall. It's either Wither Cloak Sword or Mithril Coat or you die. Um, <laughs> for example, Kudra. When the, the fleet of ghasts come and then they just keep on exploding and murdering you. This is useful for that. I used to use it for Blaze Slayer T3s and up, but honestly, Sorrow Chest Plate's just better. Focus on true defense and vitality. This item's definitely fallen off, in my opinion, from where it used to be. I would have given it an A easily, but now it's kind of niche. I'd give it a B, I would say. I'd say that's a fair... What was that? New, new playlist, by the way. The songs have some random sound bites in them. Um, okay. Goblin armor. This one was kind of disappointing, honestly. It's a cool concept. It's It gives you mining fortune per speed or something like that? No. No, it doesn't. How does goblin work again? It's interesting. I don't, what was it? What was the ability? Reduces, oh, it's intelligence for mining speed. Okay, yeah, this is a cool concept, but unfortunately it's not balanced at all and it just sucks. So like, it gives you mining speed per intelligence, which I think is kind of neat. I kind of wish that there was like a niche scenario where you could like have, for example, maxed intelligence, and then somehow this would be the best for a very specific grind. But at the moment, if there was a block that regardless of your mining fortune dropped one of whatever its yield is all, every single time, then if goblin armor was to get updated to give more speed, then maybe it would have a purpose. But for right now, F. Unfortunate, it's a cool mechanic, but I can't I can't give it any credit. Uh okay. Golem armor. F. Aurora. Oh. That one caught my eye. It's just better storm. It has attributes. Super expensive. But I don't think any of that matters. It's the best mage armor in the game. So I think out of obligation, S plus better than these two in my opinion because damage is king i have to use the bathroom again i took so much caffeine I'm back. Okay. Hello. Hello, chat. I'm back. Burning Hot Potato, thank you for the gifted uh, member on YouTube. Grinishal, welcome back. Thank you for the T1. Sorry I'm being very slow to react to these. Okay. You can use Goblin Armor to make it so Wither Cloak costs 10 mana and then use Soul Flow to keep it up indefinitely in F5 as tank. Didn't they patch that when they made it so Wither Cloak maxes out at 10 uses or something like that? Correct me if I'm wrong. I, I might be able to give a little bit more credit to Goblin Armor. Probably not. Let's be honest. I don't think that's a thing anymore. As far as I know. Um, okay. Krampus Helmet. This one's been staring at me for a few minutes. 
It's a rare drop from gifts, and it's a pyramid scheme. <laughs> it's a... I, I don't know what else to tell you. It's a, it's a pyramid scheme. Krampus Helmet's a minion upgrade that lets, it, lets you drop red gifts. And you can basically buy it for money, put it in a minion, and then use it to generate red gifts. And then make more money. You only make money if you're in the system. Um, the problem is I've gotten one and I've had it running in a minion for like two weeks now and I haven't gotten a single red gift. Is there something, am I doing something wrong? <laughs> it's just straight up not working. Uh, it's a museum slot. It gives you a little bit of skyblock XP, but like really it's not going to do anything. I'll give it like a, I'll give it a D tier. I'd give it a D tier. It's not a great item. It, I was very glad to drop it, but I'm not using it at all. Maybe if it actually gave red gifts, like a good amount of red gifts, I'd give it a better rating, but it's... it. it I've yet to even get a single red gift from it. So we'll, we'll keep it a D just for the potential they fix it, but eh, whatever. Addy Lifts, thank you for, uh, thank you for becoming a member. Hey, thank you for joining. Okay. Enchanted Jack-O-Lantern. This is the, uh, this is the, the, this is the cousin of Farmer Boots that can't get a job. <laughs> so Farmer Boots give you farming fortune per was a farming level. I believe Enchanted Jack-O-Lantern does the same, but also gives you fortune on like pumpkins or something. It's just not good. Fermento Helmet's better. Um, I guess if you're cheap, they're, it was good for like two weeks. Yeah, so like it was barely, I, I'll give it a D maybe for the off chance you can't afford crappie, but like, come on, come on now. <laughs> <laughs> like, realistically, who's going to use that? I'll give it a D tier out of respect, if anything, for the mechanic. I, I'm a I'm a big fan of interesting mechanics in video games. I, I just can't help but appreciate when something is kind of cool and the dynamic is cool. It's just too bad the balancing doesn't match up with that. Okay. Since we are talking about farming stuff, I'm trying to see if I can find rancher boots in the list here. Am I dumb? Where's Rancher Boots? Oh, it has the same... Okay. Well, similar. Okay. So, Farmer Boots and Rancher Boots. I think this should be an S plus as well. I'll give Farmer Boots an S. And I'll give Rancher Boots an S plus. There you go. If I can freaking find it. There it is. The reason being, it gives you, like I said before, a farming fortune per farming level, and it lets you precisely set your speed, which is really useful for farming. I've been doing it for a thousand hours and I'm about to max garden. So trust me, rancher boots are good. Man, people don't like farmer boots though. Do people still remember when I was selling them for 400k and thinking that that was normal and I wasn't accidentally market manipulating back in like 2019? I remember that. Uh, all right, fine. We'll put it down. Uh, let's get Farmer Boots an A then. My first ever controversy was me crafting Farmer Boots and selling them on the AH and I didn't get the concept yet of contraband. <laughs> so, hey, so people were paying more just because it was me selling them. Uh, oh, Skeleton Skull, um, F. It's another head that I missed. Okay. Oh, pumpkin armor. This is another similar to rancher boots in um, appearance. Completely useless in concept as far as I remember. F. Ooh. Let's talk about... Okay. I want to talk about blaze and frozen blaze. I just have to find Frozen Blaze. There it is. Frozen Blaze is right here. Blaze armor for a long time was 
debated in the community. It was like, is it Superior that's better or is it Blaze? And I think over time, it turned out that Power Creep would just keep on chugging. But Blaze Armor worked off of a percentage, which meant that it kept catching up to the meta, especially Frozen Blaze. Like somehow it's still relevant all this time later without any significant buffs as far as I know. Um, even then, you're still probably going to want to use Crimson Necron. It's whatever. I think Frozen Blaze is the best armor for Stranded. But the reason I like it so much is because of Frozen Blaze fishing. And you can do it with regular Blaze armor too. And it's just the best way to fish in the game. You get tons of bestiary. You get tons of items and drops. Tons of fishing XP. It's just, it's great. I love Blaze armor, dude. I think I'd give Blaze armor an, an S, yes. Because anything that ends the grind of fishing faster is a plus in my book. Same for Frozen Blaze. We're giving them both S. I feel pretty solid about that. Arachne armor. Honestly, its only function is to give you spider essence, but for that purpose, it's quite good. If you're spamming arachnes, then you might as well keep salvaging them. I would never wear it though. <laughs> so I'd give it a D. <laughs> it's probably in this category. Oh, right next to cowhead, perfect. Nice. Let's uh, pour myself a drink here. Uh, no, my coaster. <laughs> my coaster keeps on sticking to the bottom of the the, the glass. Eh, there it is. My coaster. Okay. Ooh, this one's gonna get people talking. Crystallized Heart. I have some opinions on this item. I think it is massively overrated for Enderman Slayer. Massively overrated. People used to think, and perhaps still do think, that this is just the way to break into Enderman Slayer. Maybe... But like Final Destination with good kill counts is so much better. <laughs> it's... Uh... Chat wants to give it a good rating, but I just don't think so, dude. I'm thinking about it. It's like, oh, for those that don't know, Crystallized Heart, it doubles your healing, right? That's what it does. People aren't killing 800 T1s. True. Does it double your healing or is that Reaper Mask? I don't remember the reason. I think I'll give it a C. I'm tempted. It's like low B, high C. It's not the worst, but like you're not going to use it. It does double it. Okay. They all give double healing. So that includes Zombie Heart, which to be honest, this is just a crafting ingredient. I wouldn't genuinely use the zombie heart as like a piece of armor, but if you do, it's something. So let's give it a D, I guess. And then uh, revived heart. You're not gonna be using it for Enderman Slayer because crystallized heart is so much cheaper. By the time you can afford a revived heart, you're not gonna use it. It doesn't double, it gives 100 mending and vitality. That's effectively double though. Uh, yeah, I mm, I think Revived Heart also D. Like Crystallized Heart is above Revived Heart, which seems a bit goofy, but it's only because of when you get it in the game. By the time you get a Revived Heart, you're not gonna use it. Like you'll use it to craft stuff, but you're not gonna actually like use it as a helmet. So there you go. That might be disappointing to some people, but I don't think it's that good. Sorry. Ooh, Ender Armor. I'm a bit of a simp for this armor set. I'm not going to lie. It's the go-to armor for starting the game, first of all. This is your first armor set if you're on bingo nowadays. Maybe second armor set. 
it doubles all your stats on the end island and since you get it so early in the end island it's a really solid progression i wouldn't say skip but like it progresses you pretty quickly and this is including the equipment too so like the eight piece set it increases the damage of void sword which is just if anyone remembers the weapon tier list void sword absolutely annihilated like 30 percent of the entire tier list and you're gonna be using this for a good bit like it's a solid like this is every single skyblock player at some point is gonna want ender armor does it get an s plus for that no it gets an s i think it's a really goaded armor set you're not gonna use it anymore once you're done with it which for that reason i think i'm gonna demote it to a that's it's that's it's solid yeah okay we'll give it an a let's not get too ahead of ourselves but it is a really good armor set and technically it is the best armor set in the game for mining obby technically technically because of the doubling stats on the end island thing if you were to put jaded on it and recom it i'd be stupid but you technically can uh, a we'll give it an a someone in chat said final destination and i tend to agree this one's easy for me i don't really have to think too hard on this one it's just the go-to armor set for blaze or not blaze for enderman slayer you can build up 200k kills on it and i kind of like the mechanic of it it has the same energy as like booting up pokemon and then just grinding out like the first route for like 10 hours and then just steamrolling through all the gyms after the fact that's how i feel about final destination you can just keep building and building and building kills on it and then when you finally actually take on the boss you don't take that much damage so i do quite like it but i don't think that earns the s plus i think it's a solid s only because once you get e-man 9 you're never using it again yeah i'd even say lower than these two yeah armor of the rising sun as cool as this is for me and like half a dozen other people during an event that ended two and a half years ago f sorry technoblade uh farm armor farm suit both completely useless maybe you'll craft it and then use it for like three seconds before you get crappie armor it's just bad i don't okay you know what whichever one gives farming fortune i'll give a d and the other one i'll give an f which one's which both give farming fortune oh which one do people actually use then both give fortune people actually make farm suit okay so that one's gonna get a d then farm armor gets an f farm armor is better farm suit then melon is strong <laughs> Oh, is farm armor the one that's like too expensive to be worth it when you could just make melon armor? That's probably the case. <clears throat> farm armor. Okay, yeah, yeah, that's the case. All right, good. Good thing we have an understanding. All right. I think it's time for a massacre. I'm looking at so many armor sets that are completely useless. Like, it's bad. Adaptive armor. Do people use this at all? No, you could just dungeonize dragon armor. F. Uh, armor of the pack. You can bring the pants into Rift and use that for progression, but that's not going to score any points in my book. F. Bouncy armor. It's only used as museum, and up until recently, it was really, really, really freaking annoying to drop. And even now, it's not as bad but still no f <laughs> no use in the game great spook armor it's event armor i'm pretty sure i didn't even use it during the event um bad d sharp no f <laughs> no metal chest plate you can buy it from um i don't even remember what her name is i don't know metal chest plate Actually, let's skip that one. That one might actually be useful. Uh, let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. Leaflet armor. It's only used as museum. 
uh, mushroom armor. This used to be the go-to first armor set in the game because it would triple its stats at night. And if you were to give it Grow 5 Prop 5 with uh, Titanic Reforge, not bad for starting Fire Trial. And it's decent for survivability. You're not going to use it once you get Ender Armor. D. Pufferfish Hat. I remember this one. Anyone remember that chicken farm I had back in the day where, because of the Pufferfish Hat, um, you cast a fishing rod down into a little pool of water currents going to the middle with a bunch of chicken minions, and then the chickens would reach the middle, hit the bobber, and because of the Pufferfish Hat's ability, which is basically thorns, it just insta-kills them. And you could do that forever, but then the admins patched it and made it so that you can't cast a fishing rod for more than, like, two minutes at a time. So, unfortunately, F. That was one of the coolest farms I'd ever used. Skeleton... Nope. Let's skip that one. Actually, no. Skeleton Grunt Armor. F. I don't care what people say. It's Grunt Armor. It's not that good. F. Uh, It's just a museum slot. A lot of these are. People put Pesterminator on Mushroom for Bestiary. As someone who literally maxed out the Bestiary after already being three-fourths of the way through Max and Garden and never using sprays, not even one time, you don't need to go specifically for pests, okay? If you plan on at least getting to, like, the 5,000 visitor mark, which maxes out the fortune bonus with Green Thumb, um, you'll more than compensate for the beast here. You really don't need to do that. But, fine. Mushroom armor, just for the pest terminator thing. That's novel, it's cool, it's interesting. Let's give it a high C. Not as good as Crystallized Heart, though. Moving on. Minor Outfit. Permanent Haste 2. Which is... Useless. I used to use this for some very niche purposes. Like grinding out the cobble generator at the very start of the game to sell rock pets. I'll give it a D out of respect for that. But even then, it's probably not as no, 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 super comps? What? What do you mean by super comps? Silverfish is free? Well, that's why I'm not ranking minor armor very high. Oh, super compactors. Oh, yeah, no. It's still... It's just gonna... Just get a silverfish pet, man. No, even then. Like, it's really... You're not gonna use it for long mineral armor. It's just kind of better... You can get haste potions. It's not that hard. You can literally just make it. Uh, all right. Let's see. Let's see. Squire armor. Not worth it unless you're on stranded because ender armor. Goodbye. Starlight armor. Just get three fourths crystal and dark goggles. Bye. Uh, salmon armor. It's a fishing armor set, right? I would still use Angler for a, a good bit. Wait, didn't they update? They updated Salmon Armor at some point. Maybe it's not trash. A C or a B? I'm okay. I'm not ranking that one yet. We'll get to that later. Rosetta Armor, same as the other two. Bye. Shadow Goggles. I feel like Shadow Goggles is probably going to be right next to Dark Goggles. It's just the required progression. I, I don't know. It, it's nothing really groundbreaking. It's just more damage than Dark Goggles. So, sure. I guess that deserves to be in that case. But that makes me wonder about Wither Goggles. I have to give this one a high ranking. Just like Aurora. Just like a lot of helmets in this game. It's just overpowered. Uh, Wither Goggles is just goaded. It gives you so much ability damage that it's just an obvious S plus. It's one of it's the best mage helmet in the game. It's better than Aurora helmet, which means technically it should be better than Aurora armor. There you go. Wither Goggles is currently the top armor set in the tier list. Armor piece in the tier list. Let's go. 
All right, next. Speed through armor. Completely outclassed by Young Dragon. F. Skeletor armor. It's just a museum piece. Bye. Skeleton soldier. Hot take. Some people like it. I don't. F. <laughs> All right. Now let's take this seriously. Skeleton master. Now we're getting somewhere. So skeleton master as an armor set, wouldn't recommend. The chest plate though. The chest plate has an ability that makes it so that you do not need to refill your arrows, including specialty arrows apparently. So like armor shred or like bouncy arrows. Correct me if I'm wrong, but the ability makes it so you have infinite of whatever type of arrow you want, which is effectively for lazy people like me, just straight up a damage boost. <laughs> um, even if you don't consider that with flint arrows only, it does like 5% less damage than like Necron when maxed out, but it gives you like infinite ammo. And I have a feeling me personally, I'm going to be using a 50, oh, specifically 50 out of 50 M7 Skeleton Master chest plate. Specifically. All right. I would not recommend using Skeleton Master unless you have a really, really high gear score and floor chest plate specifically. And for that reason, I think it deserves an A. It's really just QOL, technically. But I really like it. And for fish brains like me that otherwise would just not use specialized arrows, I think that's a solid A. Since we're rating the set. No, the set's F. Uh, we're not rating the set. It's just the chest plate that matters. Okay. I should probably catch up on uh, Donos. Uh, Rulo, welcome back. Thank you for the T1. Lord Crab Pat. <laughs> Thank you for the T1 for nine months. Kiri underscore Val. Thank you for the prime. Oh, and that's it. That's all we have to catch up on. Nice. Okay. Berserker armor. It's expensive. Its ability doesn't matter. And it's just a museum slot. So F. It uses enchanted red sand cubes. Isn't there also another equivalent set for mycelium that I'm not thinking of? It's in here somewhere. I don't remember what it is called. Simmering light. Thank you, chat. Uh, where is the S's? Or shimmering light, right? Or is it simmering or shimmering? I can't find it. Where is it? Is it not here? Or am I blind? I think I might... I think it's not here. Well, you know what? I guess that is going to be an honorary F tier. <laughs> I guess it wasn't in first guy when I made this. Interesting. Uh, okay. Moving on. Spider hat uh, F. I think we missed that one in the first um, massacre. Ooh, here's an interesting one. Sorrow armor. Sorrow is interesting. I quite like this armor set. It gives decent mining fortune and speed, although I just recommend Yogg for that, to be honest, and then just go straight to Devon. But if you are progressing a bit slowly, maybe you don't play that much and you just need an armor set that's like pretty decent for mining specifically, it's not bad, but that's not why we're talking about it. We know why we're talking about it. It's for true defense, for the chest plate with Blaze Slayer, and you're gonna be using that. Oh, it's also the best set in the game for Magic Find, unless you have, um, Technically, Magma Lord with good attributes, but we don't talk about that. <clears throat> yeah, Sorrow's got true defense. It's got magic find. It's, um, yeah, so this is a great, this is a great entry to the list here. Sorrow chest plate's basically going to be go-to for Blaze Slayer until you get, like, God Roll chest plate, like, magic find 10, um, vitality. Or no, it'd probably be magic find veteran, right? And up until that point it would be veteran vitality obviously but yeah, i i like it i like sorrow i don't think it's quite an s plus but i'll give it an s 
it's good. You're going to switch to it and use a Daedalus Axe with a Golden Dragon pet with all enrichments on Magic Find, Beacon set to Magic Find, eating the cakes, um, using... What's that ultimate enchant that I can't think of right now? Legion. It's good for Magic Find. So, yeah, I'll give it an S. Creeper Pants. F. <laughs> Lapis armor. It's a museum entry only. F. Don't go for don't go for lapis. Doesn't it's not worth your time. Rotten armor. It's another one of the useless dungeon sets. Uh Skeleton Lord. Not worth your time. We're starting to get to a lot of the good stuff. Most of the crappy ones have been filtered out. Zombie commander armor, also just museum. Zombie knight armor? Okay. Zombie knight chest plate, 50 out of 50, isn't the worst. Then again, just get a shadow assassin chest plate at this point. They're not that pricey. I would give this a D. Just out of respect for the shadow assassin nons. <laughs> Three fourth shadow assassin with zombie knight chest play fifty out of fifty. It is what it is. We'll give that a D. I know the servers are back up. We're gonna try and finish the tier list before. Oh my god, it's been almost two hours since stream started. <laughs> then again, it's probably been like forty minutes since the stream or since this started. Okay, frame flame breaker armor made with hard stone, right? Oh wait, is it heat armor flame breaker? Okay. I'm going to need some help on this one. I'm pretty sure heat armor is made with hardstone. Frame flame breaker is made with enchanted hardstone, right? This is the precursor to Yogg. Which reminds me, where's Yogg? Where is Yogg? Did I already rank it? I might have already ranked it. Armor of Yogg. Oh, is that why? Oh, it's here. Thank you, chat. Okay. <coughs> Heat Armor, Flame Breaker. Honestly, I consider these pretty much the same thing. The strategy at the start of mining, once you get into Crystal Hollows, it's not the start of mining, but once you get to the start of Crystal Hollows, the strategy used to be to wait until that event, Gone with the Wind, face the wind, and then Instabrink Hardstone in order to craft these two and then get started with mining. So I'd give these two probably like a C? I'd give it a, okay, if I'm gonna be consistent, I probably should give it either a high C or a low B. I think a high C, like the drank. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> that was so great. All right, high C, it's the first ever, whatever. But Yogg armor is interesting because Yogg will, increase your mining speed based on kills on yogs now for those that are planning to max out yog armor most of the time it's not worth it but if you find yourself in a situation where you're at a mine of devon and somebody dug out underneath and is doing the blue cheese goblin egg strat where they insta mine the gold from underneath tons of yogs spawn in that area for some reason a lot of them spawn in the bow chamber <clears throat> there's a few big uh chambers that spawn a good number of yogs. I would not suggest randomly adventuring in Crystal Hollows to kill yogs because it'll take you 10 years to max out the armor. So it's not bad. It's a good armor set. It's what got me started. It, it's basically what carried me all the way up until Devon. So I think for that, it kind of, I think it deserves an A. Run around here. I think A tier is very fair. And it, and it has a topaz slot. That's important. This is the cheapest armor set to have um, Topaz slot. Very important. <clears throat> and it's technically the best in the game for mining speed if you sacrifice fortune, but no one does that. Oh, how did I miss Celeste armor? That's another instant F. <clears throat> <laughs> Mercenary armor, another F, it's just a museum slot. Oh, 
Okay. Uh, snowsuit. It's the go-to armor set for th that um, Jerry Festival that no one participates in. D? And that's like... It's the best I can do, sorry. Um, well, it's the go-to starting armor. And then you have Nutcracker armor, which is better. I still don't see much of a use for it, to be honest. If you don't have Frozen Blaze, then maybe you can use it for Frozen Blaze fishing. It's a bit more useful than Snow Armor, so I'm thinking maybe a C. But like a low C. Yeah. Budget Magic Find? It gives Magic Find. Okay. Eh. It's not terrible, I guess. But it's nothing to write home about. I just use um, blaze armor for jellyfishing. But I guess... Eh. 125 red gifts is huge. You can fish and Jerry gives 125 red gifts per five days. Nutcrackers for Diana parties. Hold on. Let's look at this ability. Unlimited snowballs, sure. One magic find and 50 defense for ev to everyone within 30 blocks. Stacks up to five times. So plus five magic find for everybody. <laughs> Every piece grants a 7.5% 7. 7. bonus gift chance for every present you earn from, oh, okay. It's not that useful. It's really not. It's, it's fine, I guess. I think I'm gonna keep it at, where did I put it? See? I'll give it a low B and that's the best you're gonna get. It's worse than sorrow. You know what, no, I'm, keep, I'm sticking to my guns. I'm keeping it at a low C, that's it. Okay. Oh, wow. A lot of stuff's happening. Uh, XD-KO. Thank you for uh, the 33 months of being a member. Hell yeah. Luna Alt has been a member for 20 months. Tragic Stink for the Prime. Hell yeah, brother. Bozo Mask. All right. Sure. Bozo Mask is kind of nice. I kind of like it. It's a free death every run, essentially, in dungeons. It's cheap. It, um... Yeah, it's good for when you're just starting with, like, Floor 7 and you enter into the Phase 2 of the boss. If you get nuked, you'll survive. If you get crushed by a pillar, you'll survive. If you fall in the lava one too many times, you'll survive. So it's pretty good. It's not bad. I kind of like it. But there's something better, so I'll give it a B. Speaking of, Spirit Mask. It's a Bonzo Mask that will save your life but not heal you but the cooldown is six times faster which means you could skill this shit even more and with good uh vitality slash health regen slash whatever you're not going to be that much at risk of dying as long as you're paying attention because of the three seconds of invulnerability spirit mask absolutely goaded love this item oh my god I'd give it an S. I like Spirit Mask a lot. I like it a lot. It's a good item. Spirit Mask is better because extra death outside dungeons? Wait. Does Spirit Mask work outside dungeons? I don't think I've ever tried that. It does. I've used it on... Um, what's his face? Jobus. I remember using it on Jobus. Oh, yeah. Ooh, yeah, Spear Mask is nice, actually. That's quite the item. I do quite like Spear Mask. That almost makes me want to upgrade it. Nah, we're keeping it. All right, we're putting it up a few tiers. It's going to go like here, maybe. It's still S, but it's it's good. It's a good item. I like it. All right, I'll be chest plate. It gives you speed per obsidian in your inventory. I'm going to be honest, because of tuning points, because of just getting more speed in general from more sources... It's not useful anymore. It's just a museum slot. So, unfortunately... D. 
because maybe it's a useful tool for getting like a precise speed if you don't have enough magic power but even then it's so early in the game at that point like why even bother it's probably an f but out of respect for the past i'll give it a d it is what it is okay here's an interesting one water hydra head it's dropped by the hydra <clears throat> My throat's dying. <clears throat> <clears throat> Maybe snail pet. Oh, you know what? True. Obby chest plate with snail pet isn't the worst. I could totally see that. Just for that, I'll actually upgrade it to a C. I think chat's right on that. Yeah. Okay. Water Hydra Head, you're not going to use it as an armor piece, but you will use it to make eye drops, which instantly puts it at a minimum. I mean, what is it like 3x your chance for rare drops from Inferno minions or something to that effect? It's pretty good. It's annoying to grind, but it's just needed for progression. I think because of how annoying they are to get and how limited they are, especially for Iron Man, I'm going to give it a B. <clears throat> It's 30% speed. Yeah. I just I leave it. It's good with sponge or shark scale. I mean, it's a fishing armor piece. Sure. That's not going to earn any bonus points in my mind, though. Still be. Spooky armor. You deal extra damage to spooky mobs, right? Completely irrelevant. Oh, it gives you candy chance, doesn't it? It does give you candy chance. I'm still giving it an F. I'll give it a D, actually. I'll give it a D. But only because of how cheap and easy it is to get. To get Bat Person armor. Which is just a better spooky armor. And even then, once you're done with, like, a few good spooky festivals, you're never going to use this again. The infinite grapple ability just doesn't matter. It does its job, but... Eh best for farming fortune during spooky with 3x stats yeah but you're not gonna do that though it's just it's an interesting item with a lot of mechanics that I, like the 3x during spooky festival 2x during the night is interesting i think if they upgraded it to 3x during the night and 4x during mining or during uh spooky then maybe the best i could do is a c the best i could do is a c I'm tempted to give it a D tier, but I feel like, I mean, even then, I have a feeling that best candy score probably doesn't even involve bad armor anymore, so not no F. I'm not earning any, it's not earning any bonus points. No. Okay. Zombie soldier, museum entry only, doesn't matter. F. Zombie lord, F. Zombie armor, precursor to reaper armor. Uh, its purpose technically is to be Final Destination, but for Zombie Slayer, which is completely useless, and it doesn't even start counting kills until it's Reaper, so Zombie Armor, F. Reaper Armor has some purposes, though. I just don't remember what specifically, so chat's gonna have to clue me in on that. <clears throat> oh. Wait, people are talking about something. You do ghosts with spooky armor? Or bat person? You need bat person helmet for vamp minions. That doesn't earn it any points. I still don't think bat person deserves to be moved. We're going to leave it. Uh, zombie armor, yeah. All right, Reaper armor. I want to look this one up. Why do people like this? I know it has a purpose for something. Now, I will give it this. Full set bonus without a helmet. That's nice. I like that. Uh, healing wands, give 50%. Healing, get 100% defense against zombies. 100% damage to zombies. But 1% to all other mobs? Okay. And rage for 6 seconds dealing 
gaining 100 speed, 100 damage, and 100 strength. So that's why people use it right there is the sneak ability and rage. 100 damage, 100 strength. And I'm guessing for Kuja, right? For a quick damage boost? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Reaper armor? I think it deserves a decent ranking, if I can find it. Um. What is it? <laughs> Reaper. I am blind. Uh... Oh, I forgot. Revenant armor. Yeah, that's also an F. That's the upgrade of zombie armor. Forgot about that one. There's Reaper armor. Yeah, I'd give that for the extra damage on crouch thing for Kuja. I think this is a very similar to Precursor Eye. It's used in probably the exact same context now that I think about it. It's probably three-fourths Reaper with Precursor Eye, if I had to guess. So we'll leave it there. It's a low A tier. Yeah. Sniper Helmet. Its only purpose, really, is to snipe... Um, Crystal frags and dragon fights. Basically, sniper helmet, doesn't it? Or is that the sniper bow? I'm trying to remember. Hold on, I, can, I have to look up a bunch of these. Does that make the arrows fly faster or is that just the bow that does that? Oh, it's completely useless. Never mind. Nope, sniper helmet, useless. Yep, completely useless. It's just the bow. Minor armor. Wait, I thought we already did that. Or do we do mine armor? Oh no, we did minor. Wait, I'm confused. I remember this. There's two armor sets that have almost the exact same name. I don't even remember which one this is. There's minor outfit, right? Right, this this is the useless one, right? This gives you extra stats and like mining islands. Useless. It, this is the one dropped by the diamond armor mobs in deep caverns, right? Rampart armor. It's good for crimson essence and nothing else. F. Okay, fine. You're a D. You could salvage them for like five essence. Wow. Woo. <laughs> Oh man, Witch Mask. I remember this strat, dude. This used to be the go-to helmet for fishing. Three-fourths salmon with, with Witch Mask. It would make so many people mad, but the loot share you would get. Oh, it's like a way to automatically kill mobs. It's basically the Frozen Blaze thing before Frozen Blaze. Um, but they, as far as I know, broke it. They broke something about it, so. D. Oh, you know what I would really enjoy having on my... Okay, they also have a Vampire Mask, which I'm going to rank the exact same way. Vampire Witch Mask. Actually, no. Vampire Mask? That might just be an F. Vampire Witch Mask is an item that's currently unobtainable, but it's actually really, really good. It's unbalanced as hell. Um... If it existed, I'd probably give it like an A or a B, but it doesn't. So F, unfortunately. All right, we're getting down to the brass tacks here. This is some of the best stuff in the game. Some of. Except for stone chest plate. Let's get rid of stone chest plate. Same with metal chest plate. These are like tank pieces. Okay, I'm going to need some tanks in the chat to help me rank these two and these three. The Mender Crown, Fedora, and Helmet. Where are we putting these? Because I have a feeling this is wrong. All trash, all bad. Mender Crown, good. Okay, so Mender Helmet and Fedora, F. But Crown, higher. Stone and metal are bad. Metal chest plate is OP on floor six, so your teammates don't die. Mender crown, okay. C, use reaper helmet. Mmm. 
In Master Mode, Reaper Mask is better. Mender Crown is worse than Reaper Mask and Metal and Stone Chestplate are bad. Okay, so Mender Crown, it seems like it's not terrible, but it's outclassed. So let's give it like a C. And then we'll get Reaper Mask. And we'll give that one. So this also doubles your healing, right? And it makes it so that you are a really good healer slash tank, correct? Crown's actually good. Mm. Easy A or S. This is my bias showing through. I've never played tank. I don't plan on playing tank. So I'll put it at A tier, I guess. It's good for healing. Yeah. I'll bump Mender Crown up to a B, but that's the best I'm going to do. All right. Let's get some interesting ones. Let's do Magma Lord. And where's Rekindled Ember Armor? Oh, no. These are different. These are different. Hold on. I did that wrong. I did that wrong. I have... Are they even here? Armor of Magma. Not in the game anymore, which is really annoying for the record. Um, Because its ability is really great, right? Or is... Oh, which one's which, dude? Which one's which? Hypixel Skyblock Wiki, Armor of Magma. Is this the one I'm thinking of, or is that, that is that the other one? No, this one's useless. Armor of Magma, F. What's the other one, then? Is it Ember? It might be Ember. Ember armor is the good one. Okay. Okay. Yep. Full set bonus, Nether Lord. Will create obsidian below you when walking on lava. Also increases the chance of Nether monsters dropping an item by 20%. Okay, I don't witness the obby part. Wearing the full set will prevent you from taking lava and fire damage. So unfortunately, I can't rank it that high. I just can't. Because as goaded as that ability is, the armor is literally not obtainable. It's good for like fishing up the crates. Yeah, because you could jump in the lava. You're immune to the damage. You can use a fishing rod to like pull the crates away from the edge and then root it around to a spot that's like safer and the tentacles don't get you it honestly i would put this at like a or even s if you could get it but you can't i'm almost tempted to give it an f because you can't get it but just because there's people in the audience that could technically buy it from ah i'll give it a b i really wish they added it back to the game though because like the <clears throat> the supplies part of Kudra is the worst part of the entire fight by a mile. I'll put it like here. No, I'd I'd give it a high B. Even I again I'd give it an S if you could get it, but you can't. <clears throat> okay. Thunder Armor. It is basically the dungeon version of Aurora. So it's the go-to mage armor set in dungeons, which barely matters because in master mode, you're not going to be playing mage. I'd give it an S. It's a good armor set. I like it a lot. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I'm thinking of Storm. I'm thinking of Storm. This is different. This is the fishing armor set. Wait, 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 wait. Brain fart. Storm. There it is. Storm is S. Sorry. <laughs> Storm. Storm. Perhaps I need to start reading a thesaurus. Thunder armor, fine. I was I was holding on to it, even though I was talking about storm. Um, yeah, this is the fishing armor. Thunder frags are fairly easy to get. <clears throat> Frozen blaze slash blaze is just better. But if you're gonna be fishing by yourself or with a couple of people, it's it's pretty good. It's a it's a decent fishing set. I don't hate it. I think that earns it like a B. It's not the worst. All right, anyway, let's, let's ignore that that happened. Oh, actually, hold on. While we're talking about fishing armor, Magma Lord. Controversial take. Magma Lord's not that great of an armor set because of Frozen Blaze. I'll give it an A. 
it's technically the best fishing armor in the game if you don't do the frozen blaze strat it's a good armor set it has the most sea creature chance of any armor set in the game but once you get once you max out sea creature chance it doesn't matter and you can get above 100 percent even without marina if you use bobbin time on frozen blaze fishing speed again you can max it out with frozen blaze if you're good enough at the game you can't do frozen blaze for isle i mean you can it would just take forever for the mobs to die What do you mean you can't on Isle? You still get hits on it, so you can still do the Beast Area Loot Share thing. What are you talking about? Why would you? For Beast Area Loot Share, what? Nah, the Frozen Blaze would... <sighs> Am I just being dumb? I still think you can. You use Scepter? I doubt it. All right, we're getting some pushback from chat, particularly Rexu and Looter, which are both pretty goaded at fishing. So, you know what? Fine. I guess I'll reluctantly give it an S, even though I really don't like it that much. I'm putting it below Frozen Blaze and you can't stop me. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Wither Armor. It's used to craft all the other armors, but you're never going to wear it by itself. F. Uh, next. <laughs> Technically, it does better effective HP than three out of the four sets. Doesn't matter. Um, okay. <clears throat> oh. Why is dragon armor? I feel similarly to this one to how I feel about crystal. It's basically like... Oh, wait, no, this is wise dragon armor, not young dragon armor. Uh, that deducts it. That deducts it a lot of points. You're not going to use wise dragon that much. I would rather have in dungeons, at least young dragon armor with wise reforge on it because speed is nice. I just don't see realistically using wise dragon for much because the mana saving ability is nice. It's a very mid armor set nowadays. I think it it's like a high C, and that's generous. All right, well, since I was talking about it, where's Young Dragon Armor? There it is. Young Dragon Armor, in my opinion, better than Wise, because you can put Wise Reforge on it, and it still has pretty decent intelligence in dungeons, and it gives you speed. I'd rank it around here. Oh, you know what? Perfect. Crystal armor with dark goggles and then young dragon armor with shadow goggles. That's the mage progression right there for in dungeons. So yeah, I think a B tier is very fair. A mid B. <clears throat> and not to mention young dragon armor is also technically the best armor in the game to use a snail pet. So there is that. Okay, moving on. Necromancer Lord. It's the same exact concept as Young Dragon Armor, but instead of speed, it's like defense and effective health. Like I've seen some people have their mage progression go from Young Dragon Armor to Necromancer Lord for effective health. But at that point, you're probably better off just skipping the storm farm for like four hours to get the money like who cares uh, necromancer lord is like it's good because you can tank you can use tank and mage i mean i'll give it fc maybe i would i would rank it similarly to wise dragon it's just like eh, 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 whatever okay strong dragon I'm trying to really think about my progression in this game. As an Iron Man player, I did not use a lot of dragon armor. Now, nah, we have Shadow Assassin now. We have... No. Yep. 
strong dragon armor used to be like a really good value armor set but it's been completely outclassed in most ways most ways so i'll give it a d tier i think you're not really gonna use it realistically yeah superior best armor set in the game specifically for pet luck except for trying to get a dragon pet i mean it's not that great you could put renowned on it you can get the upgraded aotd in that update that might not come out <laughs> It was the best armor in the game for a long time. Superior is better than Shadow Assassin to fight me? In certain scenarios, definitely, but it's still not good. I think I'd give it a B. <laughs> How funny would it be if I put Superior below Young Dragon armor? Honestly, I think I might. It's just too expensive for the stats. You can do way better value-wise. Yeah, I think we're going to put Superior below Young Dragon. Ooh, I didn't think that would happen. That's an upset right there. That is an upset. Stereo Pants. Bro, if I could give this a Z tier, I would. Most annoying. Also, I don't know what happened to the texture there. It's one of the most annoying features of this entire game. Lowest F tier. I would give it a Z tier if I could. Okay. Squid boot, squid hat. They both give you extra chance for squids, right? Which is super niche. I'm going to need to do this to get... Um, Bait ring and Thanofish. fish, spiked atrocity. I'd give squid hat D, squid boot F. I think one of the two doesn't give you increased chance for squids. I just don't remember which one. I'll give them both a D tier. It's so niche that it doesn't matter. Boots, boots don't. Okay, the boots are useless, so F. We're going to keep Stereo Pants at the absolute bottom of F. <laughs> Let's take a look at this tier list so far, chat. Look at this beauty. What, what are we thinking so far, chat? You like it? Any placements that are having you go, huh? Actually, this is perfect. I'm going to use the bathroom. And in the meantime, check my work. What? I'm back. Oh. Skeleton Master armor confuses me. Oh, we talked about that. It's for the chest plates ability. I think Nutcracker should be high C, low B. Where is it now? It's in low C. <clears throat> I think that's fine. Dark and Shadow Goggle switch. I'll put them next to each other. I'll, yeah. All right, that's the only adjustment we're making. Let's move on. Uh, oh, by the way, not an alpaca. Thank you for the $2 super chat. Take stereo pants out, back, and shoot them. Yeah, we're gonna, yeah. We're gonna tell them to look at the rabbits. <clears throat> I wonder if anyone gets that reference. Oh, in Skyblock, the server will restart soon. Game update, interesting. Uh, it's Hammer, thank you for the uh, 12 months of membership. Hell yeah. Mr. Al 3XTTB. Thank you for the team one on Twitch. The team one sub. Beduli underscore. Thank you for the prime sub on Twitch. 
Much appreciated. Spirit above sorrow. Mice of men. Yep. I can see the chat also had to read that in um, English class. Okay. Let's finish this tier list up. I want to start playing the update. Flaming chest plate. Uh, useless museum slot only. Fervor armor. This is one of the Kuja armor sets. As far as I know, completely useless. Yeah. I mean, it's probably a, it's probably better than a lot of armor sets on this list, but considering when you get it in the game, you're never going to use it. I'll put it in D only because of attributes, technically. <laughs> Same goes for the other one. What's the other one? Oh, is that future 77? Yo, <laughs> this is a perfect, this is perfect timing because you 10 start a a set of, um, it wasn't fervor. Well, maybe it was fervor. It was either fervor or the other one. What was the other one? Let's see if I can find it. Where is it? I don't see it. Hollow, that's what it's called. Where's hollow? Is it even here? There's no way the texture pack doesn't have hollow armor. Oh, it doesn't because this tier list was made before hollow armor existed. Anyways, uh, Future77, thank you for the $2 super chat. Really goog list, but you're missing hollow and S plus. Yeah, I, maybe if I read his super chat, maybe I would have known. Okay, Fervor is also going to represent hollow. I think they both were going to have the same rating. Because of attributes and people using it as like a... A budget storm, which I would never recommend, but people use it for that. High D tier. Sure. It's good if you're poor. Sure. Okay. Werewolf armor. Uh, because of terror, I feel like it's almost completely outclassed. Ferocity is... Uh, I mean, it's good for weaker bosses that have like a damage cap per hit. For example, Arachne, Dragons. But you're really not gonna... Oh, you use it for Bow? Okay, okay. I feel like C is too generous. No, it's... No, it's not. Actually... Hmm... My gut instinct is telling me right about here. Somewhere in this range for werewolf. It's it's anywhere from here to like here. I think top of C tier is good. I think top of C. Top of C tier. Ooh. Um, you know what has been staring me in the face this whole time? Let's put it in the bottom here. Uh... Oh, wait. Flaming chest plate is a part of this, right? This is the... Sorry. Ignore that I ranked flaming chest plate in F. I was getting it confused with a different... I think it was with, like, flaming sword or something. Wrong item. This is the nether sea creature set. And it's... <laughs> it's better than shark scale armor. And it costs about... 15 times less. Or more. So actually not bad. It has attributes. I actually kind of like it. It's the problem is fishing level. So I think honestly, I think the whole set deserves like a C tier. Maybe, maybe B. I'd say C. Eh, eh. I'm thinking, I'm thinking how long am I going to be using this before I get thunder armor? I'm going to put it at C. I think Thunder Armor is decently easy to get. So I think because of how high the fishing level requirement is, especially for Taurus Helmet, like literally you're going to be using a Taurus Helmet for like probably less than 10 hours of gameplay because by the time you get the fishing level, you'll just start with um, Thunder anyways. So whatever. The Nether Fishing Set, C. I, I would rank it higher, but... Eh. Oh, you know what? The, I, I'm kind of hating right now. I'm being a hater. I acknowledge that. I really don't like shark scale armor. It makes me angry. 
it's so expensive and it's so bad you get like what 2.5 sea creature chance with the nether set right i'm pretty sure it's even worse with sharks so it's like 1.5 sea creature chance for armor piece absolute trash the reforges give plus one it's so annoyingly bad in sea creature chance and it's yeah no i would honestly put it in d i don't like shark scale at all it's a really irritating armor set to get it's 2.5 percent per piece it's still not great it's just i don't like it dude i really don't uh salmon armor i'm gonna rank salmon armor higher because screw you shark scale i remember grinding for that and it sucked anyways <clears throat> Yeah, I'm ranking all, pretty much all the fishing armors except for Frozen Blaze way lower than most people would just because Frozen Blaze is that good. Shark and D? Yeah, it's not worth it. I mean, you're going to want it for like museum, but the disrespect, I'm being a massive hater for fishing. I always have been. I don't hate it as much as dungeons, but I do hate it. Okay, next. uh old dragon its only use is to be salvaged f <laughs> that one should be fairly obvious holy dragon armor it's the same thing f what about where's protective dragon is that in here did I already take care of Protector? I don't remember. No, I didn't. Uh, Protector F. Okay. Uh, now we're going to talk about one that's decent. Unstable armor. Um, for a long time, Strong was considered the go-to like budget option for dragon armors. But I really think Unstable takes that. It's cheap. It's good for early game. It's really annoying to go against because of its passive ability with like goblins. I don't know is it is it not patched still i feel like it is and it has been for a while i can't hate on it that much but i can't give it that much credit either i put strong in d so i think it's only fair i put unstable in c it's still not that great i would go for other armor pieces like again young dragon armor is just better value overall it's not as much damage technically but like with how easy it is to get coins, especially if you just like hop straight in the rift and just get like 30 mil an hour by just grinding items no one else wants, <clears throat> then you could skip so much progression. Necron armor. I mean, this kind of goes without saying, doesn't it? Uh, I would not rank it as high as Storm. I wouldn't, mm. My instinct is telling me either here or like here. Maybe even A tier. I want to put it A tier. Uh, but will I? Mm. I would put it right here. And here's why. Necron armor is technically the best berserker armor, right? For dungeons. But let's think about this. If you're going to be an archer, I know I just said berserker, but Necron's also used for archer. If you were to be an archer, you could use a skeleton master chestplate. If you want speed, you can use Maxor boots, right? So you're really only using Necron leggings, right? Because you're not going to use the helmet. No one ever uses the helmet. It gives so much damage versus Crimson. I don't know. All right. You know what? Fine. I'll rank it around where Storm is. But the reason I don't like Necron armor is because I don't feel like it's powerful enough for how expensive it is to like max it with all the stars and the, I don't know. I'm expecting more. No, here's what it is. I expect more progression. I don't mind spending extra if I can make the ceiling higher. And with Necron, you really can't. So it's like 
I crimson armor is just better outside of dungeons for fairly cheap but in dungeons yeah but I could see a setup using a terminator where you have a I don't know I'm trying to remember what people use in dungeons <laughs> um, oh a golden or no a diamond head you would use a skeleton master chest plate necron boots and mac or necron leggings and then max or boots like uh, I don't know. I think that's a fair spot to put it. I don't like it as much as Storm. But it is it is what it is. It's still a good armor set, but I'm going to knock it down a few pegs. Because I think it could be better. I think it deserves a buff. Crimson armor. Now we're talking. Now we're getting somewhere. Because you have swipe and you have increased damage. My voice is dying, by the way. You can tell I haven't streamed in a while. <clears throat> uh, Crimson armor. I mean, it's goaded. You can use it technically as a RCM <laughs> mage set if you were to get M uh, magic. No. Mana pool, mana regen on it. That's kind of sick. Obviously, veteran vitality, it's the best slayer set in the game. I think Crimson might be... It's either the single best armor set in the game or it's tied for first. Or it's second. It's it's gotta be S plus. It has to be. I'm gonna put it right there. Ah, oh, but mm, yeah, I'm gonna leave it there. I'm gonna leave it right here. Crimson armor, perfect. And what do you pair with crimson armor? At least in Slayers, Warden helmet. I think Warden helmet. Ah. Uh, I was about to put it in S plus, but let's think about this for a second. <laughs> what do you use one helmet for? Kudra. Blaze Slayer. I think that's about it. <laughs> All right. I think that puts it right about here. Still S. In my opinion, it could be used for revs, I guess. I'll put it in S. It's still, like, technically the best helmet in the game for Blaze Slayer. Not even technically, it just is. Um, I don't know why I waited this long to point this out. Angler armor. Uh, it's your fish. It's your fish. It's your first fishing armor. I don't think it's as good as salmon, right? I don't remember. It's around where salmon. I'll say it's better than salmon. Eh. It depends what salmon gives you. I don't remember what salmon gives you. What does salmon do again? All oh, right. Okay. So it's a. Okay. We're going to put it below salmon then. Yeah. I'd say C tier for our angler. It's fine. You're not going to use it for very long. <clears throat> Ooh, terror armor. I think this one is even more niche than Necron, to be honest, but it's still a really good armor set. It's the go-to for Kudra DPS. I'd probably put it around where Crimson is. I'd, I'd give it an S plus. Yeah. Yeah. I think it deserves to be up here with the heavy hitters. Ooh, so this is where we get to the spots in the game that I'm not that... Okay, I have a feeling cheap and fancy... T okay, cheap tux, I'm going to give a D. Just because it's only 3 mil to max out the talisman for the Romero quest. Fancy tux, F. Because why? And then Elegant Tux. It used to be used for certain things, but I don't know anymore. All Tuxedos on DRC for Quick Lifeline. I don't think it's gonna earn much from that. It's needed for Kudra Follower Relic and Mandible. It's for the quest line. Well, I guess by that logic, I have to put it in a similar spot to where I put the cheap tucks, huh? 
<laughs> at the bottom of D tier. Let's go. <clears throat> Ghostly boots. As far as I know, useless. Oh, let's maintain that stereo pants being in the last spot of F. <laughs> uh, hardened diamond. It's completely outclassed. Mm, goodbye. Heavy armor. Completely outclassed. Goodbye. The hell is Ember Ash armor? Ember Ash armor? This item is no longer obtainable other than trading with players. What? Oh, that's Ember. Oh, wait, wait. That's Ember. Ember Ash. Oh, weird. We fa Oh, uh, I don't know what I just clicked. I don't know what that was. <laughs> okay. Uh, Ember Ash doesn't exist. F. <laughs> okay. Oh, we're getting down to the... Okay. Tarantula armor. Um... The double jump has with the boots hasn't been useful for quite a while. Ember Ash is unobtainable. It was crafted with 24 coal before Crystal Hollow is released and it sucked. Yeah, so F. Um, honestly, Tarantula probably also F. Oh, helmet. I forgot Tarantula helmet. Oh, okay. I mean, you're still probably not going to want to use it, but like. Okay, the helmet as far as I'm aware, gave you strength per crit damage that you had, right? Or is it the other way around? It was something like that. It's pretty mid. Like, so much power creep has happened that Tarantula Helmet's kind of fallen from grace. Same with the boots. So, like, I think that maybe earns it a D? Like, a high D? I'll give it a C. You know what? It's expensive to get a Warden Helmet. You're not going to use Crown of Greed. Then again, at that point, Crimson Helmet's probably better. Eh, I'll put it at C. It, it, it's fine. Whatever. Uh, okay. Monster Hunter Armor. Way too much effort to get. You're not going to use it by the time you get all the stuff, especially Creeper Pants. F. <clears throat> okay, you know what? That's harsh. I would give it a D, maybe? It's decent damage. I used it on my Hardcore Profile. Tarantula Helmet's Dungeonizable. That's not going to save it. I would still keep it at a C. Yeah, the Diamond and Golden Heads exist. Yeah, Monster Hunter, let's give a low D. Diver Armor. It's used to get... Um, golden Wand or whatever it was called. Alchemist Staff? Alchemist Staff. Other than that, it's really annoying. Isn't it used to craft something? Doesn't matter. D tier. Also, where's sponge armor? Or did I already rank sponge armor? Maybe I did. Let's assume that I didn't. F tier. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> uh, Maxor. The boots give speed. This is the archer armor set, right? In dungeons? I don't see people running Maxor. Is there a reason for that? Maxor C for mage. What? I don't see people using it. Please do M7. No. Is it just the boots for the speed? Yeah, people just... Okay. In that case, I can't give it any better than like... I don't know. Our salmon floor seven. I see a lot of high level players using full max or, but why? For RCM? Is there an ability I'm not aware of? Maxor is with Necron? No, it's not, bro. <laughs> not even close. No, no. <clears throat> it's just for speed. Nothing else. I mean, if it's just for speed, I mean, tuning points exist, right? I mean, sure. I'll give it the lowest of eights here, I guess. 
Uh, perfect armor. Completely outclassed in every way. Super, super expensive. And it's upgrade I've yet to get because it requires diamond essence. Absolute trash. F. Oh, how do they skip Shadow Assassin? This is the armor set that killed Superior. It's also acquired fairly early on in dungeons. Does pretty good damage as a archer slash burrs set. I tend not to dislike it. I think it deserves higher than Maxor. <laughs> I think it deserves higher than Maxor, but probably not much higher. Hmm. I think it deserves to be better than Mastiff, like somewhere in this range. But that also makes me want to move Precursor Eye up here. Same with Reaper Armor. I think that's fair. Basically mid eighth here. Yeah. Okay. Um, I'm going to need chat's help for the rest of this because it's either tank or it's items I don't remember what they do. One of these is from Bingo and lets you double jump into this day is still highly valued. And I'm guessing that's spring boots. Save so much time. Yeah. In trap room and all that. I think that deserves an A tier then. I'd probably put it... Probably around where... It lets you charge jumps, I think. I'd put it around where Maxor is. Convenience item. Sure. High A? I don't know if I'd give it high A. I mean, would you rather have Precursor Eye and Reaper Armor and Kudra or Spring Boots? I think I'd rather have the Precursor Eye and the Reaper Armor, personally. I think Spring Boots is fair. Low A. <laughs> Mr. Legend's getting triggered right now. <laughs> it's great for dungeons. All right. All right, fine. The best you're getting out of me. It's a convenience item, right? So I think that's fair to put it right next to Skelly Master. Right there. Maybe even slightly above because maybe people aren't fish brand like me and actually can remember to restock arrows. There you go. That's the best you're getting. Spear boots. I don't know what these do. Useless? F. That's easy. How about super heavy steel and gold ore? <coughs> All tank equipment. Can you tell where my lack of knowledge is in this game? Steel is F. Super heavy C. But like why? Gold ore is mid to high B. I need explanations for the video. So obviously gold ore armor is the tank armor set. Um... In master mode, that's fairly important from what I hear. I don't use it, but based on what Chad is saying, it seems like it would be a low S. I'd say a low S. There you go. Why can't I sub on kick? Uh, I haven't set everything up on there yet, so I might have to do something, I'm not sure. Perfect's better than Goldor. I doubt that. Put it with Spirit Mask. But it's not nearly as... Uh, maybe it is. Fine. You know what, Goldor? We'll put next to Spirit Mask. There you go. Okay. Steel kind of Garbo. I'll take your word for a chat. I thought that it would be decent like metal chest plate. I thought it would be like kind of how Mender Crown is good when the two versions steel F. All right, so we're just going to give it an F. Get rid of that. Super heavy armor. D. I got to at least do some uh, super heavy armor. I have a feeling it's probably bad. Oh, so it's upgraded heavy armor, right? Grants plus one speed for every 50 defense. Is 
it's good defense. You know what? For that, it gets a D. And there you have it, chat. Finally, we have the official certified 30 virus high pixel skyblock armor tier list. With S tier containing the Wither Goggles, Aurora Armor, Crimson Armor, Terror Armor, Armor of Devon, Mineral, and Rancher Boots. S having Storm, Necron, Warden Helmet. I'm a little tempted to put Warden Helmet up, but it's so niche though. So I think we'll leave it. Blaze and Frozen Blaze is so goaded for fishing. Yeah. <laughs> Ugh. 30 you're not allowed to separate gold or reaper mask oh you think so where did i put gold or okay you know what i'll move reaper mask here to to be with gold or there you go please swap shadow assassin and dark goggles it's the wrong way oh wait no, no. Remember, this tier list isn't what items are the best. It's what items are the best when you have access to them. So there you go. But if it is the absolute pinnacle of the skill, then there you go. But anyways, there it is. What do you think of the tier list, chat? I'm going to have to scroll down so you can see. Well, I mean, this is actually a perfect screenshot because you see everything that technically matters, right? Because everything in F tier down here. This is a sign that we're going to need a rebalance. Looking forward to 1.0 when I get to redo all my tier lists and they rebalance everything. Am I tripping or is Fermento missing? Is it? Is Fermento missing? I think it might be right. This tier list was made about a year ago. Okay, so Armor of Devon, I would probably put... I would probably put Fermento right where Armor of Devon is, for the record. So there you go. Mineral is so niche. No, it's not. Some of the best grinds in the game require mineral. But anyways, if you enjoyed this video... Video, I know it's a stream right now. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like down below. And again, if you can use code 30 virus, it'll save you 5%. Whenever you buy anything in the high pixel score, score, the high pixel score, we're gonna run with it. Anyways, um, for now, I guess that's it. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys later. Bye, YouTube. See you later. All right, stay in the stream. That's the recording over. Stop recording. Start recording. Tier list is complete. B drop went crazy? Kind of did. All right, here we go. Uh, let's turn back on the Minecraft display. Turn off the monitor display and the color source. And I think it's time. I think it's time to actually play the game. Let's do this. We recorded the tier list chat. I've been meaning to do that for like three weeks now. So congratulations me. See you people watching the video. I like how we still get the maintenance message, even though it is April 9th and it's 1 p.m. instead of 9 a.m. Whatever. Oh. Hey, chat. Hey, chat. I got a Tinder message. I'm going to read that real quick. interesting anyways i'll deal with that after stream um how to get railroad pass you have to forge it okay so now supposedly the update is working again so let's try it ah we're back very good Already got that YouTuber Riz. No, YouTubers don't have Riz, bro. We don't. And that's the most I'll say about that topic. Uh, let's go to Dwarven Base Camp.
Isn't he dating someone currently? No, no, I am not. Hey, 30, I have a challenge for you. Do slash playtime and try to do any Slayer boss. With the number of coins of your playtime with Emerald Blade. So I'd only have 5,000 coins? <laughs> no. Don't use Tinder, people trying to use you for your ACC. I don't advertise them a YouTuber or any of my accomplishments on there. It's actually really annoying in a way because if you want the best result in dating, you can't brag, which is ironic because how are people supposed to distinguish the high value people from Okay, that's harsh. The the highly accomplished people versus those that haven't accomplished anything yet because maybe they're too young or haven't gone to school. You know what I mean? I judge people based on their actions, not any, obviously, not any inherent traits. We've known this for years. But anyways, I can't go out advertising I'm a YouTuber that has a house and like a car and stuff. I can't. Because if I do, guess what's going to happen? Gonna get a bunch of gold diggers. That's just how it works. Also, I should probably put my Invisalign trays in. There we go. Anyways, it is really annoying. Oh, my lisp is back. That'll go away in a few minutes. Anyways, um, let's look into the update again. How do you make a campfire? That's what I want to know. Where you at, Fred? This is a great mechanic and I absolutely love it. Okay. Uh... this oh it's the onyx right so we need to find onyx for the travel scroll but where's the campfire i don't see it it's a collection item I'm so confused. Oh, okay. I was like, why aren't all four of the new gemstones showing up? But Tungsten and Umber aren't gemstones. I'm an idiot. Okay. So I guess we just have to throw ourselves back into the caves and get as many new materials as we can. And then just freeze to death over and over. <gasps> oh, oh, that hiccup. That was awful. Oh, I should probably catch up on donuts. Oh, this is Umber, apparently. This is Umber. Nice. All right, so while I do this, let's read some donuts. Jaden, thank you for the 100 bits. You're fine with your opinion. I just want to know why is Mineral more niche than Warden? You pretty much only used it for gold, no? I think you're phrasing the question incorrectly. So your your question probably is, why did I rank Mineral above Warden? Because it makes a grind that would otherwise be absolutely impossible, possible. And it's like, if you want maximum damage, you need a technically a bill gold collection. Well, technically it's 10 bill, right? Or I don't know how that, where it maxes, but... Mm -hmm. Did I mine all of the umber? No, I didn't. <clears throat> you said minerals not niche and warden was? I mean, 
they're both niche. I will, I will say that. Now that's Sapphire. This is Glacite. I'm gonna keep getting Umber. We got some smooth jazz right now. Yo, what's up, Andrew? Thank you for the two dollars. Love the BGM. I don't know what that means. It's a vibe. What does BGM mean? This guy's my YouTube partner, Red, by the way. He's one of those cool people that keeps us YouTubers sane. This is the only bridge we have between uh, ourselves and YouTube. Oh, background music. I see. Yeah, I like the new playlist a lot. Doofus. I mean, to be fair. Also, Fez, you want to be seen? I think now we're getting to that point where the uh, content mode starts to calm down. Because we've seen a lot of the new stuff, but not all of it. But, you know. You should listen to... No. I don't like rap. Fezzi, are you proud of me? I finally recorded the tier list. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> finally caught up to the jazz, huh? <laughs> I told you, it's great. It's great stream music. It just works. Some about it. It's like something you'd hear in the lobby of a restaurant. That didn't make sense. I have to but put I your mean, volume down a bit. There we go. I'm just like, am I loud? <laughs> You're absolutely peaking the mic. Dude, that's awesome. Oh, yeah. So, uh, I, you know how I used to be weirdly quiet? It turns out Windows turned me down for some reason. There you uh, go. I put you to 85% and that made uh, it sound normal I, again. I, I listened to the stream. I didn't sound too loud before, but let's see. Oh, okay. I'll put sounds you... Good. No, it sounds good now. It sounds fine. You can keep it there. Don't touch it. You can use efficient miner for glacia and umber. Oh, interesting. Okay. Oh, you can. Thank you, chat. Yeah, anything that's not a gemstone, right? This is so much faster. Oh, my God. <laughs> I love having pretty much max gear before coming in here. So, like, how is the new content? I don't know, because they locked it, like, 30 minutes after my stream started, so I had to do the tier list. Oh. But now we're back. Check Discord DMs. Why? What am I looking at, Rexu? It's listing all the new stuff. I don't know what I'm looking at. Thirty year cold level. What about it? I'm not gonna lie. What I changed my Twitch name to is just a better name than I had. <laughs> I kind of want to change my channel name to that. I got complimented on my name the first time I appeared in some guy's chat the other day. <laughs> yeah, I need to get that travel scroll. You know what, chat? I kind of want to... Okay. Does this completely reset your cold, like, right away? It does. I'm going to make a mad dash to find... The, the black gemstone. Onyx? So I can make the travel scroll to the base camp. Oh, this is new, right? What's this one? This is the farming fortune one. Per Peridot. I sent cords three times. Oh, is that what that screenshot is? Wait, I was under the impression this was randomly generated. Is it not? Oh. Is this in the Crystal Hollows? Or is this a new area? This entirely? is technically in Dwarven Mines. <laughs> Whoa. Wait, Jaden, what are you freaking out about? Design for foraging update? What? Yo, does Jaden got some leaks or something? Oh, just posted. Wait. Yo, Jaden, do you have me on Discord? Actually, Twitter DM me. I want to see too. Hold on. 
Oh, you linked it in the chat. I'm an idiot. Sorry. Yeah, I'm I'm dumb. I tried searching for it. Okay. 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 Wow. This is the thing. And it's not that long. I'm going to read it on stream, but first I need to go oh, to the base camp no. before I die. Do it. Um do it. actually, let's just let's just leave. Uh let's go over here. Trees? They're adding trees? Design th they're adding trees. They're adding tree? Oh tree. my god, chat. Yes. Wow, this We've been looks waiting kinda, for so long. I ain't going to lie to you. This looks kind of big like this. All right, all right. Here we go. Hello, bro. Hello, bro. <laughs> <Great. Hello, Bert. laughs> Yo, screw it. These Invisalign trains, trains. <laughs> you know, Yo, maybe that's reason. not the problem. <laughs> maybe, I was about to say, maybe these Invisalign trains, they're, they're getting in the way. These trains. These trains, bro. Okay, let's try this again. Attempt number three. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Welcome to the inaugural post in our new series of design discussions. This series aims to spark deeper com conversations on various design topics related to our community. Though this first entry is a bit lengthy, it really isn't. Future posts may vary in size. Our goal is to share a design philosophy, float new ideas, and gather feedback from the community. Cool. <clears throat> that screenshot looks sick for the record. W. The spotlight forging update. What is this supposed to be? Oh, that's supposed to be a ladybug, I think. First off, this isn't a delay announcement. Quite the opposite, thank God. We're making steady progress and are quite excited about what's taking shape. We had an internal group testing session and are planning the second one in a couple of weeks. <clears throat> There's still polishing to be done and improvements to be made, but the core elements are in place. So it's time for a sneak peek at what the foraging update has in store. Pause. <laughs> Trees. <laughs> pause. 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 Look at your Discord. It, uh, you need to. Okay. Uh, this is important. Wait. Mm. Wait. Okay. Fearless wanted to be here for you. Ah, so, fearless. I just, I just literally hijacked your stream. The boy, he's here. Or at least. Yeah. He... Well, he's ringing. <laughs> he's ringing. Oh, he's also streaming. Nice. How many, we got a phone. That reminds me, how's the Switch, Twitch stream doing? How's oh, not Switch bad. The Switch stream. I think I lost the ability to speak. I've been away from streaming for too long. Okay. He is yet to pick up. I think you might have to harass him in his chat. <laughs> I might have to harass him. I'll, I'll do that. You, re, you read. Good luck. I'm going to keep reading. Uh, trees, the heart of foraging. Wow. I, I do oh, wait. I just I'm realized. Lind Fearless. Lind Hello. Hello. Your list. Are you currently reading the patch notes as well? Or not patch no, notes, I, the announcement I, thread? I had a person come into my chat like a minute ago said that the new update's kind of flopping because there's some issues with it. And then I was like, what are the issues? I clicked on your stream to check maybe <laughs> and I was doing it to us. <laughs> and uh, you're doing the, the patch or the, the forging update thing. So I was like, oh. I kind of want to hear this. Oh, okay. Do you want me yeah. to read it aloud, or because I know yeah, you're yeah, streaming yeah, too? Yeah. I don't want to be. We're both part of the audience here. I am. I am uh, here to listen and give All right. opinion. Well, TLDR, they're doing a new type of forum post series that shows the new features they're going to add. I yeah, a new series so of wait, design what discussions. Well, what I read so far, TLDR, they're doing a new series of design discussions. So. Trees. So like, uh, like we, sorry to interrupt. Uh, like we used to have like a bunch of those uh, patch notes. Where well, they, we had. They, 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 yeah, we had that first wave of ideas. design threads like two oh, years so they're ago. Doing another wave. They're doing another wave, and this is the first but one. It, is it gonna be the same that like they promised they're gonna do it, and then because before they promised us a second wave, they started one, and then they just went silent for like what six, eight months, and then didn't, didn't do another one, and then they're back, and they're like promising the same thing. They flopped on again. It sounds uh, lucky. It sounds hopeful based on what I've read so far. So I'll I'll read through. Let's okay. trudge through the rest of it. Let's get through it. Uh, trees, the heart of forging. <laughs> The central activity on the forging islands will naturally be tree cutting, but there is a few other mechanics we are looking to improve on compared to the gameplay of the park. Tree gifts. One large problem with the park is that players would rather be alone than share trees with someone else. Yeah. 
She's on the new Forging Islands, Galatia. <laughs> Will offer players rewards once fully taken down, just contributing at least 10% of a tree's cutting will result in a tree gift, encouraging group play. So loot share for trees, cool. Sweep and toughness. The tree capitator introduced a new mechanic that allows you to quote, sweep 35 logs in a row. Okay. We intend to make this mechanic a core part of the item progression. Sweep is a new stat that allows you to cut extra logs. So basically efficient miner, for trees <laughs> an item with 35 sweep like the tree capitator will cut 35 logs <clears throat> cool and we have the figure... so it's not only um it's not only loot share for the tree sorry but it's, it's also good. like they it's gonna be more efficient to to do it in the group like before like loot share is like a nice bonus but now it's actually like we're gonna be meta to have the more people like for it. Also, depending on how trees good, probably have a lot of health. Depending on how good the tree gifts Mystic are. Mystic damage. I don't know what that means. Oh. Well, there's a there's this new axe here. Mystic damage. Yeah, I don't know what that means. Uh, damage, strength, forging, fortune, sweep. Gives one extra sweep every ten thousand logs cut. Oh, interesting. In Galatia. Okay, so that would suggest it's a biome. So probably like Crimson Isle, it's going to be a massive island with a bunch of biomes, I'd imagine. However, trees cut on Galatia have increased toughness. So, so mining, what's the term for pickaxes? With mining level or no, with like toughness, I don't remember. Yeah, it's just, it's just mining The level. things you use Silex on, I forgot the word. Um, meaning 35 sweep won't actually cut 35 logs and you'll need much more to efficiently cut the last few tri oh, oh interesting breaking power. breaking power so it's not quite yeah. like breaking power so it seems to me like toughness has a diminishing return for how good your sweep is that's what it looks like yeah okay styles each tree on galatia okay so the island's called galatia galatia is not a biome has its unique cutting style adding a layer of skill to the process so kind of like rift maybe the first nah, style you gotta chop logs like roast that of the fig tree is quite simple. You just have to cut the branches of the tree and then the trunk. So yeah, exactly like how they did it in uh, Rift, essentially. If you try to cut the trunk first, you will only sweep half of the logs you should have as a penalty. I can see people trolling with that, but okay. Axe throwing. Oh, interesting. You can't really cut the branches of a tree if you can't throw the axe. Or oh, I love this. If this Wait, how are gonna people troll? Sorry. Well, for example, someone will, to grief you, they'll just break the trunk of the tree before you manage to break the, um... No, I, I think that's... No, so you get rewarded for breaking down the tree, right? Yeah. So the only thing that this says is that you should chop the tree first and then the trunk. Oh, so it's not a uh, yield. They, okay, the penalty is yeah, not a uh, yield penalty. It, it's, it's an a, efficiency penalty. Yeah, Got it's it. an efficiency. So they're, they're just going to be stupid for doing that. Yeah. Okay. Axe throwing. Love this idea. If it works the way that it immediately popped into my head, you don't have to like have jump boost good. and like Maybe. AOTE, AOTV teleport up to the top and hope as you're falling you break the logs that that crap was annoying so throwing the axe instead i like a lot axes with sweep will have an axe throwing ability allowing to target logs from a distance however once again throwing your axe will only sweep half the logs so only use it when needed so it does seem like they're making a meta there's like a strategy it's not just click block which is good oh and there's more than just trees there's like a building here heart of the forest oh boy <laughs> it's heart of the mountain <laughs> literally heart of the forest oh boy you know what's funny heart of the forest makes more sense than heart of the mountain in my mind but anyways as we previously Whoa. discussed hypixel skyblock reached a stage where we can slow down our never-ending explorations of new mechanics and start reusing mechanics that prove themselves good i agree the heart of the mountain skill tree was a success well well yeah if the if heart of the mountain was a success i feel like there would be much discussion in the community as to what the best setup is but there really isn't there's like a well 
established yeah, meta. It's 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 more like yeah. a bunch of skills that you unlock and there is just no choice in between them. It's just like yeah. yeah. In my opinion, what we need with Heart of the Mountain is like basically the way that magic power works where you can have like a preset that you just switch to in my opinion maybe it would cost something but clicking those buttons like a million times is just annoying as hell i don't know i feel Careful. like the idea of heart of the mountain ideas. i like the idea of heart of the mountain the problem is only one out of the four abilities actually matters I mean, that's kind of the mantra of the whole game, is it not? There's one way to I do mean, it right and a million ways to do it wrong. <laughs> that's like I don't know. I feel, in a like, nutshell, really. I feel like there's skills where that's not the case. Um, I mean, mining in general does have variances and metas depending on what you're doing. So I do think they can fix it. But anyways, moving on. Let's really assume good. Heart of the Mountain was a success. Kind of. Sure. Uh, sure. And we're excited to introduce a similar concept in the forging update. Cool. The concept's good, it just needs balancing. Uh, Starlin Sisters. Those three sisters are similar to Jacob, except they're concours. I don't know what that means. Uh, don't put you against other players. Instead, it's all about your own performance. Their concours will always be ongoing, giving rewards every in-game day. Oh, is it a new daily? No. Uh, okay. Wait, what is happening? Uh, with this like uh, every game day oh every so game day oh never yeah, mind so oh like so not real life day. so it's like so it's like a it's like a farming oh. contest oh oh okay it's never mind really never mind not a daily even though it yeah okay mystic damage uh, it's like a it's like a kind of daily most monsters on galatia will have a mystic shield meaning that you simply won't be able to damage them before their shield is down interesting only items with mystic damage will damage the shield. So the meta would be to use one of the new weapons until the shield is down and then one tap it. <laughs> Wait, with a Hyperion. This is... Oh, monsters in this place. Um... Yeah, yeah. Berries across all three of the islands. So there's three islands on Galatia. You will find different types of berries that can be collected to craft hunting items. Ooh, now we're talking, okay. While we never worked on the Abyss Island. Oh, it says pressure. While we never worked on the Abyss Island, we still decided to make pressure as a system and introduce it to Galatia. You mean like underwater Pre like pressure? Yeah, like, pre yeah, like you get pressure. It'll make by... your respiration bubbles go down faster the deeper. <laughs> Subnautica mechanics? Oh my God. It makes the bubbles go down faster the deeper you dive into the waters. Running out of air while in deep waters will deal massive damage, so make sure you stack up extra respiration and pressure resistance. Be so diver armor. Cool. I'm going to be completely honest. We have never had a problem in the game where we can't just heal a full health bar in a second. So I, I feel like this mechanic will be ignored. I have a feeling. I don't think so. I mean, unless they brute healing. force it. If it's a continuous... Unless they insta kill you, it's not. Yeah, there's a ways to. Brute My brute guess brute. is that it exponentially gets worse, and yeah, yeah you'll be able to heal hopefully. for an extra like maybe thirty seconds, but it'll just get to the point where no matter what, you'll die. Is it's my guess. Basically, an insta kill. Yeah. Running out of air and deep water will deal massive damage. So make sure, yeah, yeah, make sure you have extra respiration and pressure resistance. Pressure resistance. Okay. Okay. Before you adventure yourself in the deeper rooms of the lake. I could have called it integrity. Could they have known? Deeper rooms of the lake? Interesting. Oh, so there's like a lake in the middle. Yeah, god then... temples. Gods used Whoa. to exist in the world of Hypixel Skyblock. But Whoa. they were dethroned. Probably like Devon, I would imagine. But they were dethroned. Unless Devon's just a guy that was really good at mining, who knows. Um, <laughs> dethroned by an ancient civilization. God temples can still be found in the world. Is this like the Skyrim mechanic? And reactivating them will allow you to become a worshiper. They, The very first god temples will be introduced on Galatia. Those grant global stat buffs to everyone who unlocks them and extra buffs to their worshippers. Oh, titles. The more worshippers a temple like has, the stronger the god becomes. So it's kind of like Blaze Tech Ham Radio, where if everybody's on the same thing, it's better. Or is it like that? Interesting. Hunting. 
I won't dive into this subject on this thread. I find it funny how they use the first person I when it's the high pixel team. Who are you? I'm pretty sure they have said form. we earlier in this doc. <laughs> that is kind of funny. That would have docked points in a class I had back in high school about this sort of thing. It was a consistency in writing. Uh, I won't dive into the subject on this thread as it should have its own thread, but I can already explain a few important points about hunting. Forging went through multiple design iterations across the months and years, and the game is very different now than when it was back when the project started. The mentality was always to make this island as lively as possible, a goal that, in hindsight, was overly ambitious. This vision became a significant bottleneck for the design process. While we still want the island to be lively, our ambition has to be reset multiple times over, and during conversations a few months ago, we found the solution we instantly liked. Hunting will be a new skill? Oh boy. Oh! Oh boy. That's, shit. That's nice. And will be available on a ton of creatures across the game. Many mobs that already exist. It kind of sounds like bestiary. Uh, it does sound like bestiary. It and you like better, bestiary, you but, but better again. give us credit. You know, so <laughs> better what I give can, us credit if we already I get can, it. By the way, I can guarantee you this is going to take massive inspiration from the way hunting is in RuneScape. Is you don't kill the creature. You essentially put down a trap and you wait until the creature walks into the trap. Don't say things like that. <laughs> uh, it's very fun. Just hey, you know what? If it's, the, kind of a, if it's a fun, fun mechanic... Fun. Uh, yeah. Conclusion. The forging update has made a considerable amount of progress in the past few months, and we are getting close to the alpha release. There is no need to sugarcoat it, though. This update took already took too long, and we were able to learn from our own mistakes. Our mentality when it comes to Hypixel Skyblock updates evolved a lot throughout the years. Like spending all of 2023 on updates that are QOL and left us YouTubers starving. This alone would be the We're subject of a thread. We are still hungry. We're eager to hear uh, your thoughts on this new update and what topic. Okay. Nice. All a bunch of stuff so, that is exciting and interesting. So for how long have you been waiting this update? We have about, we, we, we know that it's going to be a, a, a new skill and uh, a new area. Well, a new skill with three islands, three islands, three islands that make up the new forging system with a heart of the mountain light system. Uh, you're getting some kind of pressure mechanic. Hunting is going to be its own skill. We already said that, but you know, like it, honestly, they didn't mention the version, which makes me they, kind of surprised. They did not mention the newest version, which is the big they, rumor they going did, around right now. The and big, there's only so much I can say really on the topic. not really a rumor. They kind of just said it in the last post. Okay. So they were like... <laughs> here's what... Here's the thing. I can't really talk on it because I know too much. So you can, already played the whole update. I'm you two I, can I, I speculate, it. but I can't really speak on it because I promised I wouldn't. <laughs> if it's not 120, riots. <laughs> By me alone, nobody else cares. <laughs> There was dripstone in the dragon screenshot. Wait, 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 wait. Was there? Oh. Can we confirm it, or deny that? Yeah, there might that? be new version stuff in a screenshot. If you that guys is... come to any conclusions on your own, that's not my fault. Well, if it's in the screenshot. I personally believe it's 120. I don't see why it would. I've been in the good graces of Hypixel for a long time, and no, I want to keep leak. it that way. Ruin it. <laughs> Ruin your relationship with it. All right, time to put the Invisalign tray back in. I'm going to sound like I have a lisp. There's also copper what? and 1.16 wood. Nice. <clears throat> All right. I learned some stuff. I'm going to leave you guys to stream. I'm going to go do my <laughs> thing. Have a good right. stream, Mr. Fearless. Welcome back. Uh, you too. This is. Uh, welcome back. I've been gone for half a year. I don't think uh, I'm well ready to be back yet. <laughs> that is fair. <laughs> welcome back for now. <laughs> right. Welcome back right. later. <laughs> Bye chat. See you later. Bye. Good Catch up. Have a good stream. So I'm not gonna lie. Look, uh, I like it. It doesn't look like nothing but optimism from that post. I, I'm gonna be honest. I, it seems like there's a decent bit to it. I don't know how extensive each system goes, but there is quite a bit of new things uh, and stuff. Chat, you want to know something cool about BLC? They finally added folders. Oh, <laughs> they finally added waypoint folders. Finally. So now I can do this. Glacite caves. Um, add waypoint. 
Oh, the bangs. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? Aquamarine. I think that they should move Skyblock on its own server IP. No. No. Just give it a. Just give it an IP. Like, just make it. If you want to do all that, just make you know, it, give it its own custom thing so you log in. Allow people to log in the current way, but if you, if we really need to, I guess, add like a redirect, I guess, if or you just, really or, want. Or, you know what's easier? Just add a preferred game to spawn into, and then you just join the IP, and it remembers based on your account to spawn you into the preferred game. So, chat, this might be a bit tedious, so bear with me. I'm, I'm going to, I am going to input all of the waypoints here so that i can navigate I mean, this new area you're pressing more than two buttons so it's, it's a little <laughs> more true. stimulating than other things the screen isn't moving at all though so fish brains guys look at the bottom left see there's a little see the little do blinking, i need to get some text box? <laughs> some subway surfers yeah we need some subway surfers <laughs> you know it's crazy i've never played that game or anything like it i played temple i played temple <laughs> run you never twice. played subway surfers yeah, I played Temple Run twice, like right when it came out, and then never again. I didn't own a phone for most of my school career, and I played Temple Run. <laughs> I've also never played Clash Royale. I've never played any of the Clash anything. By the way, I am going to supply... I'll update my BLC profile so everybody can benefit from what I'm doing right now. You're welcome. That's five gifted for that. That yes. sounds like five as, gifted. As payment, not even as gifted. Payment. As payment, I want every single person that's not on my Twitch stream to go to my Twitch stream and use your Prime sub. I know you have one. Get it, it is to be. a requirement. It's it, it costs nothing for you, and it gives me free money. So, like, that is, we, that is an appropriate why, payment. Why do we have a highlighted message redeemed about the Federal Reserve? <laughs> <laughs> Is there an update on that? I'm pretty Wait, sure what? that did something happen? I'm pretty sure the next Fed meeting isn't for a while. The last one was in March. Yeah, even then it's just... even then it's news that like no one in the Skyblock community really <laughs> cares about. This I only care because I'm like plugged into this the world of investing in stocks. And even then I don't really look at it. It's all ETFs. <sighs> Okay, I know this has been tedious, but we're almost done, chat. Peridot. You like shit. Ooh! What? Three out of five. Three out of five? Hell yeah. <laughs> I'll read all the donos once we uh, have all this typed oh. in, and we're heading towards Onyx. <coughs> well, Peridot. Two. One, one, four. One, two, five. Three, nine, four. Nice. Uh, there we go. Now, if I turn on the waypoints mod, I should see everything. Whoa, look at that. Beautiful. Now we can actually navigate this place. So I need to get to... Oh, let's catch up on donuts. Uh, Buff Luigi. <laughs> Buff Luigi. Oh. I mean... There should be two I Fs. Think you, you did pronounce it how it's spelled also. I, yeah, Maybe. I pronounced it how it's spelled. <laughs> but I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be Buff Luigi. <laughs> <laughs> Lego dude, thank you for the prime. Nil Jim, thank you for the gifted sub. Hell yeah. Sim Vindor, thank you for the prime. Niljan, thank you for another five. Use your Prime subs. Yes, use your Prime subs now. Let's get that counter to over 100 so I can update the goal. Plat G underscore Attaboy. Thank you for the Prime. Matt Scoboy. <laughs> thank you for the Prime. Luna's little... I don't know if I should say that one. Thank you for the um, that third word there. Thank you for the 2A. Most handsome Skyblock player. Oh, thank you. I try, but no, I don't actually. Not in recent months. <laughs> I the last time I was in the I gym try, was. But I don't. I did try for about a year with fitness, and I'm gonna try again very soon once Ford or no, Ford, once um farming is done. But I'm hyper focusing on farming, and I can't I can't stop it. 
I can't do anything productive until I'm done farming. That's just how it works now. Um, <laughs> did I catch up? Oh, what's up, Randy? Thank you for the 20 months of member. <laughs> Hell yeah. Got another prime. Thank you, Phantom at base. Thank you for the prime. Nodded alpaca for the two. Take stereo pants. Oh, that, that was from an hour ago. I think we're caught up now. Hell yeah. Ander Iman. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you for the prime. Hell yeah. All right, let's find some onyx. I want to see some onyx. Is that what this purple gem is? <clears throat> no, that's... That's, um, I forgot what it's called. By the way, somebody asked how primes work. If you have Amazon Prime and you link your Twitch to your Amazon account, you will receive a free sub you can give to somebody each month, a free tier one sub. There was one Onyx. The reason I was confused is because some other guy got it. That makes a lot of sense. I was very confused. I think Onyx might be in high demand. It appears to be in high demand. I think people want the travel scroll and I don't blame them. This process is very annoying. Having to teleport all the way back. What does Onyx give? It's the, you need one flawless Onyx in order to craft the travel scroll to base camp which is just going to be infinitely better than not having it. So I, I'm making that a priority right now. It takes seven or eight hours to forge. So it's not that big a priority, I guess. That's one for tomorrow. But I definitely need to start forging it today. 100%. What? Oh. Oh, yeah. I completely forgot. Isn't there that mechanic that, like, opens up a new cavern? Where's that at? Oh, there's, like, little structures here. Interesting. Want to get a fairy soul? Sure. What should I order? Go. Chinese food. No. <laughs> Use your prime subs. <laughs> I don't think I have any decent places around. I had Panda Express the other day and it was really good actually. Then again, that might be the munchies talking. Because a few times before that when I got Panda Express, it was very mid. Uh light bulb, thank you for the five. Fezzy Fezzy or you should give us a freestyle. <laughs> no. But well, thank you. <laughs> yeah, if you want that, you're gonna have to use an AI voice model. Uh, I will not be doing that. I wouldn't do it to save your life. <laughs> I wouldn't do it to save my life. <laughs> yes, you would. Let's be honest. I would. And I absolutely hate music <laughs> with lyrics. <laughs> Dude, I need somebody to put a gun to someone's head so I can hear 30 just belt. You know? Just like until it turns out that I'm actually goaded at it. Like <laughs> This has the most angelic voice. You know, with enough practice... I do think oh I had, there's enough variance in my, in pitch. I have a lot of, there's a term for this. I have a lot of vocal flexibility. If I really practice at range. it. Range. Range. There you go. If I really practice at it, I could probably do like about a dozen impressions and actually be good at singing. But because of my social Dude, awkwardness, I, I will it, never do that. Honest. I <laughs> wish I could not. do impressions. If someone was able to puppet my body, and control <laughs> my vocal cords and use them that probably it would sound great but no, man that social anxiety hits Dude, i wish i just didn't have it yeah life would be so much easier without it you know what really makes me disappointed <laughs> in myself like this is it's a little dark um there was a health scare with my grandma like a week ago like she could have died and my social anxiety prevented me from calling her. I felt really bad. I've had similar kind of things happen. I... That potentially could have been my last chance and I was too socially anxious. Like I really need to get over myself. It's bad. I need help. I need, I need, I need help. Luckily it wasn't my last <clears throat> chance, but yeah, it's bad. Social anxiety is like, 
it, I don't understand how that works because I'm here talking to over 2,000 people between yeah, it both. Just doesn't, like, it, it just, just doesn't, doesn't even apply here. You know what's weird? I get more socially anxious on a one on one with you than in front of 500 people. Isn't that weird? <laughs> Doesn't that make no sense? I don't know. I don't know. 30 sub goal? Oh, hey, we hit the sub goal. Nice. You know what? W, raise it. Yeah, we're going to raise it. So, you know what's funny is that if you notice in like the videos, anytime there's a clip from a stream, you'll notice that the sub count keeps going lower and lower because I've been streaming less and less. It was at almost 400 at one point, and now we're at 100. But I promise you, this is a 100% chance of happening. Once I'm done with farming, then I'll be back to my normal self, streaming a few times a week. I'm just so hyper-focused. This is the same thing that happened with Space Summit. It's the same exact thing. So I've been like itching to upload to Pepsi, but I have no idea what to upload to. But I've been kind of itching to do it, just to see. Social anxiety scales with confidence, I think. What does that, what do you even mean what by that? What does that mean? Yeah, what do you mean by that sentence? That doesn't make any like sense. Like the more confident, the more anxious? Cause that seems not That right. doesn't, hey. it does seem, oh, hello. What's up, Grinishal? Dude, it's been goaded since the start, honestly. Like it's been years. But I still remember <clears throat> the times when Grinishal gifted like a hundred subs at a time. Like it was nothing. Like <laughs> much appreciated, Grinishal. Very much appreciated. What happened with the Bon Armor price? Oh, did they like shoot up? Probably. Oh no! I griefed the guy and he knew it was me. I'm sorry. It's steal or be stolen from. I'm sorry. There's like two veins of onyx in this entire cave. <laughs> and I want the travel scroll. <laughs> if it makes you feel any better, it wasn't personal. It never is. When I'm in grind mode, I don't like, I just go for the resources and I don't even pay attention to the usernames of who's in my way. So where's the base camp? Am I dumb? There's, there should be a waypoint for, oh, it's right here. Oh God. Oh no. How do I get back? I need to get back to the camp. There we go. Is your grandma better now? Uh, it's okay. TLDR. She started taking some medication. The dose was upped recently and a lot of nosebleeds that turned out to be hemorrhaging, I think, or at least that was the theory. So it was not good. It was very serious for about six hours, but we're good now ish. I think I hope she turns out all right. I'm going to have to apologize when I finally do call. My social anxiety is terrible, but that's not an excuse. What would you rate this update out of 10? Don't know. Haven't been playing it long enough. What is your first impression? Of that? I like it. The fact that I haven't even been in one of those like external caverns yet, and I'm still enjoying this. I don't know. I, I like the environment. I like the fact that it expanded on Dwarven Mines because Dwarven Mines kind of for a while seemed like a waste. It's just the thing you have to do before Crystal Hollows. So having the progression kind of loop back kind of cool does is this is this looping back as in like you need to go through the crystal hollows to come back to this to do it or is no. this doable before you even get to the crystal i'm talking more from a lore standpoint because like okay. we're in the same lobby as dwarven mines right now we're just behind the gray ice wall uh, the loot to key ratio is not good um Looter wants me to join. Can I warp? Yes, you can warp. Ah, what is this? What did I just fall into? Looter just found a portal, I think. Yep. I didn't even know you could warp people in these. What? You can do that? Oh. How 
How are you doing, 30? My daughter took her first steps yesterday. Oh, hell yeah. Well, hey, that's exciting. Bestiary, rare drop glacite shard, new power stone. There's so many things happening right now. I'm doing good. Uh, to be honest, I'll be 100% with you, chat. My mental health has not been in a great place. But we're on the up and up. We are on the... Okay, the entrance just caved in. I'm assuming now warps don't work. There's mobs in here, right? Glacite mutt. Dead. Oh, so that's what she meant by bestiary. Okay, and there's also a dude here. I love how, like, we've just settled on that pronunciation. Pronunciation, even though it's just wrong. What's it? Glacite? <laughs> no, bestiary. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Glacite? <laughs> Glacite. I'm pretty sure Glacite's right. I hope it is. And if it's not, I'm, it's wrong. Then, then, then that's wrong. Use a gauntlet. Glacite's it does good better. damage. Do I have to pull my gemstone gauntlet out of retirement? No way. Also, are there like any gemstones in here or is it all... Ice. Glacite. Ice. <laughs> and umber. You can use drill. Damage is multiplied by your breaking power. Oh. Well, considering I have breaking power 10, that should be helpful. Come here. Your scoreboard. It's an umber mine shaft. <clears throat> oh, it is. Okay. Hello, looter. What, what would you like to show me? There's some dudes. A bowman. Oh, there's a corpse. Oh, <laughs> that sounded so weird out of context. <laughs> the way you said that. I was, oh, there's a corpse. I was so excited. Look at that. Frozen corpse loot. Fine citrine gemstone, two goblin egg, aquamarine gemstone, peridot gemstone, and most importantly, glacite powder. And we just got a commission. That was a commission right there. So we have commissions in this Poor new area. Got lost in Lapis, what if? Well, actually, no. I heard. Is it Lapis or is it? There's like a hero armor. What? What's it called, Chad? It's like some weird name for like in the game files for an upgrade to Devon that might not even exist. <laughs> the blue armor. Yeah, I don't remember what it was called. I found another one. Ooh. How do you find them? They're just randomly? It's getting so cold you can barely feel your fingers. This is Minecraft. You don't have fingers. <laughs> oh, there, this has a reverse heat mechanic. You can get too cold. Yes. Interesting. Is there an armor set that re reduces that? Vanguard armor. That's what it's called. Mm. You can't teleport in here either. Interesting. How do you find Turn these? Said that undoes the cold. More glacite powder. Another corpse. So the goal is to find suspicious scrap, right? <clears throat> because that's how you get the new pets. There's gloves that give cold resistance. Oh, I'm aware. Tab. What do you mean for tab? <coughs> oh, so there's a... So there's two lapis armor ones that are looted and one tungsten that isn't. And that requires a key, I'd imagine, right? Because tungsten keys are a thing. Right middle. Oh, and there's a bestiary. So wait, why is it out of two, four, and six? Are there like... I'm so confused. So is that like a goal for the mine shaft? Also, I just missed the tungsten guy. No, let me back up there. The tungsten corpse, right? Yeah, he's in mineral armor. You need to be holding a tungsten key to unlock this corpse. Sad. So we can't do that. Can I at least complete the bestiary? I need to kill one more mutt. Two more mages, one more caver, and one more bowman. I gotta find them. Unless they're already dead. They might already be dead. You can build with cobble. Oh. 
That's just info. Oh, on how many are in the... Oh, interesting. All four commission slots are taken up by different commissions than the other ones. Oh, that makes sense. It's technically a different biome. Yep. Man, the lack of teleporting is really throwing me through a loop here. Apparently you can build. Okay, so I can at least place cobble. We can't die to frostbite. We can die to frostbite. Well, it seems like I'm about to, so let's get out of here. Bro, just like put on a coat. I'm sure that something to that effect exists. A gauntlet. Let me leave. Oh, I have to click. There's a gauntlet. You got a 1,000 glacite powder bonus for leaving a mine shaft before you died. Interesting. <laughs> also, that's a level 100 legendary T-Rex. How? The, the update came out two hours ago. Three hours ago. How? How is this and possible? They have been going hard for three hours. Oh, it's buddy. an MP. This is an NPC. <laughs> Fossil arm. No, I mean, I, I, he's been here for three hours. You know, technically, if you use the Catechus Feeder twice and then just instantly ran into, like, flares. Maybe. I like that name. So we got some Peridot. I'm still focused on the Onyx for the scroll. Is it actually pronounced Peridot or Peridot? I don't know. Let's get some Onyx. Has he already gone through the patch notes for the foraging update? Yeah. Yes. Okay. It seems to me, like straight out the gate, Onyx is the highest demand gemstone, probably because people don't want to navigate back to the base camp, which is entirely fair. It's kind of annoying how I have to keep constantly switching back and forth between efficient miner being enabled and disabled. That is quite annoying. It's been years since I placed Badlog, a lot of changes. How many years? Yeah, it really depends when you quit. If it's been like three years, yes. This is an <laughs> entirely lot, different lot. game. If it's, been like, if it's been like three years, it's a different game. Like straight up, not even the same game. Not even the same no, not genre. Even, not even remotely. Like it's, it's, it is crazy how much. 2019. <laughs> yeah, not even the shame, the shame, the same genre. Not even the shame game, dude. <laughs> not even. <laughs> oh. I have to actually upload my profile again. Whoops, my bad. <clears throat> Share. Um, for those that want to get all these waypoints and everything else with my BLC profile, you press right shift, go to profiles, click search, 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 <laughs> 30. <laughs> oh, you don't even search 30 bars. You, you go to most popular or no, you do most recent. Yeah, this is a fake one. It has 21,000 downloads. It's made by someone that's not me. Go to most recent. It's actually funny. Most recent. There I am. I just uploaded it. There you go. Make sure to check that author name, people. Read the patch notes. Are they out for this? Oh, we got some citrine. I'm kind of walking around aimlessly for now, just mining whatever the hell, but primarily trying to get the travel scroll because I'm <clears> impatient. <throat> Nomers, thank you for the, for joining. <laughs> thank you for joining on YouTube. I am sad because there is not a lot of onyx. It's quite annoying, actually. There is patch notes for glacier tunnels. Okay. Well, after I mine this and get back to base camp, then we can do that. LF. Warp? What's LF mean? Let's freaking warp. What does LF mean? I am Let's boomer. Oh, looking for. Just tell me to warp then. <laughs> Why'd you have to confuse me? Just say warp. <laughs> Is this how I feel when I try to teach my parents how to do anything tech related? Is that what's happening? 
Or you. Or you. <laughs> well, that's what I mean. Is the way the viewers feel Dude. about teaching me is how I feel teaching my mom about anything tech related. I don't know, man. I had to like slowly walk you through how to make a Discord group chat. Like, <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, that was years ago. <laughs> I know, but it was really funny. I will be back. What? Now I'm gonna swear. For your information, there's a YouTube stream going on. Actually, I probably shouldn't. I haven't even looked at the YouTube stream. Yo, how is the YouTube frogs going? Frick! I just closed the tab. Is there a cap on the interest in the bank? I think there technically is because there's a max amount you can store. <sighs> Wow, YouTube chat, you are devolved into nothing. I mean, I can't even talk to you. Oh, is Look it all? Is it all sentences. egg? It's egg. YouTube is sad. Is hot M10 out? <laughs> oh, by the way, I've been having to read two different chat feeds the whole stream. Technically I'm gonna. Three. I'm gonna need. No, actually, I combined at least two out of the three. Twitch and Kick. <laughs> by the way, Kick has like no one there, but you do show up in my chat. I can see you. If you're on the kick stream, but, um, YouTube, the bot is being dumb. So I'm going to need chat's help. Maybe potentially your help. If you have the ability Fezzy, there is a, what? there is a bot that I am using to produce a chat widget in OBS that lets me read a combined chat. So I don't have to look at three different chats. It's called bot Ricks. What do you need help? Connecting it to YouTube. There's either a command or I have to mod the bot. It's just not, it's not like it is on the other profiles and I don't know how to get it to work. And it's really annoying. All I do know is that a yep. YouTube stream has to currently be active in order to fully set up the bot, which means I can't do this I'll offline. I'll tell you this, chat bots are not my specialty. <laughs> Definitely not my specialty. But yeah, what... Sorry, I just got like so distracted by the music that stun started locked. playing. Yeah, I got stun locked because I was like, wait, I recognize this music. Uh, neuron activation. <laughs> this is in a video. <laughs> yeah, I updated the playlist. It is, I think, double the size of the previous playlist. You talking about music? Yeah, yeah, the, the stream playlist is different now. Oh. It uses a lot of the new music that you've been introducing over the past year and some new stuff that I found myself. I don't even remember what i've been introducing for the past year wait i can't name a single okay. artist that i've introduced oh, this, this is know. hurting my fish brain is it just hurts my brain i keep going back and forth between gemstones and not gemstones and i have the wrong efficient miner both times it's annoying ah i need to focus one thing at a time all right fine we're going gems we're going all in on gemstones forget about efficient miner once i get the onyx then i'll worry about this and this god i hate my attention span so freaking much easy what happened to refresh? also looters trying to get my attention follow for the fairy soul i, I am paying I attention i've had a i've had a i've been in a call with oh. refraction a grand total of one time ever i'm pretty sure so i don't know for me i think twice so we're inside of the frozen lake right now that's kind of cool oh fairy soul that was needlessly loud <laughs> Why does the fairy soul come with a jet engine? Yeah, exactly. What happened with Dragon Rush update? Um, a lot of people, me included, were very alarmed and disappointed with the concept of let's just take this grind that's already finished and extend it 800 hours further than it should just to get an armor set that's way too powerful and boring to get and just kills the entirety of Crimson Isles. It power creeps the entirety of Crimson Isles. So I did not like it at all. And it should die. It, that The primal dragons thing needs to never see the light of day in any capacity. I just don't like it. 
good news. It's coming out next week. By the way, exactly do we, how you know it's coming out. Do we have anybody doing research on that bot? I would like to get my YouTube chat lumped in with the other so I don't have to keep looking I like I forgot what it's called. Buddy. It's called bot it's Rex. Hopeless. I'm gonna I'm gonna, gonna it type again. it in YouTube chat. It's called Bot Ricks. That's what I'm using to read multiple chats at once. How do we how do you do it? There might be a command, there might be a way to summon the bot. I'm not sure. Maybe you can say his name enough, he'll show up. Looter wants to show me something else. What is it? <clears throat> what the, would you like to show me? Where are we going? Oh, there's a lot of onyx here. What the hell? This lobby hasn't been picked clean here. Or at least it came back in the past five minutes. What do you mean you don't want to grind 64 eyes? <laughs> for, for like two dragons. And like a 2% chance for it to be primal. It's so dumb. It's crazy how they just like hit gold with that first dragon update. And then it just took a while for them to like figure it out again. I thought it was against Twitch TOS to combine chats. It is. That's why the one on screen is chat. <laughs> yeah. And the one that I see is the combined chat. Yeah, it's it's only on stream that's an issue. Do you see me, Sire 30? <laughs> yes. I can see Twitch and Kick Chat on my right monitor, my right chat feed, and on the left monitor, the left chat feed is YouTube, and I want to combine all three, and that's why, I, and I'm struggling with the bot. I don't know how to, it's very annoying. I still don't know, I still haven't gotten an answer of what to order. What do I order? 30's vote was, was thrown away. Get a so, pigeon? I don't want to eat a pigeon. I have a royal pigeon right here. Oh, I should probably do one of these, right? There we go. Wait. Does combined chat work through? That was the wrong one. Wrong one. I don't think so. There we go. Oh, wait, no, it's 7TV. I was thinking of Shade Chat. I don't know. Oh, Does 7TV do combined chat? That would be convenient. So far, the best bot I've found for combining chats is this one. Well, good for you that 7TV is not a bot. <laughs> oh, I didn't hear service. that. <laughs> Whatever. Why don't you want a pigeon for food? How do pigeons taste? Does anyone I don't know. I'd imagine it tastes like a pigeon. <laughs> You don't have to use Restream to distribute your stream, but they have a piece of software that combines the chats. Yeah, but you got to pay for it for more than two platforms at once. I'm not paying for that. Ew. It's so close to working, bro. We just got to get the bot to work in YouTube chat. And like I said, I can't set this up while there is no YouTube stream running. So I, we either have to do it now or we're going to have to wait until next stream and we'll just have the same problem again. That seems like a huge problem. I mean, you seem like you're you're trucking. It's just an extra window. I've been well. I'm gonna be honest. I've been reading the feed on the right because it better aligns with where my neck is. <laughs> I, I I don't have to look as far away. I don't want to neglect YouTube chat long term. Ah, uh, you guys don't care, do you? YouTube chat. One of, one of the biggest <laughs> barriers to entry mentally, because like I said, mental health hasn't been great, has been this chat issue. So getting this fixed would be very good. We'll just not read YouTube chat. You guys don't care, do you? You don't care. Piggy underscore Twitch. Thank you for the, for, <laughs> thank you for the prime. <laughs> Legendary Mr. Duck 11. Thank you for the prime. All right, we gotta go back to base camp. I wonder if we have enough onyx to make the scroll now. We don't. All right, hold on, I'll mine one more.
So just double check blue egg still works all for all but one ability. That ability better be mining speed boost. Or no, it better not be. Better not be mining speed boost. We're about to die. Not an alpaca. They give it the two. Tech is why I love having millennial parents. <clears throat> oh, you probably do. You probably do. You if you had millennial parents, I think the likelihood of you being a Linux is statistically higher. Probably. I've been hearing stories about how people like play video games with their parents, and I'm like, damn, that's kind of crazy. <laughs> yeah. I never had that. I tried to teach my mom how to play Call of Duty and she died like 17 times because she couldn't figure Probably. out how to look forward. I found a video on what you were trying to do with multi-chat. Would you like me to send it to you? Um, you know what? Here's how we're going to do this discourse. Uh, go to the suggestions chat on my Discord and I'll have that as a third chat that I look at for any relevant info on how to fix the bot. Assuming I could even find the suggestions chat. Where is it? Did they move it? Hold on. Oh, here it is. In the suggestions general chat. On my Discord. Discord.gg slash 30 virus. Hashtag suggestions dash general. It's in like the third or fourth category when you scroll down. So if you have any info on how to get it working properly the bot that's where it goes that would be much appreciated all right let's continue getting onyx we're very close to being able to get the forge started on that oh what's this citrine citrine sounds like a chemical I think citru L citrulline is one of the main components of uh, pre workout. So, yes. <laughs> so, close enough. So, you're mining pre workout. <laughs> Exciting stuff. L citrulline is very different from. I've already forgotten the name of the gemstone. <laughs> citrulline. Citrulline. The guy with level 100 T-Rex gives you free scrap. Nice. Well, once we have 512 Onyx, 512K, which we do, we're home free. Uh, let's go to the camp. If I can find my way back. Yeah, having travel scroll is gonna be pretty nice tomorrow. All right, we're back. So T-Rex guy, you. A fresh face in these. If I just randomly jump when I mean to click, by the way, that's the brain rot that comes with farming. <sighs> Name's Soren. And before you, before you ask, no, I'm not here for the camaraderie. 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 <laughs> that's that had the same energy as Res Endeavorous or whatever I said. <laughs> in some Res Endeavorous. I'm also here to require rare items. Why did my 7 TV stop working? I can't see the- And not a single person has posted in the suggestions chat. Big sad. I guess we're just doomed. Suspicious scrap found within the deepest depths of the Glacite tunnel. Place in the fossil excavator to- Okay. I know exactly what's about to happen and I'm queuing up the music for it because I can't help it. Nostalgia is too strong. Uh huh. Give me a minute. You won't know what I mean until you hear it. Actually, you probably wouldn't even get it. I'll do that. Uh, there's a very specific song. I don't even remember what it's called. Okay, mom. I'm very confused. <laughs> My experiences with Skyblock have been very satisfactory lately. I hope to spend more hands on the clock in touch with this video game. Okay, Sire I found 30. it. <laughs> Why are your out? What are your hours on this profile? Way too high. 
good enough. Four thousand seven hundred and fifty hours. Getting close to the big five k. Yeah. That's half of the time it takes to master something. Don't use that. I'm nicked. It's gonna waste it. It's gonna waste it. Don't do it. <laughs> Don't do it. No. You don't understand. <laughs> It's not going to work. <laughs> All right. I need to turn off the music for this. Uh, okay. It's going to, I'm going to look really stupid if this is the wrong song. There it is. Damn, it's loud. All of 10 people in chat are gonna get the reference. Is this just Minesweeper? This is literally the mini game from Pokemon Diamond and Pearl. It just is. Ooh. Is it? If I reveal too much of it, it's going to break the entire board. I only get two more. Oh, there we go. Da, 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 da. Oh, there was fossil dust. Enchanted glacite. Oh there, we did it. It's like one for one. <laughs> it's like one for one. The there were no game. fossils in there, unfortunately. But we got a flawed onyx and three flawed aquamarine. Did you get portal? I don't know. I don't know what you mean by that. <laughs> but anyways, that's what that mini game is. Uh, you click to reveal stuff, and sometimes there's things that are not just a one by one, but it's like a whole structure. You have to reveal the whole thing. How'd you get that scrap from this guy? He gave me one. We'll cross paths again, I'm sure. Yeah, every time I teleport here. <laughs> What button do you need to press to go to your BLC profile? Uh, right shift. Okay. Recipe Onyx. I love this update, by the way, because look what I'm about to do. Without having to touch the personal compactor at all, Now we have enough onyx to make, hopefully, a flawless onyx gemstone. And we can take this to Le Forge. You can shift click in the super craft to craft as much as, much as you can. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah, I don't know why I can't speak. I can't either. Well, I kind of know why. <laughs> my Invisalign trays recently got taken off, and this is a retainer, which is thicker, so it makes it hard to see. See my brain. That's why I can't. I have forgotten why I'm here. Oh. Travel school, scroll alive. to Dwarven Base Camp. So it's coins and pearls. Easy. I knew I left that slot open for a purpose. Travel scroll to the Dwarven base camp. Boom. Shit. Sorry. Shift <laughs> to craft <laughs> max amount. <laughs> uh, that was out of nowhere. Shift. You know, you know, it'd be to funny. craft the max amount. I was reading chat messages. You know, it'd be funny is if you cut yourself right after you say the swear like you just yeah all right like in the video hey, you just straight up swear and there's no cons there's, just, there's no um i almost said concept context uh, yeah my brain's no not concept. working okay i think you know the mentality of no, you know <laughs> you know the mentality of use it or lose it i streamed once last month and once the month before that and i think it's finally starting to take a toll on my brain honestly 
you're lucky your stream stuff still works because I str I tried streaming the other day and all of my alerts and overlays stopped functioning entirely. <laughs> they not a single thing works anymore. Too much garden. I haven't touched True. them. They just died. It's just it's working. the garden brain rot. That's what's happening. Oh, Zachro Miner, welcome back. Thank you for the two pounds. Haven't played this game for a while. It's up there. Yeah, welcome back. How long a while? How long? <laughs> So what's the goal now? I got the travel scroll, so... <laughs> wow. What's the next uh, thing here? So we have tungsten and umber. Is there anything interesting I want? What's umber dice? Guess we'll never find out. Uh... <laughs> coming soon means not coming. Refined umber. Rub. Umber is key. Is that, is that rock deal? Okay, Umber Plate is interesting. Wait, is that Rob Yarn? Where? He's, he's right there. Sar. There's three chats Sar. I have to look at. The purple one. Twitch. No. I... Lost him. Don't see him. He, he, thanks for the tier one, Rob. <laughs> oh, sure. oh, oh. I see that in the Streamlabs feed. Bro, there's like seven different feeds I have to read. There's Minecraft chat, there's YouTube chat, there's the combined Twitch and Kick chat, there's the Dono chat, there's the Discord chat. Ah! Sorry. Um, but thank you for the T1 rock. <laughs> Sir Dan Demand. Thank you for the prime. Taco John's makes taco pizza now? There's oh, a place. No. There's a place called Taco John's. You don't kind of funny. We don't have those in New York or Florida. Is that is Taco John's regional? Okay, someone linked the tutorial on how to set up Botrix. I really can someone get the TLDR and text form on how to do it on YouTube because Rob everything else is already... again. Oh, thank you for another five gifted Rob Bjorn. Hell yeah. You need the necklace and talismans. No, tell me someone in chat knows Taco John's. Don't tell me it's like something that only exists here. There's no way. I guess that's we like should. A, that's like a major regional chain. You know uh, what? Let's focus on commissions for now. Let's do that. All right. So we're going to start by collecting Glacite. Let's do that. The commissions. Should I order a taco will... pizza just to see? That doesn't sound like it would be good. It sounds awful. But I could get 15% off. <laughs> Wait! Just wasted a third of my efficient miner on that. Commission completed. I'm not gonna lie, this pizza looks like trash. Dude, I. Can we, like, start a commission? Can we. Or a commission? Uh, petition! Petition! Can we start a commission? Uh, can we yes, start we can. a petition? To just straight up make efficient miner not work on gemstones, so I don't have to swap every three seconds, because it's really freaking annoying. Your first mistake is thinking commissions do anything. <laughs> I mean, ah, uh, see what you've done. <laughs> <laughs> Discover. Oh. <laughs> nice. Discover. I, discover I get two commissions for discovering a mine shaft. Nice. What does tungsten look like? We're tungsten. What a disgrace of a pizza in my days we enjoyed jellied eels, young sire. You type like an elite dangerous viewer. <laughs> jellied eel? You type you type you, you type with perfect punctuation and complete sentences, which oh, means Oh, it looks like cobblestone, okay. You can't be a skyblock player. Ain't no way. You hear about the upcoming <laughs> Ed update? They bringing new ships out. Oh, ED update. <laughs> Elite Dangerous. Oh, so elite Dangerous. Yes, I thought I Eating Disorder. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> I thought they just typed something wrong. Maybe End Update? I don't know. Uh, yes. I'm very excited. I'm really excited about Powerful A2. I want it so bad. Oh, also, literally tomorrow we're getting a new uh, FSD. Tomorrow. Oh. It's coming out tomorrow. Things you are know, looking nobody up. Nobody knows what an FSD is. Things are looking up for the games that we enjoy, it, it would seem. Because we just got a video from the tier list I recorded, and I'd say three days of this is a video, probably. I don't know, maybe, honestly, 
I don't think so. With the, you up, know what, with you, the you update know what, day content, do we just go yeah, back to the old format my, for a little bit? My, I was going to wait till after stream to recommend this to you, but I'm not going to anymore. So here's what, <laughs> here's what my opinion is. Update video, tier list, update video. Or well, new content update. No, sorry. <laughs> new content. So this would come out first, probably tomorrow. And then, and then a tier list, and then we follow up. Interesting. That was my idea. Yeah, I honestly agree because if you think about the idea of Iron Man as a playlist, well, congratulations, general, Chad, You just heard our content schedule. For general <laughs> progression. Well, I think we're gonna go back to like a hard every five days schedule because I think we'll have enough content to fuel that. Because, like I said, farming is gonna be over soon, so saying, update content. Maybe even twice in a row. Nah, I think splitting it up I mean, would be good. Can. Update content, I tier list, update up, yeah. content, farming. Sure. Then if also get something... garden rot, I, I haven't, no, no, I didn't. I'm, I luckily stepped out before that could take hold. It's bad though, dude, it is really bad. Like, yeah. I, <laughs> I don't know. Like banana pizza, no, sounds awful. Sometimes when I'm in the middle of farming and I think about how long the process is, it brings me to a dark place mentally. It's like not good. I oh, hate last, how stubborn last, my brain is. The last couple days to a week, I have just been sitting at night in deep thought in darkness. It has been a weird time period for me. Same. Just total darkness. Just oh, we have someone in uh, the... Okay, I have streamer mode enabled on Discord, so I don't know who G is, but you're a YouTube member. So thank you, G, <laughs> for giving the making... suggestion. Thank you, G. Is <laughs> still making videos on his secret channel? Not only am I still making videos, I got the most views I've ever gotten on a single video on that. He channel. has multiple secret channels as well. I do. I have multiple. One of them is monetized and doing surprisingly well. We need to go back to base camp. Man, I cannot wait to have that stupid power scroll because this is annoying. Um, oh, wow. Uh, Matthew the Hacker, they give a $10 super chat, man. <laughs> Hello, 30. It's been a while. I haven't touched the game in a long time since I got banned from Skyblock. I have a question. <laughs> Just going to glaze over that one. Uh, could you and Fezzy do something like Sky Factory 4? We'd love to. But we would love to. In. We would love to, but I mean. Algo. Okay. Algo Rhythm. I want you to go to youtube.com slash 30 buyers <laughs> and look at the most recent video right now. Yeah. And so, then look yeah. at its views relative to the video. Granted, that one was, that one, before was the, that one was extreme. That one wasn't yeah. from your perspective. It was a different editing style. It was different. It was a video technically that was made for a different channel. <laughs> it, not even technically. It literally was. And then we were like, what if April Fool's? <laughs> and what if we yeah. did? And boy, it flopped. It was I'm not bad. Unhappy that it's up, though. Neither am I, to be honest. Honestly, with we might be able to repackage it and save it. It's just gonna take some time. Started with No Man's Sky like five days ago, but my ED fanatic coworker isn't happy though, and I'm not happy about it either, Rob Bjorn. Oh, and not at Alpaca. Thank you for we the. We only accept one space game. In two. Place. A Smash Tuber made his tier list as one vid per tier. That. For how many heroes are there in Smash? What? He Smash? <laughs> Where is this going? How I'm many? Lost. Someone did a tier list of all the characters in Smash and apparently made a specific. You're so cool. You're so cool <laughs> for that. Man, you made that stream so much better for doing that. Words. Where are my AirPods? What? <laughs> I'm so confused. The set, okay, lost. the feature's broken. I have my Where AirPods my in. AirPods? I have my AirPods oh, in. They're just I not working. It. I get it. I know what you mean. No, all right. Well, me a minute. all right. Because of you, sir, unfortunately, we have to ruin it for everybody else. So time to put up the barriers. Guardrails. Time to put up the child. It's been a while since we've been in anti-snipe mode. It's been a long while. All right, we're gonna change lobbies. Bro, is your full name Fezwald? It nice. has been a long time Could since be. I've had to do the anti-snipe, but you, sir, congratulations. Oh, and Jaden, thank you for the 100 bits. Can you look at the top left mining ability? It's better than mining speed boost. Really? You get pristine and fortune? Whoa. What? <laughs> 
increases the effectiveness of every gemstone in your picks gemstone slots by 50% for 16 seconds. Okay, so I would get 25 mining fortune and 50 mining speed. That doesn't sound good. <laughs> With blue egg, it's 75%. <laughs> that still doesn't sound that good, I'm gonna be oh. honest. Oh, actually, hold on, hold on. It's the pristine, right? That's what matters. It's the pristine. So it would be plus one pristine. Is it just with the pick or does it also, well, it says the pick. What about artifact of power? Out the gate, doesn't look that great. I'm gonna be honest, but pristine's calculation is weird. So maybe, I don't know. I did it again. The garden brain rot. I jumped when I meant to click. Oh, Matthew, thank you for another five. Episode four of Sky Factory 4 has 200k views and your most recent bit is 28k views. That's mm -hmm. not, no. <laughs> the most recent one was an April Fool's video that flopped and the Sky Factory out videos the, were from a different time. They're from a different <laughs> okay. time and they did not perform that great out the gate. And look no. at the view drop off once the series like got to about like episode eight onwards. Then you'll see why we stopped. It hard fell off. It felt like the beginning few episodes, we were really hopeful, but it's We not. were. It was like, damn, this is like really working. And then it wasn't. Then it wasn't. <laughs> then it was Collect 1500 Galacite. All right. So can you open a mine shaft by mining this? Or does it have to be gemstones? Why not play what you want and not care about the views? Because uh, then we wouldn't have a house. <laughs> <laughs> then or electricity. Then I wouldn't be able to pay my mortgage. <laughs> <laughs> um, it could be anything, but the resources inside the mine shafts are dependent on what you're mining. So if I mine glacite, then I'll open a glacite cave. That makes sense. Can YouTubers still do coin giveaways on stream or not? I think that there are circumstances in which you can, but probably shouldn't. Apparently, not necessarily, according to Jaden. So, I don't know. It's just a more... Oh, it's just a higher chance for a Glacite one. I see. Where are the commissions? I think I'm mining far too long for these commissions. Obtain one scrap. Okay, well, we're not doing that anymore. Uh, I guess Aquamarine, then. There was a really funny moment at the start of this stream when I started listing off all of the benefits that I already have for Heart of the Mountain and thought that's what you get for upgrading your Heart of the Mountain. So you'll have fun with that one. <laughs> Me just taking all the buffs that I already have and going, wait, I could get even more of that? Like, no. <laughs> I'm angry at Hypixel. My friend was given 350 mil from his friend and he got banned and got my profile wiped for boosting. I mean, unfortunate, but technically, isn't it? I don't know, man. I just, I'm very glad I'm an Iron Man player is all I'm going to say. I don't like interacting with other people in this game because, I mean, yeah, the, it just causes the, issues, man. <laughs> dealing with massive amounts of coin and the way that the game works is like just risky. Just, just don't do it. I just, like, just I, I wouldn't feel safe even using the trading system. Like I, everything would be through Bizarre and Auction House. And even then you're not safe because no, people not. sell duped crap. I just you're not even safe through the Bizarre. Shout out Iron Man mode, honestly. It's just a better version of Skyblock all around. It's, it's kind of, it, well, I mean, Iron Man is kind of just Skyblock. Like that's kind it's of- Skyblock It's Skyblock as it was meant to be because you actually play through every aspect of the play game instead everything. of just doing nothing but the best money-making method and buying everything. Like. Yeah. Just if you're gonna start a new profile, play Iron Man, like straight up. Vids, I Just voice with an AI super chat. Okay, I should probably read the suggestion for how to fix this. YouTube settings, community, standard moderator, add bot tricks because it's oh yeah, be careful because scam channels. Yeah. Bot trick settings, yeah. widgets, chat, enable YouTube chat. Okay, let's see. Uh, chat bot. <laughs> Here we go. It's boomer moment time. I have to log back in again. Boomer moment. 
I wish I could like add moderators to bot tricks so I don't have to do this. <laughs> you might be able to, but I don't know how. All right. So there's just a check mark next to the YouTube integration. What's that supposed to mean? Oh, because it. Oh, never mind. I'm going back to the chat bot section. It changed my tab, which confuses me. Okay. Uh, moderation, name, commands, timers, additional features. <laughs> additional features? I don't see a button to enable on YouTube. 30 getting colder. Oh, right. Gotta go back to base camp for this. Yeah, give me a minute. I'm gonna try and get bot ricks working. If anyone wants to help out and try to research, that would be appreciated because as of now, the instructions I'm working with do not correlate with what I'm seeing. The only thing I dislike about Iron Man is some random things that you can that can be done for fun while still making money that can't be done Iron Man for money. I think I read that message horrifically wrong. Hey, my bad. I'm not gonna read it again though. So. <laughs> <laughs> There's several things I need to do. First of all, we need to go into community settings and make sure I already added the bot as a mod. Let's take care of this now because I don't want to ignore YouTube chat any longer. Uh, I mean, I do. Settings. If that makes you feel better, YouTube chat. Cold community standard moderators. Let's see if bot Rex is in here. <coughs> uh, should be at the end it, of the he, Oh my God. Wait, you're asking me for elite dangerous advice in a skyblock stream? This is weird. <laughs> Any tips for raw mat grinding? Turns of your drug your planet with 18% resources. Um, a okay, lot of people, mod Rex is not added as a mod. From what I understand, a lot of people like to do HTE farming and then cross trading. Uh, if you don't know what that is. For raw materials, there are planets D2EA has a great video on it. There are planets where you can find the specific high grade materials you want. They take, their raw materials are the most annoying to get in my opinion. Uh, no, actually that's not true. Data is the most annoying, but raw is second. Okay, um, I am not seeing, this channel does not exist. Um, look, up, look up raw mats from uh, D2EA. Yeah, there. first of all, Botrix, I don't know which account's the real one. So that's a problem because I can't even go to the channel. <clears throat> Shout out web design. What's their URL? Correct. <laughs> they got a raw mats um, video for Odyssey. If you're using Odyssey. There's... <sighs> There's too many bot rixes. <laughs> There's too many. Oh, I see it. Thank you. Thank you. We're, we're doing this together, chat. We're doing this. Thank you again, G. I don't know who G is. because It might be graphicality. I don't know. Um, Because streamer mode. Okay. Bot rix is now added as a mod. The correct account is. So now... Uh, YouTube settings, community. Yep, 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 yep. Did that. Botrix settings, widgets, chat. Enable YouTube chat. It already is enabled. Do I disable and re-enable? Chat, I want you to look out for Botrix the bot. Look for him. <laughs> If he shows up, uh, that means maybe it's working. Did you moderate it? I, I think I did. How do you make him talk? <laughs> you had to go to widget, widgets, chat widget, and then enable YouTube what? chat, which I already did that though, but it's not showing up. That's How the, do you make it talk in chat? I don't know. And it's not showing the YouTube chatters on my feed in OBS. I don't, I don't know. I, 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 I would be willing to bet that it at least requires a restart as well. To I don't, the OBS widget work, by the way. No, I don't think so. The OBS <laughs> widget updates in real time. It's only a web link. It's like a web thing. 
Well, yeah, but I don't know. Think about if they made it so the web thing updates. It might not. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. Um, here's the problem. Is that like, yeah, all the settings are working. He Virix wasn't added as a a mod, which might be the reason why it didn't work before. That would make a lot of sense. But like, now what? <laughs> I could see it in the mod list now. That's good. That's good. So at least is that. So maybe, maybe it'll just work now. Is there a way for us to see the bot settings? No. Also, what the hell is that? I'm so confused. Okay. Um, here, I'm going to screenshot what I'm looking at because I'm so confused. Okay. Chat, uh, what platform is this? This like T looking platform that has a bunch of fake chatters and bot ricks in it. Like, what is this? Oh, oh. Uh, and then there's another is... one. I don't even know what that is. 7TV supports that. I think that's an Android app. Ugh. Um, Gross. Yeah, I don't know. It's still not working for YouTube chat. That was loud. Uh, yeah, I don't know. The best advice I have for chat is just to look out for the guy or the bot. <laughs> look out for bot ricks. If you see bot ricks, something might just change. I don't know. Look out for the guy. If you see him, let me know. Look out for the bot. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's not well documented. It's like, yeah, I've enabled YouTube chat. Now what? It's not working. Like, what am I supposed to do? Uh, <laughs> streamer, streamer tools. It was so simple with the other platforms, but well, here's the problem. I know it's YouTube's fault. It's not BotRix's fault. It's YouTube's fault. Because YouTube is notoriously awful with their support for third-party stuff. So, like, mm -hmm. it makes sense. I'm just annoyed. I don't know how to fix it, man. That guy's name is Thorby? This has been a goal for months, man. I just want it done. I thought that said Enchanted Uber for a second. I was very confused. 30 how does one get into your guild macro i think it's a minimum sky block level of like 360 or something i don't i'm not a good resource for that you know what i also don't like about this new area not only do i have to constantly turn off and on my efficient minder depending on what i'm going for technically for the max efficiency if that third slot in the drill is universal, which I'm not sure it might be, it might not be. If it is universal, then I should be putting a jade there if I'm mining anything that's not a gemstone, which I also don't like. So I have a feeling they need to do something to make it less awful to switch what you're grinding. Yeah, same with gold mining. First time registration. After initially registering, the bot might not be able to join your channel for at least an hour. If you've just registered, it's advisable to wait at least 60 minutes before starting your stream. <laughs> well, know. no, no. I was registered. The bot just wasn't a mod. Turning well, the bot might... on. If you have the bot turned off and then turn... What is this? Oh, it just got a mine shaft. Hello. That's new. How do you do oh, it? You, you get it for, like as a drop. Wait, 30 crazy. virus queued for glacite, glacite mine shafts. <laughs> I actually <laughs> like that a lot. Actually. How did my brain even do that? Glacite is <laughs> <laughs> Oh, my brain. Okay, so there was a queued, which is new to me okay there's so much my i'm being overwhelmed <laughs> there's too much stimulus to process at the same time okay i guess we're gonna have to pause this bot thing because we have to deal with this now i think you need a break from garden i think i need a vacation 
Yeah, me and you both, brother. Uh, I think yeah. you know. I think I need. I think I need thirty warp. <laughs> Does anyone have an extra million dollars laying around they don't need? Appreciate it. I would appreciate it. It only took three attempts to okay. slash P warp. Don't worry about it. Got you, Fezzy. Thank you, Jade. It's a big solid. That was so clutch. That was so clutch. Oh my god, that was like almost frame perfect. That's crazy. Oh, never mind. He's not in. You need heart amount of seven. <laughs> You need Heart of the Mountain 7 to get into this area? Yes. Wow. So you really do circle around like the game progression makes you leave the Dwarven Mines to come back. The more documentation I read about this bot, the more I hate YouTube chat. I know, I know. It is terrible. And you know what's crazy is they've stopped like improving things. <laughs> they like, have since the since the era of streaming like kind of came to a close post pandemic. They're focusing on shorts now shorts. and podcasts a little bit. Podcasts a little bit like yeah, they're, they're focusing on algorithmic stuff and they're not incorporating streams at all into that. If you have the bot turned off and then turn on again, you may need to wait another 60 minutes for it to join your channel. All right, we're going to do that then. So, here's the question. How do we turn off the bot? Or is it in that Okay. Work. To whoever G is. Oh no, that oh that that's gotta be Granishal, because he's talking to me in Twitch chat. So Granishal, um, when you say turn the bot off and on again, do you mean widgets, chat widget, and then unticking YouTube and ticking YouTube again? Is that what you mean by that? Because I did do that. Which means in less than an hour, the bot should show itself in YouTube chat, and then all will be well. They made Dwarven Mine comms as good as CH comms, both being 400 x so technically you really don't have to leave. Yeah, but you will. <laughs> but, but I do see what you mean, yeah. Okay, I have several questions. Do you get more fortune while in the mine shafts in general? Like, is there incentive to be in here other than the corpses in the bestiary? Other than the corpses as an incentive? <laughs> With equipment, yes. Oh, suspicious scrap. True. All right, let's see if we can find one of the corpses, right? Oh, no, there's an umber corpse and a tungsten, so we can't do either of them. That's sad. Do an Arnold impression of saying I need a vacation. He says it in the most normal way possible. He literally Who just is said... Who is Arnold? He literally just said... What movie is that from, anyways? Who's oh, it's Arnold? from Terminator 2. Never mind. I'm oh, dumb. the Arnold? It was a scene from Terminator 2 just after... Was it just after killing the T-1000? I have, I have, I have a confession. He didn't have an arm at that point. He said, I need a vacation. Uh, he I said it like that. I have never watched a Terminator movie. And I'm a film buff. <laughs> oh, that hurts. I've never watched that it. That hurts. I know, I, I've seen, I've, I think I... I've seen it as a child, but I've, I've never watched it. I remember nothing about it. Aside My from mining Arnold. speed's becoming trash. <laughs> Chat, help me. <laughs> so, so only with the new equipment do you get increased um, fortune and speed in here in the tunnels. So, if I've already killed the things and I can't loot either corpse, is there a reason for me to stay here? Is you my get scrap question. more pristine fortune, more gemstone locations. You get new gemstone crystals for perfects. Also, they added opal crystals, which is in there. The corpses also get books for cold res. Yo, is that Brandon Crafter? Yo. Oh my God, where? Oh my God, we got a lot of OG people oh in today's stream. God, it must be because of the title in all caps. It's update day. And then it just like reminds people of it's long just, times just, long it's past. Just the iconic phrase that, that never goes away. It's incredible. You can get scrap, Dude. but how? Mine Hardstone? <laughs> I can get scrap from Hardstone? What? W? Is this confirmed anywhere? Cause that seems weird. Wasn't your peak viewership a mining update stream? It was. And it was like 16k viewers almost at one point. Yeah, it was, it, was it the Dwarven Mines or Crystal Hollows? 
Um, Dwarven Mines. Okay. By the time Crystal Hollows came out, it was already too late. I should probably leave. How rare... How rare is scrap from hardstone in that? Rare. Also, can I just keep, like... Can I just, like, leave? Can I just, like, keep going in a straight <laughs> line? Or do I hit bedrock? Probably I hit bedrock. Well, Dwarven Mine isn't griefable, so eventually you'll uh. hit a wall. Oh, I need what? to leave. I need to leave. I was at 97% cold. 97% <laughs> cold. It's weird how heat percentage makes sense, but cold percentage doesn't to me. It doesn't click <laughs> Oh, thank you for the $5, Aiden. Aiden Jeffrey. Wish this update didn't come out on the day I'm meant to go back to work for a week. Hey, I'm going to be 100% oh. honest. We just needed, we needed an update <laughs> at all. Sorry. The timing Sorry. isn't relevant. The updates don't come out often enough anymore for the timing to really matter, <laughs> in my <laughs> opinion. I almost, I almost ate my keyboard. <laughs> Charisma virus, question marks. Charisma virus question mark sounds like a full name. What's the what's the question marks? My name is Charisma virus question marks. Oh, commissions, right. I should focus these. I should keep focusing these. Isn't it fun having my brain? Can you see the struggle of focus? It's terrible. Dude, I still don't know what food to get. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's figure this out. Uh, fried chicken. I mean, I've had a lot of fried chicken. Okay. Instead of get a, getting a taco pizza, just get a pizza. Get an actual pizza. Yeah, I, I'm thinking about it. But I could just make one realistically. But am I going to do that? I'm not 100%, 1,000% no. certain. <laughs> but I remember finding a tunnel with FX 2X powder, for example. Might have just been Dwarven Mines passing over. Yeah, I don't... That's That sounds to me just like the regular double powder event in Dwarven Mines. You should get the grilled cheesesteak burrito. It's, that sounds good, but I'm Chat, afraid. this is getting in dangerous territory. We're talking about food. And sure enough, within 30 Why seconds of bringing up food, my stomach starts to feel <laughs> 30 hunger. seconds later, I'm hungry. <laughs> Look what you did, chat. <laughs> Look what you did. Bordido crunch. There's Pizza. no events in mine shafts. Steak. There are... What's your favorite food? My favorite food? You know what's crazy? Ooh. We have known each other for more than half a decade at this point. Been working each other. Been working with each other <laughs> for half a decade. <laughs> and I don't think I've ever asked you that question. I don't think I've ever asked myself that question. What is your favorite the, if food? I, and I'm guessing it's one item. Not a genre. Not a platter. I mean, you could answer however you want. I'll take whatever answer you give me. Well, I'll I'll start with the most literal way of interpreting that question, which is what singular food item is my favorite? That's so hard sure. to do, though. It is. It's why I don't That's want to really it hard though. to do. How about you, chat? You might as well weigh in. There is yeah. one that comes to mind. I, okay, there's one that's my gut reaction. I ordered pizza. But I don't know if it's truly my favorite, but the first that came to mind is chicken bacon ranch pizza. What? What like, is that? The specialty slice chicken bacon ranch. Hot pockets with banana cream, chill out, Robbie. <laughs> there was this one uh, pizza place that I went to. It's somewhere in between like Warwick, which was my hometown at the time, and RIT, which is my school at the time. Somewhere in between the two, roughly halfway, there's this like mom and pop pizza place that has chicken bacon ranch and it's just incredible. I don't know how else to describe it. It's like <laughs> the dough was like almost like pastry like in a way. It was so fluffy. And, so you uh, wanted the pastry and the pizza ranch was with so chicken bacon and ranch. And the ranch was so creamy, the bacon was salty and crunchy, uh, and the chicken was chicken. <laughs> it was the seasoned. chicken was chicken. It's what you'd expect from chicken, but it tasted good, and on top of that, it was just a good regular old slice of pizza underneath all that. It was delicious. But is it my favorite item of all time? I don't know. 
Bessie is quiet, not gonna lie. Do chat, do you concur or you have person you have person? gotten quieter as the call progressed? Have I gotten quiet? Hang on, let me check to make sure my windows isn't doing something. There, I put you to hundred. Oh I just realized something. Hold on. Did it do it Hello? again? Hello. Oh, okay. Never mind. I thought my nothing. Let me uh let me see if my windows is doing stupid. <laughs> you know what though? A good a good contender for second place. The second time Bernie visited my house, he made this <laughs> like Maybe chat will no, recognize. Maybe chat will recognize what the recipe is. Imagine you take little beets. Oh my god! <laughs> oh, I can't talk. You know, it's funny because uh, you perfectly mispronounce. You perfectly pronounce the wrong words. Little <laughs> I love pieces that. of chicken, little beets. Little pieces of chicken thigh that you coat in <laughs> baking soda, cornstarch. Whoa, cornstarch. You take little pieces of chicken thigh, you cover it in cornstarch, and you fry it up in some like sesame oil or whatever. <clears throat> and then you add that onto rice that has been mixed with like a uh, citrusy vinegar. And then you use gochujang, like a uh, Korean chili paste sauce. And it's absolutely incredibly Delicious. Is there an experienced Iron Man player here? Does 5,000 hours count? My Minecraft account just got ratted. What should I do to stop it? Make sure you have no other accounts that have that password. Change your password. If you have a VPN, switch your location and then try to log in like seven times in a row until you get security banned. And sure. then and then you can regain account access. And then after you've gotten your account access, you can appeal on the forums. If you don't have a VPN, uh, move <laughs> uh, quick. Revoke the hacker's account access, which I, there's a tutorial. <laughs> if you scroll up a bit in the announcements chat of my Discord, obviously change your password. All of them, especially if you reuse them, which you should not do. Yep. You wanted to read the patch notes about 30 minutes ago. There's so much going on right now that there is no hope for me to focus on a singular thing. There is, there I, I can't even maintain my commissions. Like, that's how bad this is. Like, I keep forgetting that commissions are a thing. Little beats. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Little beats. So stupid. Rate your garden rot from 0 to 10? 11. I don't think you understand, chat. <laughs> Do I need to show you? No, you know what? Do you want to know how much brain rot I've experienced because of garden? I'm about to show you. Do you want to see what it looks like when an Iron Man account can't sell their excess RNG drops after already getting a full set of mossy fermento and fermento boots and a maxed out vacuum with all the stuff added to it? Cultivating 10 on every single tool except for cactus knife and pumpkin dicer, which are rapidly going to be cultivating 10. And then on top of that, you have this. Three rows of BDIs, a row of bookworms favorite books. This is all overflow, by the way. A row of overgrown grass. Overgrown glass. glass. Hell yeah. Seven clipped wings, seven green bandanas, <clears throat> which by the way is all overflow. Every single farming pet in the game has a green bandana on it on my profile. I have five chirping stereos, six harvest harbinger potions. <laughs> Did I say that wrong? Sorry. You said a harbinger. <laughs> How do you say that word? Harbinger? <laughs> I've been calling it that since they were. You've been calling it Harbinger. There's That's a awesome. there was a mob called that in Hexit back in like 2012, and I started Harbingus. calling. It... <laughs> <laughs> Six rat pets, three slugs, all overflow, and two atmospheric filters on top of. Yeah, it, it's disgusting. Absolutely disgusting amount of. Yeah, that's how much brain rot I've experienced. There it is. There's your proof. There's your evidence. W. <clears throat> What's even crazier about the potions is the fact that that came in a recent update. And I still have that much overflow. Why is my 7 TV so busted? I don't understand. It's not working anymore. It just stopped one day. Yo, Thomas... 
Ver06, thank you for the 100 bits. Oh. Venice guy, thank you for the prime. <laughs> All right, commissions, commissions. Let's keep on topic. I need to mine Umber and Aquamarine. Let's do that. I have seen the forging design thread, yes. Tungsten. <laughs> oh, you know what I should do? I should probably read the patch notes. Things have calmed down a little bit. Uh, YouTube chat, keep a lookout for the bot. Its name is bot. He's out there Ricks. somewhere. Its name is bot Ricks with an X. Search for him. Once you see him, I have a feeling I'll notice once it starts working because I'll see a bunch of red in my chat feed on the right. All right, uh, patch notes. Can someone send link to patch notes? Let's read them on stream. Thank you, Jaden. Ooh, they used the fancy graphics. That's how you know this is important. Hi, fix the sky block, the Glacite Tunnels. Hello, starting today, thanks to the schemes of one particular dwarf, experienced miners, I don't like that phrasing, may now explore what lies beyond the great ice wall. The Glacite Tunnels are harsh and unforgiving, with many once lively adventurers having met a frosty fate down in the depths. So the question is, will you fare any better? Before you read on... Before you read on to learn what's waiting for you. Oh, they released a trailer? Oh, when did this forum post come out? <laughs> Almost two hours ago. I'll leave that one for your own entertainment. Uh, you can watch that in your own time. All right, I I'm gonna skim through this because we've experienced all of it already. So, uh, Dwarf and Base Camp's the other side of the gray ice wall, yep. Which signifies the end of Dwarven territory. Interesting. Some lore here. While the tunnels are harsh and unforgiving, they host a variety of valuable ores. Yep. Tungsten. The, okay, the game brings three new ores, and with them, three new collections. Umber, Tungsten, Glacite. Yep. Already figured that. Uh, yep. New gemstones. Yep. Knew that already. Okay. You can place them in a chisel, apparently. I didn't know that. <clears throat> New stat called resistance. Yup. In order to stick around for longer and gather more valuable materials, players will want to build up the cold resistance strat. We've known this. Heart of the Mountain, eight through 10. Yup. Mining may mayhem. I'm gonna say madness. Okay. With this update, we'll be introducing Heart of the Mountain 8, 9, and 10. Yo. While the Glacite Tunnels are vast, they are also static, meaning the map is always the same, similar to Dwarven Mines. Hence why we have waypoints. Um, or how we can do waypoints. However, when mining, players will sometimes unearth the entrance to Glacite Tunnels. Yeah, I think functionally this update's very good. I do like the way it works. Mine shafts are not all sunshine and rainbows. Yeah, 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 we knew this. Corpses, keys, we knew this. Pendant of Devon? It's a necklace. And it has two slots on it. Now I want to read this. Not only does the Pendant of Devon become the first equipment piece in the game to boast gemstone slots, but it also has a full set bonus that grants pristine when in mine shafts. The three other pieces of this equipment set will hopefully make their way into the game in the distant future? In the distant future? So not coming soon? There is a distant future? <laughs> well, damn, that's disappointing, but anyway. Uh, fossil Research Center, we already knew about this. 
occasionally the suspicious scrap will uncover a piece of the larger fossil that's what i was trying to describe earlier the white glass is um that's fossil and you have to expose the whole thing and i'm assuming getting a better what's the tool you use in the excavator the chisel i think you can craft better chisels which probably let you break more blocks if the player can successfully uncover the entire fossil during the mini game, they will receive it as a physical item. Yep. That's how you get the pets. Future plans. Glacite tunnels part two. Uh, okay. What's in part two? It's in the design phase. We'll deliver new content in the form of NPCs, events within mine shafts, new collections, and heart of the mountain related stuff. So no new info there. <laughs> Just listed all the features that are already in the game and just said more of it. <laughs> Glacite themed fishing content. That's new. Okay. As part of the follow up, we would like to take some time to streamline the overall progression within the mining skill by making some key changes. You better mention nucleus runs to recipes, outdated mechanics such as heat. Is it outdated? I don't know. Heat makes sense as a mechanic. And forge times. Where's. Nucleus runs, please. Our goal with these changes is to put mining as a skill in a stable position so we can leave it for a prolonged period of time in order to focus on lesser developed skills. Better Mares. Better Mares features more perks, perk revamps, and a better new minister system. The main idea of this update is to make all mares an attractive option to vote for. I mean, most of them are, let's be fair. Uh, mayors that come second in voting with non-special mayor candidates will be elected as minister and will have one of their mayor perks active in conjunction with the active mayor. We've known this. The update is scheduled to hit alpha soon and balancing for bug testing, so keep an eye on it. I feel like there's some sick combinations you can come up with with that. Dragon Rush and Primal Dragons? Oh god. Oh no. You've seen this update more than a month ago on Alpha and it hasn't been brought up since. Yeah, I wonder why. Our development efforts have been directed towards completing the Glacier Tunnels for the past few weeks, causing a delay in pro progressing with this update. With the Glacier Tunnels now released, we can prioritize returning to this project and releasing it back on Alpha in the coming weeks. Oh god, they haven't given up on it. To gather further feedback and bug test, one thing to note is that we have nerfed the set bonus for the Primal Dragon Armor. Good. Kill it. It needs to not exist. Primal Dragons were not necessary. Anyways. Um, I don't know. Let's keep looking. Uh, how do we upgrade the chisel? I want to upgrade the chisel. Recipe chisel. Nope. Nope. How do upgrade chisel? Enjoyable content. Yo, thank you for the the Streamlabs dono, Thomas. Thomas version 06 <laughs> oh and the 100 bits earlier yes 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 we are caught up now thank you thank you have you ever thought about using an item texture pack like vert sky i don't care about texture packs in my gameplay <laughs> i don't care honest. ratio <laughs> it's crazy how ratio is just like not a thing anymore you know i've seen it a few times in recent well, well it, it happens, but like it's not like the cultural. Okay, so hard about thing it used to be. Hard about eight is how you forge it, I guess. Oh wow, we have a lot of progress we need to make. Is there a faster way to get? That's a dumb question. Yes, there is. Heart of the Mountain XP. I need to just focus. I need to stop being a fish brain, and I need to do the commissions. <laughs> That's really all it is. I just need to do commissions. So let's stop being dumb. And let's do the commissions. If you want really fast XP, you can do crystal nucleus runs. I'm going to push that off until I have the new pet that makes it so you get plus one loot. 
and i would prefer to wait until they actually fix nucleus runs but i don't know how long that's gonna take so what the what the, what what <laughs> i'll see we'll see if you stumble upon it i'm not pulling any attention towards it oh i need to clear this I barely slept. <laughs> I, for some reason, and I'm I'm feeling the hours. I feeling them. I struggled to fall asleep yesterday. Not gonna lie, I've it took me until like three thirty a.m. to fall asleep. I don't know why that happened. I've been struggling to fall asleep my entire life. <laughs> I find it so funny that for years you were just like, yeah, caffeine doesn't work on me. No, no. <laughs> and then for and then because of something some substance suddenly you uh can go to sleep again and then <laughs> it made it so caffeine worked yeah although sleep has been troubled recently oh has it very <laughs> very very troubled would you consider would you say it's because of the stress of the past few weeks of the job or just other probably things? probably mixture of things tax seasons that you know i'm things. just glad i finally recorded something so like we actually have footage now like finally <sighs> <laughs> it's about how I can illustrate the way I've been feeling. <laughs> what needs to be fixed with Nucleus runs? I don't know. The fact that Alloy is like an inconsistent drop chance and you have no way of tracking it. And the fact, I don't know, that, the fact that, that they're in the game. And the fact that it's so incredibly rare. Oh, okay. That's also Tungsten. That like, it's just impossible to get on Iron Man pretty much. Like, there's a lot of reasons I don't like... I was mining the wrong thing. Man, I my attention span needs some work. I <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I am bouncing back and forth constantly. There's so many different things to do. It is too much to process. I mean, this is kind of how update days go. They've like always kind of gone this way. I mean, the <laughs> thing is, it's been so long since one that I'm just not yeah. acclimated anymore. I'm not. <laughs> you think this like, is bad? Wait when the foraging update comes out. We're gonna, you're gonna be discombobulated like crazy. Hey, I'll take discombobulated over depressed and discombobulated. just. Discombobulated. <laughs> depressed. <laughs> Make at, your target. At sad. least we have new content. Oh, great. They made the one part of Skyblock I don't understand more confusing. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great first time chat. Just bought gems with your code? Hell yeah, brother. <laughs> code 30 virus. Is Wait until the tree island rot? Nah, that, uh, out of everything that update looks, it doesn't look like it's going to be huge, like 800 hours huge. It might be huge in huge. terms of like the variety of content. Diversity, perhaps. Diversity of content, but I think the admins It doesn't have... look too grindy to me, though. The admins have established to me at least, or I've established to them that the game is dying mm. because of how <laughs> long these grinds are, and they are going to make efforts to lessen. It's like the a double-edged sword, though, right? Whereas the people that are here are going to be here for the thousand hours, but the majority have left. Yeah. It's. Tr uh. <laughs> Oh my god, no more rot. Well, yeah, that's the thing. They've made so many new systems, so many mechanics, so many impressive features. It's crazy that, how the like, garden was just a right hook out of nowhere. It was like all of these changes, oh, all these dude. design philosophy changes, and then 1,000 hours of two buttons. Oh, I didn't even nowhere. know at the time. I had, I was, man, I almost missed that just, that world I used to live in where farming was not a part of my life. I miss the world where I used to live in where I was optimistic <laughs> you know that's the world i miss admin needs to start designing these grinds with iron man in mind truth and factual i mean <clears throat> iron man should just be the, iron man should be the game it should be the game really i mean they kind of figured out how to make iron man players even play together like you know like there's a magic there that they've already kind of figured out i'm trying to get hard on mountain seven Stick around to get lost. <laughs> are commissions or nucleus runs better? Uh, nucleus runs are nice as like a bonus. Like the extra heart of the mountain XP is nice, but I don't, 
I don't know if it would be a good strat just to gun it for the heart of the mountain XP. I would imagine probably not. I would I would suggest doing something else for the Heart of the Mountain XP until you have that pet and the perk in the Diamond Essence Shop that makes it so you get an extra loot bundle. Because like you really don't want to waste your nucleus runs because they are such a pain to get the materials for. I need an onyx again. <laughs> Crystal commissions in combination with nucleus runs goes crazy though. It does, but again, it's such a waste of the materials. Then again, Heart of the Mountain XP might be a commodity again. I've been Heart of the Mountain 7 maxed out for like over a year. And the fact that they added 10 more levels, maybe Heart of the Mountain XP is something I should focus on again. What ear of time. cookie buff? How many were those? Haha. -ha. <laughs> One ear of cookie buff. Chat, would it surprise you if I said that I've spent $400 between all of my profiles on mm -hmm. gems? No. And yes, before you ask, I wrote it off as a business expense. Very good. <laughs> it surprises me it isn't more. <laughs> yeah. That part, wait, that person's just named Hoplite Dev. Is that true? Hoplite Dev? It's just Hoplite Dev. <laughs> it's just, it just is as advertised. I'd imagine Hoplite has more than one dev, though. Unless they no. share a dev account. No, they got one. <laughs> <laughs> they got only one for the whole game. Hey, in case you guys are real, I think you guys are doing a cool thing. I don't. No, okay. <laughs> I think the fact that yeah, your server really is cool. still alive despite not being high pixel after yeah. six months that's something that's that not a, a lot of servers can say that's a that's a major accomplishment yeah just the fact that it still exists at all is an accomplishment and as far as i know I, as much as it's not my genre i don't really like those kind of games i can appreciate how well executed it is though right offs cringe tax evasion based <laughs> <laughs> it's not tax evasion if it genuinely is a business expense. It's just the law. <laughs> Playing it's the just... game is my business. <laughs> yeah, and honestly, dude, I used to like think taxes were like a good thing. <laughs> oh, it, it was so <laughs> And then funny. the government distinctly proved just how inadequate they are with that money. And I was like, damn, my entire outlook has changed. It was very funny watching uh... you get black pilled on... Taxes. Dude, I was like, I was like, dude, uh, dude, it's crazy. It it's was like, very I entertaining because I was already I was optimistic, and then and then uh, like foolish of me to be optimistic <laughs> in my life ever, because good God, <laughs> that did not go well. Is it not tax evasion if it's not tax evasion if you don't get caught? Well, it's just uncaught tax evasion. <laughs> you know what's <laughs> I mean, funny? Thinking. The amount I've paid in taxes in total for my entire life is probably a rounding error for like one general that's given a stipend of government funds. Like not even like the government as a whole, it's a rounding error for like the one-tenth of 1% 1 of the budget. <laughs> like <laughs> it's like nothing. So far I've paid like a really good whole year's salary in taxes. I've paid much more. I'm almost disgusted to really try to think about how much i paid in taxes total it's at least 200k is what i'll what i'll say i've at least paid 200k in taxes and that's after every trick in the book for getting write-offs and all that crap home office deduction writing off a percentage I of my automotive expenses i stopped paying taxes i now give 100 percent of my money to the to the to what is who is that i don't want to read that i'm scared <laughs> my tax return today sat real nice dude it's crazy how for everybody in the normal world tax season is a good thing roughly 30 minutes since he made the changes to bot ricks okay i was wondering about the exact same thing grinishal thank you for that <laughs> you write off taxes as a business expense you can write off the filing fee as a business expense you know what's funny you can write off technically it is you can write off your fica taxes as a 
the, the money you spent on FICA, which is Social Security and Medicare, you can write that off on your income taxes so you don't get double taxed. That you can do. There is what's called the self-employment tax credit. Raytheon is military industrial complex. Okay, roger that. Turns out having a child to write off on taxes is really nice. Yeah, a lot of the finance YouTube people I follow are like on it. They're going on and on about the child tax credit. Dependence. Yeah, apparently it's a huge thing. <gasps> oh my God. They had a shift left click to upgrade 10 levels of Hottam. Hottam. What happens when you reach 100% cold? You die. You die. You freeze to death. These waypoints turned out to be very helpful. I think that I think the thing that highlights how dumb taxes is that there are situations where you can be taxed on your tax to ref tax refund from the previous year. Can you? I would think that that's non taxable. <laughs> well, if they get the math wrong, then they can claw back the extra. They it's their fault. The best thing I can say. Imagine wagons sorry that's not what he typed imagine paying taxes and you'll never know if i don't have to pay them or do haven't do and haven't do, haven't. Uh, do haven't. how do i get there how do i do have how do i get to that location how how get to there 30 transfer party Oh. Ah, <sighs> you know what? Reinvite me. Nick Hyder makes parties annoying. I'm also oh, that was a mm, gross. I also cannot, for the life of me, find that. I don't even remember what the name of the gem was I needed. I'm hopeless. My attention span cannot even focus on one of the 17 things happening on my screen. Also, I was trying to kill that with a sword. <laughs> Don't worry Do about you it. think Nick Hyder is necessary for this area? Sounds like a yes. stream sniper. Yes, it is. It's very easy Sounds to Sounds like something sniped. a stream sniper would say. The fact that I haven't streamed in over a month and within like 10 minutes of me going into the new area, there was a guy with stereo pants. Like, yeah. Is this citrine or citron? I don't know. It could be citrus. Excavator, you found a suspicious scrap. How? My food is in balance. Is it genuinely from just digging the hard stone? Because that's like, if that's the case, that's like all you should be doing here. Mining ores. Is it ores? Or by ores, you mean this, right? The glacite blocks. Also, is it a rare drop from the mobs? Oh, hello. That's a tungsten key. I was mining mithril. Corpse? I got a yellow egg. I gotta find the other lapis corpse there's another one around here somewhere thoughts on the update so far i like it i think it's a really healthy bit of progression for the game and no complaints oh here's the other one hey let's go we got some peridot all right, I guess I'll mine some glacite then and hope for a key, I suppose. Assuming that counts, I don't know. Maybe I should be mining mithril. <laughs> I love desecrating corpses. <laughs> Hey, they're not going to need that stuff anymore. Might as well take it. It's no use to them. They're already dead. How's RP games going? 
shelved indefinitely until Skyblock isn't my entire life. But I will finish it someday. So I did everything I was supposed to for this mine shaft, right? I looted the two corpses, killed most of the mobs. And now I'm farming glacite or mining glacite with the hopes that I drop a scrap. Time to assemble a strike team for RB Games Engine. Oh, hello. We got a scrap. Hey, let's go. We got a scrap. Now, from what I understand, an upgraded chisel can reveal more blocks in the minigame, which would suggest I should probably save these and not do the minigame until I have like a pretty good chisel. Now the question is, what materials do I need to craft an upgraded chisel? Or to forge one, probably. Jira, I don't know who that is, has openly said they will maintain RP games for free. Is that the person that tried to hack the entirety of Linux? Is that the reference you're making, Rotbjorn? <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's who that is. <laughs> Just a trustworthy open source maintainer. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh-huh. You need different plates for upgrading the chisel? Okay. I should probably get out of here soon. Okay, time to leave. Dying. Where the door at? It's over here. Oh God, I might not make it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, this is close. This is gonna be close. 95, 96. Bye. I survived. 97, just like last time. Mm-hmm. More commissions. Okay, uh, we're gonna need umber and citrine. Anything bad happen if you die? Probably not, to be honest. There is a bonus, like 1000 powder you get for leaving early. But dying in Skyblock when you have cookie buff doesn't really have a consequence unless you have a Slayer active. So, I don't know. Oh, interesting. In Tab List, it has daily quests now. Fetcher and Puzzler are available. That's very interesting. I didn't notice that. Wasn't your comm getting scrap? It was. And I already did it. And now it's back to scrap again. Nice. All right, Citrine. Now, how the hell do I get to the citrine? I struggled with this last time. Also, what's citrine even look like? Is that the dark green? No, it's the brown, brown gemstone. And I'm doing this for comms only, so I'm leaving efficient miner on. Aquamarine is the blue one. I have decided to start playing this game again. Lord save me. <laughs> hey, you know what? It's a good time to come back because we have actual content now. It's great. And there seems to be a good bit of progression. Heart of the Mountain 10 doesn't look like a pushover task, but not in a bad way. There's enough variety where I have a feeling it won't get that stale. 
then again, my standards have lowered so much because of farming. Does anyone here have any experience decompiling programs? I've done it before, but it's not fun. Did we just fill the sack with glacite? Hold on. Oh, damn. I have 60,000 of them. Oh, wait, hold on. It's shift right click, right? Or shift... How do you do it? How do you use all? Someone said there's a button you can press to use all instead of just... Oh, I just did it. What? Wait, what? I'm so confused. Wait. Huh? Shift left, then left. What? Shift right click and then click again. That makes zero sense to me. Is it... The UI doesn't look any different to me before and after I do that. What? Recipe aqua. Okay. So let's see. Crafting one item into your sacks. So it's 20,000 out of 80. Shift right click. Oh, yeah. Okay. I see. So the only thing that changes is the number. Yeah, that first number. Okay. That makes a lot more sense. Good to know. Thank you, chat. Twitch isn't letting me sign in because I'm using a new computer. Well, hey, you found your way to kick. Man, this chat widget bot thing is actually really good from my point of view. Like, it's actually pretty nice. It's just getting it to hook up to YouTube chats, the problem. Once we do that, then I'll have zero complaints and I'll be multi-streaming on all three platforms like multiple times a week. It's gonna be great. We just gotta wait another like 20 to 25 minutes until we find out if it worked or not. I need citrine, right? Yeah. Super crafting is so goaded. I know, bro. It's great. I love it. Great feature. It's too bad I suffered through all of farming before that, but whatever. Oh, uh, Jaden, thank you for the 100 bits. The patterns of the fossils are in your DMs if you want the pets and what they do, level 80. Let me know I have them all lined up if you... How? You got all of them? There's no way. There's no way. Oh, vernacular. Vernacular. Welcome back. Thank you for that resub. Hell yeah. I'm starting to think it might just need a stream restart. So I'm hoping it works next stream. Well, next stream is going to be tomorrow, so it's not the biggest problem. Why is YouTube chat so dead? Uh, it's because YouTube chatters in general are a bit less engaged with the content than Twitch viewers. Not in like a bad way. It's just a difference in like the expectation of what you're consuming for content on the platform, if that makes sense. That's Sapphire. Oh, not an alpaca. Thank you for the team. What do we get for the sub goal? Oh, we're just catching up. We're playing the catch up game, which reminds me, I need to change the number and stream labels. So instead of out of 100, let's do 250. Where we realistically should be as a channel is around probably three to 400 if I streamed regularly. So we'll start having goals that actually matter after like 250. Then once we get to 250, then it's like, okay, we're caught up after my long absence from streaming. And then we'll, we'll figure out some fun things to do with the sub goals. He's not reading our text. I'm trying. We're trying to fix the stupid bot so I can read everybody's messages equally. I'd say there's about a 50-50 shot in the next 
20 to 30 minutes. I'll be able to read everybody's chat equally, which would be nice. Hey, 30 virus, my asthma's been very bad the past couple days. So I haven't really been out of the house, so I'm happy I can enjoy your stream. Hey, I'm glad to be of assistance to provide some entertainment. Is Corleone broken right now? Not that I know of, but I can see why you're asking that considering you need it to get here, Corleoneite. I remember back in the day, people really overhyped how difficult it was to get Corleoneite. It's really not bad. It's a 25% chance and the mob spawns up once every like two minutes. It's like to get eight of it, it's not even like an hour to two hours. Like if you're really unlucky, it's gonna be two hours. I was done in like 20 minutes. It's 25%, isn't that what I said? It used to be 4%. Now that would make sense. I, <laughs> If it used to be 4%, that makes sense. That's not the right thing. I was my, why am I getting Tungsten and Onyx confused? They don't even, there's no, the names have nothing in common. Also Jaden sent me like 10 DMs. Oh, that's all the pets. Gotcha. Oh my God, there's so many. Yeah, oh, okay, they're all from Alpha. That makes sense. The biggest struggle is finding Corleone in the first place. Yeah. Your opinion on the RNG based grinds usually isn't accurate. I don't know. I mean, I, I mean, we could joke about me being RNG carried, but some of these grinds, for example, core were pretty average. I don't know. There's definitely a few things I can't talk on, like Skay the pet drop. Like that was just dumb. I'll acknowledge that. That's like an RNG carried moment. A thousand percent getting my Skay the. But if I really went for it, I could have gotten a Skay the pet. Probably would have taken like a day or two. If I just did nothing but try to get Skay the pet for two whole days, like probably would have gotten it. Just being honest. And that's with like average rates. Any more umber? Oh yeah, the warden helmet also was an RNG carried moment. But to be fair, I didn't even use it until like nearly 3000 hours of gameplay later. That was sitting in my ender chest a long time, that warden heart. And even once I crafted the helmet, there was no reason for me to use it. Like I'm, I'm at Blaze Slayer like seven right now, bro. <laughs> and I did Kudra like not even 300 times. Like I still to this day have barely made use of my Warden helmet. Blaze six, all my, <laughs> nice. Uh, Aquamarine right this way. I should probably restart recording. There we go. Hey, I see Botrix in um, Twitch chat. Oh, what's up, Bernie? We were talking about your dish that you made earlier, the one with the, um, the chicken. Yeah, let me add you to the VC. Uh, Bernie. I don't know where Fezzy went, for the record. Barney. Yeah, we need to we need to get Botrix to show up in the YouTube chat. That's once we've won. That means we have completed our task. Hello? Hello. Hey boys. How much of the new update have you seen so far? I just got on your stream. Ah. Not gonna lie. Streaming five hours ago. Not gonna lie, it's kind of cool. Yeah, I see it. I see the uh, environment. It's nice. Not gonna lie, if oh, we got what? if we got an update like this once every six months for the next year and a half to two years, I think we're back. I think Skyblock can actually come back if we had an update of this quality once every like three to six months. I'm not even kidding. I'm not even exaggerating. 
Mm. We might literally get to like, I think if we had an update of this caliber, once every three months, we're going aggressive with it. Once every three months, within a year, I think the play count will double. I do believe that. Wow, I haven't seen Skyblock in months. <laughs> <laughs> I think, yeah, last time I saw anything Skyblock was like when I visited you and then, um, and then I was, I, and then home, you were like, freed from Skyblock after. yet again. <laughs> and then I went home for like three and a half months. Nah, yeah, no, I'm bad. The forge times will take six months anyways. I doubt that. Are there that many new items? Because like my prep for this update is all the materials that were already in the game pre-update and i it didn't take that long to forge it it was like a few days so far oh wow, chat. i haven't seen drug beyond in forever you know what i just realized there's a mining fist at midnight oh i'm gonna have to be up dude 12 hours from now i'm still gonna be awake oh you're doing this again this is uh, are you gonna stream fiesta if i stream fiesta this is gonna be a 24 hour stream <laughs> <laughs> oh god i mean not gonna lie the revenue kind of needs that right now because we have not been making videos so maybe you know what i should probably do i should probably send that first recording to fezzy so that he can like actually make a video all right, you know, if we're going to do this for the long haul chat, let's upload the footage so Fezzi at least has something to make a video out of. Uh, raw recordings. I will put these in here. This might hurt the stream. I just realized I'm streaming to three platforms at the same time. Oh, nice. And Is it kick Twitch and YouTube? Yes. And uploading the footage. So this might not work. Chat, let me know if speaking the stream of, starts to skip or have buffering. Speaking of, speaking of. Yes. I recently upgraded to an SSD from an HDD after like eight years. Oh my God. It's oh, such a difference. Yeah, oh it is. God, it's such a difference. How'd it's you crazy. Make, how'd you make it this far without an SSD? Like, I, I would have lost my mind. Don't ask. Don't ask. <laughs> I would have absolutely lost terrible. my mind. But now it's so good. It feels like a new PC, you know? Yeah, it does. That's the cheapest and easiest upgrade to make an old computer come back to life. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Like, if you took one of those, like... <laughs> those what, what were those old Dell machines called that like every school had? I think there was an O in the name somewhere. I don't even remember. Like a ThinkPad? That's a Lenovo machine. No, the um like those desktop Dell machines that like every computer Dell Optiplex, there it is. Yeah, I bet if you took a Dell Optiplex, put an SSD in it, you probably couldn't play many games on it. But like maybe like Halo. First Halo. Yeah. I mean, that's kind of what, that's exactly what we did, actually. We didn't even need an SSD. We played classic Halo. We could probably play Halo 2. Or even, no, nah, Halo 3 would be too much. <laughs> Old games were built different. Yeah, like, if you think of Fallout New Vegas' map size compared to, like, that of, like, Warzone. It's so much larger of a map with so much more detail and story and characters and everything. And it's like three gigabytes with DLC. And then you have like Call of Duty multiplayer only. That's like 150 gigabytes. Is that who I think it is? Oh my word. It's Fezzy. Fezzy, they learn 5,000. Oh, Bernie, I was, um, the conversation yeah. at one point came to what our favorite food is. And I brought up, um, after chicken Hot bacon dog. ranch pizza, I brought up that thing you made when you came here with the, the chicken really? and the cornstarch. Yeah. 
Do you like it that much? It was really good. What's the name of the dish? I'm curious. It's called a uh, uh, chicken karage. It's a Japanese ah. uh, fried chicken, basically. So there you go. That I don't know where in the top five it is, but it's in the top five for sure. Well, if you like that, you would also like uh, Korean fried chicken a lot. I've heard a lot of good things about Korean barbecue and yeah, anything you should, in that. You should yeah. try Korean fried chicken at least. I think that would surpass the karage in my opinion i think it's a lot more like flavorful what uh, is lard yeah <laughs> what is, is lard? lard just animal fat yeah or like tallow i think that's also not the name for yeah that. i've heard i've heard the term like beef tallow in reference to like mcdonald's making their fries oh really korean fried chicken drenched in that sauce is godly which sauce the um, Korean chili Kuchang. paste? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or, yeah. Give Pezzy Pete. <laughs> what? <laughs> Lard is pig fat, tallow is cow fat. I didn't yeah. know there was a distinction. I didn't. I know. thought they were both just lard. And it was cow lard, pig lard. I bet you can get both lard. 50% pig lard. So wait, if you get pig mixed with lard. cow, do you get lard tallow? <laughs> Speaking of lard, Pezzy, I upgraded an SSD and my computer is so much faster. It's crazy. Yeah. Are you, you going to wait it's, on checking out the pets? Yes. It's funny how big of a difference in a, like a speed up of storage is for a PC. Mm -hmm. Big time. So you were on a hard drive up until recently? Up till eight years, yeah. <laughs> wow. I was like, oh my god, my computer's taking like 20 minutes to boot up. <laughs> yeah. I was streaming, recording, all of that with that. Oh my god, dude. I switched to an SSD like, what, two, three years ago? Maybe mm -hmm. longer? Oh god, I've had, go a, back. I've had an SSD for like, probably, honestly, it might be a literal decade. I oh, used nice. to I used to be really like into PC building and that world and like when it came out that an SSD even if it's like only 200 gigs just having your operating system on it is a game changer so that's what I did like I had the yeah. smallest yeah. SSD I could afford it was like literally only like 200 gigs and I I put my OS they were on it at that time, bro. They, they were, were I think for like Super. for 200 gigs it was like 160 bucks I believe it that's not a good deal at all. You'll yeah, pick that got, now. I got, my, I got my two terabyte SSD for 130. Yeah. <laughs> but if you want to buy a Samsung Evo product, I think you'll still pay those kind of prices, which is really, really no, I have a Samsung uh, SSD. I don't know if it's Evo, but Samsung, Samsung. Evos, which I don't even think are NVMe. I think they're sell their uh, SATA, which is terrible for like, it is a go. SATA, a yeah. two and a half it's inch drive. Baby. So an 870 SATA, which is a terabyte, mm -hmm. is no, 500 gigs is 85 bucks, which is honestly terrible. <laughs> is there an updated version of Uber items on your Git? It's not there. Uber items, the repository is private as far as I remember. Because I well, use speaking it. Of Git, to, to I gotta money. get some food, so uh, <laughs> I'll just be back. <laughs> All right. <laughs> What's the difference between a cheap one terabyte SSD and an expensive one? Probably reliability speed. and speed. Reliability, yeah, but speed is the biggest one. Speed, yeah. Also, the form factor, if it's... <clears throat> yeah. So SATA versus M.2. Yeah, so SATA versus an NVMe drive. Very important distinction, because if you get a SATA SSD, it's going to share bandwidth with your hard drives, which will slow it down. So basically, in my opinion, NVMe. go NVMe or don't go. Yep. Also, NVMe SSDs are stupid cheap nowadays. <laughs> Even like small, like you can, you can make it work. Trust me, it's so worth it. Not to mention it's a lot easier to install than a typical PC component. You just kind of click it into its slot. When are we getting power over motherboards, dude? Like, I feel like as a society, we should have done this 10 years ago. Getting what? power over the motherboard instead of having the cable manage oh like it just seems like the natural progression <sighs> right i mean i don't know well that's the problem with manufacturing standard is once a standard is set it basically never changes all the innovation happens within its like 
uh, template, which sucks. I do agree. I agree. So that would be kind of like a modular board. Because if all the power is being delivered through the board and there's no cables, then you're just plugging stuff into a board. How'd you get the waypoints? I um, left my food. I'm oh. using Badline Client and my um, profile on there you can download and use. <laughs> Correct. Some things never change. It's not a stream without me doing this. <laughs> Have you actually like learned the language? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just doing like super basic stuff, keeping my streak alive. This is just his game of choice. Mm. Yeah, it's yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> I love <laughs> Duolingo. It's my favorite game. <laughs> if you weren't partnered with DLC, would you still use it over Forge? Absolutely, bro. With the amount of crap going on in my life, yes. the last thing I need to worry about is whether or not this <clears throat> jar file I downloaded is going to rat me. Like, no yeah. thanks. <laughs> not only that, but version compatibility with Badline is yeah. literally unmatched. Inevitably, when the game updates to the modern versions, people are going to realize real quick, oh, wait, all of my mods are for 1.8.9. Uh-oh. And Badline... It's just already they, there. <laughs> yeah, they since they build it from the ground up for the client, it, it already just works has, on all the versions. Right now, all the mods work in modern versions. <clears throat> hey, I tried to load up uh, Lunar, like, a few weeks ago. But it doesn't allow me to, um, it keeps giving me the bedrock launcher. What happened to the Java launcher? You know Didn't what? I think, twice. I think I saw something about that on Twitter. I, I think I also did. I don't remember what it was though. Would you accept the sponsorship from Genshin Impact? Depends. What's the price? It depends. <laughs> what, what are the deliverables? Is it... If they're giving me a hundred grand. Buddy. And yeah, okay. I'll make a season. I mean, everybody has their price, right? If it's like a Raid Shadow Legends type, like a fourth of the videos, the ad. <clears throat> I mean, ugh. honestly, for something that awful, 5K. <laughs> I'll make them overpay. If it's for one video, sure. I'll ruin that video for 5K, whatever. And if it was a bit less intrusive and it was like a 30 seconds, like, oh, here's a thing that I'm sponsored by, then uh, one and a half to two K. I don't like doing sponsorships. <laughs> uh, you might notice they're very rare. It's because it always like makes the video worse overall, you know? But sometimes if it's something I genuinely like, like the mouse pads, that was sick. I was very happy with the mouse pads. Oh yeah, I unfortunately I couldn't buy it at the time. Ah, I bought five. <laughs> I bought what? They are... I am saving them for a day when the 30 virus name is worth something and I can auction them. <laughs> but, but what? <laughs> I'm investing in myself. <laughs> but what? Like random answer, I could like... I'm so lost. I could... Mouse pads. What? Investing in stonks. Oh. <laughs> gummy sponsor i just can't it's morally so do that and everybody knows it if we lived in a society even if we lived in a society where alcohol and we were switched i don't think a sponsorship for the gummies would really be a you want to know how i got me these to do. drugs i again even if it was societally speaking like people treat it the same way they treat alcohol <laughs> like would i take an alcohol sponsor no like it's just it's, I guess it's it depends. Not a, if I, if it's my not demographics are like, if my demographics are all like older people. Well, that's different. Yeah. If it's like, if the audience, let's say I was, I don't know if I had a channel that reviewed cars, <laughs> like, or like was talking that's about. That's a crazy channel. They I just send you cars. <laughs> well, well, there's people that have like, for example. Marquez the, Brownlee. The Strad <laughs> Man. Um, Strad. And then there's I'm Marquez. Strad Man. Wait, Grungly. Hold on. Have you heard the Grungly? I no. Gr Dude, Grungly. Oh, oh wait, you have lag. it turned off. You don't get to see it. I love lag. Well, well, Bernie hears it. Dude, that's a sound hey, um, in Discord. Hey, do we have an update on the <laughs> on the bot connecting to YouTube so I could see all of my chat in one feed instead of two feeds? Nope. 
Botrix, where are you? Yeah, we might have to wait until next stream to get it to work, unfortunately. That's really annoying. What did he say? Botrix? Botrix? Yeah, honestly, it, it seems to be that's the case. That's very annoying. How close are we to Heart of the Mountain 8? How much of this do we have to do? Probably a good bit. Oh, God. Hey, chat, everything I've done in this stream so far, I have to do four more times. <laughs> Uh, to be fair, I've been very fish brain about this. Maybe if I actually focus on the commissions, they'll go by faster. <sighs> Use mineral armor. We already tested it. It doesn't work. <laughs> there was the silence and then just... <laughs> it's not like someone retched in the background. It's called a cough. Oh, the coughing no. syndrome. I'm getting too cold. <laughs> Will I see you again? That campfire ain't even a fire. There's wool in it. <laughs> Maybe that's the fuel. Is, that, is there wool in it? I don't even know. There is. Mm. Since it's Speaking a version of, of Minecraft to old devs. I didn't hear that. <laughs> <laughs> you talked over me in Discord, just muddled Now I'm going everything. to talk over you both. <laughs> Do you make so a bank in this up... <laughs> Bro. I, knew I knew it. I knew that was going to happen. It happens every time. There must be like a subconscious, like <clears throat> expected amount of time to be silent <laughs> before you get uncomfortable and have to break the silence. I think it's consistent between us both. I think so. And yeah. that's why that happens. Kind of like yawning. And how you, if you, someone yawns near you, you're going to yawn. Is it nice? I mean, <laughs> so when, <laughs> so when are you going to stop 30? You've been at it for five hours. Well, considering gonna do like 24 hour stream. considering the nature of how much grinding is ahead of me and the fact that there's already a mining fiesta at like 5 p.m. Or 5 p.m. Midnight to 5 a.m. I'm going to be here a while. Oh, Here's... you're going to you're going to stay up for that. That sucks. <laughs> hey, I mean, there's a lot of bills coming in that you know, I didn't you know expect. What you should do. I had to spend 500 bucks yesterday on an unexpected thing that happened. So you know you gotta. You know what you ought to do. What? Fraud. You're right. Glad I could help. <laughs> well, speaking of that, I've Chat, been doing that all the night. all the Bitcoin you send me, I will double and send back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Me it's too. Game you don't with. actually send. Well, actually, you can't send me Bitcoin because I have no way to receive Bitcoin because I don't deal with that crap. I don't have a wallet. Oh, you can send me. It's okay. <laughs> At uh, illuminator5000 bitcoin.com. <laughs> Bitcoin. Dot, yes, that's how wallets work. They are. <laughs> you know what, though? Addresses. I do. I do have several services that advertise that they can trade crypto. So maybe I do have a wallet you could send it to, but I don't even know what the address is. <laughs> I used to, but I don't anymore. Forging update is gonna be nuts. Fezzy, do you speak from experience? What about fraud? Maybe. <laughs> uh. All right, I'm gonna get some food. Just bought. <laughs> Just bought a hundred dollars worth of gems with your code. Paid. Is there a way to fix that? How Discord just, if two people talk over each other, one of them just inevitably gets right. One of them just lags. <laughs> and it's always like consistently a specific person that gets muddled out. Like, why is that? It's probably because my guess is Bernie has us playing either through a speaker. Are we playing through a speaker? Oh, that might be why, yeah. It's the, it might be the. He went to go get food, so I don't uh, know. Yeah. <laughs> What's the word? Audio canceling? No. <laughs> Reverb canceling, uh, no, right. no. echo canceling, something like that. No, you you had it. Well, kind of. Audio canceling works. It's noise reduction. Noise reduction. That's that's the term. Noise canceling. Some people. In an alternate universe where they pick different words for the term. Yeah. How to get cold resistance? Uh, apparently, there's a lot of stuff in the forge that does that. So we need to start looking into. 
I mean, I'm just gunning it for Heart of the Mountain 8. I'm not even entirely sure why. <laughs> like, what am I even going to get? You're going to get... You're going to get that little red pane of glass to be green. Also, how expensive is Peak? Eight? Oh, that's a million glaceite powder. How much do we have? I haven't even been keeping track of that. Like, where even... Where does it show <laughs> my glaceite powder? 77,000. Interesting. The gauntlet gives cold resistance. Books give cold resistance. Hot, hot and perks give cold resistance. I see. So it does seem to me that we're doing the most efficient thing possible as long as I don't fish brain with actually checking what the next commission is and not just mining whatever's in front of me because I've been doing that a lot. Oh, music? Thank you for upgrading your membership on YouTube. M <laughs> music? YouTube? The entire media? <laughs> YouTube really the needs to fix thing? their terminology because the way that sentence is supposed to go is thank you for upgrading your membership to member. <laughs> Like, okay. <laughs> like. Yo, oh. Rot Bjorn. Yo. Rot Bjorn. See, here's the terminology that makes sense. Thank you for the 10 gifted Twitch subs. Now that. That is a pog chance right there. I'm sorry. That I is... still have the stance that they need to add chips. Yes. To YouTube. They had chips, and they need to change memberships. is a little goofy. Yeah, I don't know what they should call it. I don't need it. Chat, Subscription what... is what it's supposed to be, but they but... kind of use that one up. <laughs> yeah, follower is just a better term than subscriber. What's, but a, they... what's a synonym for subscription? I mean, what are patrons called? Patrons. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> That's not any better. Uh, contributions, that's not, that's not helpful. Did I just ask what are patrons called? Am I stupid? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh... The brain rot is, <laughs> I don't know, Chad. I think I've been farming too long. It might be permanent. I haven't snapped out of it yet. <clears throat> Why don't they just call them super subscribers or something? I don't <laughs> care. <laughs> premium subscribers although they already use premium those isn't best. that isn't that what twitter uses as its subscription super model? follower or whatever super fan or i think they did just switch it out for subscription though didn't they honestly you know how the super chats super subscriber yeah. isn't the worst it's not it's not the it's worst thing in the world honestly i think i'm comfortable recommending super subs sure I think that terminology makes so much it's better, better than sense. a galaxy. Oh my God. Rockford's oh my God. Losing. I was just about to click if I missed a He's donor and then the death. whole feed just became rot. Your nice gifted sub. Holy crap. Thank you, dude. Jesus. That's the 30 of them. That noise, I might have to, I might have to turn the alerts off because otherwise that noise is, oh wait, I could just mute it. There we go. Yes. Oh, I finished Glacite Collector. Umber over somewhere. <laughs> Here. Up. Well, the... <laughs> what the... But anyways, I'll, I'll mention that with the YouTube partner manager man who was here on this stream earlier, actually. <laughs> I'll mention them. I think they should be called Super Subs instead of Member. Guys, this is a bit. He's giving me the money so I can donate. <laughs> Revealed. Guys, this is a bit. He's giving me the money so I can, quote, donate it, guys. Ah, yes, so that we can encourage more people to donate. Very good idea. You it's know, like I'm not the type to talk trash about exes, but there was one of them that gifted me Twitch subs and then changed her mind and wanted the money back, and I just lost out on Twitch's 50% cut. Wait, because... you actually gave the money back? Well, yeah, I'm a, I'm a Dude, nice... I would have said no. I'm a nice like, person. Yeah. I don't know. And probably Sorry. too nice. Did you I read think, the chat rules, I think man? At that, I, think it, I think at that point, it's not nice anymore. <laughs> it's just being a pushover, and I kind of was at that time. My self-esteem was not in a good place. What? Hello. What? But now that's the thing that happened back in the day. What did he say? Oh, Phantom's Gamer, welcome to the stream.
I'm so behind. Why on a Tuesday, Hypixel? Why? I don't know if you've heard, but Tuesday is always update day nowadays. Like, that's... That's the... Tuesday is update day. Which is weird. That's the Steam thing. It makes sense to me. I bet Steam they, is Thursday, isn't it? I bet they picked no, it because it's... Tuesday oh. probably is when Hypixel is the least amount of players online. <clears throat> so they have the least impact from an update dropping and people getting booted off the network is my guess destiny 2 update today too an elite update tomorrow there's a lot of games updated i watched there's a hell divers update that happened today too i watched a whole video on how the monetization <laughs> of destiny 2 is just absolutely Dude, horrendous but, 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 but i don't know who's who who owns bungie now unless they are by themselves and they're not they don't have a publisher anymore but they fell off so hard. Like Destiny they pull, 2. They pull every stop. They'll do that thing where you buy the premium currency and then whatever it's packages they less, offer, it's, it's yeah, slightly yeah, it's, less than right. what the thing costs. <clears throat> and they do that other thing where it's like, oh, in order to participate in this area, you need to buy it. But in order to get into that area, you also have to have gear from a different area. And that's not explicitly stated anywhere. So you also have to buy that one too. And it's just like, there's a web of it's just- It's weird how hard they felt, because Destiny 2, it still is, but it was also very popular. Like, I don't see a monetary issue with the way it was going before. It's like, here's here's an expansion, pay for that, and then that's it. There's the game. Well, hey, here's- <laughs> That seemed to be fine, but you know. Here's my promise to you, chat. Someday, my primary I'll do the same thing my pro my <laughs> primary job title will not always be youtube i'll always be a youtuber but my primary job title will eventually become game developer if all goes not always plan. Be a YouTuber. and when that happens if i have to have a premium currency in a game i'm not gonna pull that crap you want to buy a DLC? Well, then probably you just buy the <laughs> DLC and not for premium currency. I don't know. There's a lot of crap that See, games do to monetize that I won't be doing because... Here's the promise I can make to you, Chad. I'm going to... I will I'm, do all of that. I'm going to be an indie developer. I won't need to make 17 quintillion dollars because there's only going to be like a half dozen people on any given team that I put together. So... We won't even need that much monetization as long as the game is good and gets a lot of downloads and everybody's happy. I'm considering making... I'm considering Project Immortal to have no microtransactions whatsoever. You buy it, you own it. And then maybe supply DLCs. Maybe. But honestly, I might even just release it as a content update without charging. But yeah, that's the plan. <laughs> and if I and if I have to do <laughs> monetization crap, it's gonna. Every, I'll try to keep it to cosmetics only, but I can't promise it because obviously Hypixel promised it, and we have cookies. <laughs> Release a massive update when it's the spring sale. It's kind of smart. <laughs> you can sell cookies. You can sell cash. That's not a bad idea, actually. Yeah, the upgrade. I didn't hear what you said, Bernie. I heard what Fezzi said. So I don't know what I just accidentally responded to, seemingly. Uh, nothing. Selling. That cash. was a great joke. Come on. I didn't hear it. I said instead of selling cookies, you can sell cash. You can sell cash. I mean, that's basically what microtransaction currencies are. I don't remember You're what. You're buying cash. You just unlocked an old memory of mine. There was some cartoon I used to watch as a kid where that was a thing. It was SpongeBob. They were giving away of bags of cash because of how successful Pretty Patties were. Uh, I remember Oh, I remember that. this. Yeah, no, I remember that. No, no, no. You get it? Cookies and cash? Like C-A-C-H-E? Like a website cash? <laughs> oh, I didn't even get that. <laughs> yeah, that, that was... That was... And, the up, and the website would save cash so that you know, like... So all the images on the website are saved on your computer as cash. Yeah, exactly. So you can load it faster next time. Mm -hmm. I'm so funny. I have the best jokes. That's Especially when games are costing more to make and cost less or cost the game with inflation. Yeah, but I hear from what I hear, a lot of the reason why it costs that much is bureaucracy. Bro has negative right gems. Word? Oh yeah. I have corporate structures. I have negative gems right now. You know why that happened? 
there was some person that bought me gems and then I was like, oh great. I was about to have to buy cookies anyway. So I bought cookies and then I guess they, um, they charge back because now the gems are gone, but I still have the cookies and the bits. By the way, don't try that chat. That will get you banned 1000%. I am a YouTuber with special privileges. Do not try this at home. You will get banned a thousand percent. Did SpongeBob even have any profit or incentive or did he just work? No, he was sucked into the capitalist system and didn't even know he was being exploited. I think like he was making less than a dollar an hour according to one episode. That's actually insane. He can afford that house off a dollar an hour? <laughs> he can grow that house out of a seed, you know. What? He grew that house out, out of a seed. He did. So maybe, oh, you're right. maybe That's he didn't canon have to buy too. it. Yeah. I, well, how did he afford the land? And he has to pay property tax. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I, I mean, know. I don't think there's a government. There's a mayor, but I don't know if he does much. Is there a country or is it just the town? Is Bikini Bottom the te like the little city? I or think... is there a state? Is there a government? Is okay, there a country? This is a viewer theory, but the theory is that their whole society is just what happens when the nuclear testing at Bikini Atoll happened. It just irradiated all the sea creatures and they well, yeah but like now they have structure and stuff so like are, is there a core is there a i mean state? they were probably already in those spots physically so maybe they don't have to pay property tax because they already lived there before they were intelligent <laughs> but how but what is the dollar like how is that defined like do they have gold reserves or what they use the u.s dollar as a <laughs> it's not a u.s a, uh... it's not a u.s dollar but it is a dollar of some kind. It has like a fish. No, they use the US dollar for anchor. There are multiple currencies that are called the dollar. Yeah. The Canadian true. dollar, the Australian dollar. Singaporean dollar. Singaporean dollar. What did this combo turn into? I have no idea. We're talking about the the economic the stability that SpongeBob society could bring to the table. They live off of a dollar an hour pay, don't have to pay property tax. Where is the government? You know, who's the Microsoft of uh, Under the Sea? I saw a post on Reddit like yesterday. They have public there was transportation some, down there. There was a guy that bought some SpongeBob thing. I think it was a sticker and it was 62 cents, which I thought was absolutely hilarious. For those that get it, you get it. For those that don't. 62 cents. Oh, is that the worth of his soul? Yes. Yeah. And he bought a Something sticker, like a SpongeBob sticker for 62 cents. 62 cents. Fezzy, it's, it's a kid's show. They don't have to know those things. No, they do. It, there's got to be a canon explanation somewhere. I guarantee. <laughs> for all the change in my pocket. <laughs> in exchange <laughs> for pocket. his soul. I can't believe you know so much about SpongeBob, but did not know that that guy that voiced the pirate. The Flying Dutchman. This, the, fly, the Flying Dutchman and Pe Peggy? Wait. What's what? his name? Oh, no, 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 no. Um, Pe Patchy Pe the Pirate, SpongeBob Patchy. the announcer or the narrator, and they're all, Flying Dutchman are all the same guy. They're all the same guy. That is and crazy. They're all Tony. To, to, what's, and they Tom all Kenny? sound, voice actors they all sound so different. That's the weird part. That's There's a, so much range. Of voice actors. He's very well. He's a good voice yeah. actor. And also, uh, he, Lee, he also Bradley, Lee Bradley Brown? No, Lee whatever. Lee. Who was it? The side characters also does a great job. Oh, God. Yeah. This just reminded me of the AI voice covers. He's, he's, the, the, he's the my leg guy. Tom Kenny also voiced a couple of Transformers that... I remember were this. <laughs> yeah. Controversial. <laughs> they were the ones that were swearing a lot. In the a movies, lot. Right? And they also were they were criticized <laughs> i'll say that they were criticized for some i things. think i know the same guy voiced i think all the i know the, characters. i think i know well, the scene you're talking about and i can't describe the reason well, it's not it was a scene. the two characters were just inherently problematic from what i hear <laughs> i i think i remember why the and same guy voiced all the sesame street characters i don't think tom kenny voiced any of the sesame street no characters. i think i think they mean that a different guy but the same guy voiced all the if you're talking about the guy that voiced elmo kevin clash i don't think he voices anyone else other than elmo and maybe one more wait 
What? Sesame Street, yes. Yeah, what? Sesame Street. What? Elmo's part of Sesame Street, right? Oh, I just got warped into a tunnel. Interesting. Thank you, Looter. I didn't mean to kill the conversation there, but... <laughs> No, uh, it was over. Oh, I <laughs> it. it just clicked in my head that that little module and tab is not how many mobs are in the cave. It's the literal amount of kills required for the next bestiary milestone. I'm an idiot. Well, no. <laughs> and your cold research was, uh, was all of this updated today? Yes. Mm -hmm. This whole area is brand new. Hey. But is this mining another island or what? Looter, what happened over here? What? <laughs> oh, hello. Twelve thousand glacier powder, not bad. I'll take that. Who is that random person sitting up there? Is that you? These are That's corpses. They are people what? that died in the caves. Oh my God. They're all in lapis armor for some reason. Or mineral. <laughs> or mineral. Or what was that other one that is not something players Vanguard. can use, but it, Vanguard. I like I how you remember that before me. <laughs> huh? It's Why also the worst that? Call of Duty. That's not true. Modern Warfare 3 is the worst Call of Duty. Infinite but Warfare was the worst Call of Duty. What are you talking about? Dude, Modern Warfare 3 is the worst Call of Duty. I think it's safe to say... Like the current Modern Warfare 3, not the old one. Oh, all the Call okay. of Duties after they started with SBMM are equally bad in my eyes because I won't play any of them. Because SBMM nah, is that, nah, the Nah, there's definitely better and worse. Like MW 2019 was pretty good. I didn't like the maps, but it was pretty I good straight up. Dude, like... Uh, Cold War, I freaking hate it. It keeps <laughs> getting... the zombies. It keeps getting worse, too. You know, there's a trend that I absolutely mm. hate. And this is across the board, not just video games. This applies to data, or not dating apps. It applies to delivery apps, like food apps, like DoorDash. Surge pricing or like changing the rules because of the customer in any way. Again, SBMM, right? It's like, oh, the player has these qualities. So we'll queue up this kind of game. DoorDash, surge pricing. Oh, this person's in a zip code that's more wealthy and there's more people right now that are buying so we're gonna increase your price like stop stop wendy's it's noon and you're hungry 50 percent upcharge like just stop it make the product what it is for everybody make it consistent i hate it i hate it so much this trend makes me uh, it's so depressed and angry and sad and i i hate this trend if i was a regulator i would make it needs surge to, pricing illegal it yeah exactly same i would just make it illegal you can't do it Changing no, the experience it. of the product because of like some arbitrary thing so the company makes more money in that way is so awful. I hate it so much. I would make it illegal. Garden Warfare 2 is the greatest. You know what's weird? I've heard that a lot. No. And I've never even touched the game. I have not I have no remote connection to it, but I have heard that for some reason Garden Warfare 2, the Plants vs. Zombies game is dope. It is a great game. I do agree. What about dude? But, uh, Black Ops 2 was my That's not how supply and demand works. That's a respectable opinion. Of course, if the I'd person in front of same. you orders something, then that I am... Favorite Call of Duty game. Becomes more my favorite yeah. multiplayer Call of Duty was probably BO2. My favorite Zombies was BO3, not because of the vanilla maps, because of customs. Oh, I'm gonna uh, my favorite campaign, okay. probably MW2019, followed closely by Infinite Warfare. BO2 had my favorite, like, multiplayer base mm -hmm. maps without dlc yeah because like yeah. other games had great dlc maps but bo2 just killed it right off the bat but you the didn't like bl2 bo2's dlc maps i thought they were pretty good no no they, they were fine but like you know like magma or or whatever that uh the the takeoff map or whatever it was called i i wasn't mm, like yeah. a big fan of those like studio was great it's a great remaster yeah we record. love studio chat i have but, a question but, does mining yeah. gemstones also give you a chance for scrap? Or is it just like glacite, mithril, like ores? Or like Gla 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 glockite. Gla glockite. Glockite. <laughs> Used to craft the glock. <laughs> Used to craft the glock. 
Skylock really Skylock changing directions. Lock. <laughs> God Warfare 2 has so much content, the community is still alive like seven years later. That's crazy. Rank, prepare for orange name. How? Do not buy me MVP++. Plus plus. I'm a YouTube rank. I'm nicked. How did we get like one of the best FPSs of all time? Nobody played it. How did that like happen? Which one? Titanfall 2. I heard a oh. lot of good things about the movement Dude, systems. It's so good. It's the best it. movement out of all of the advanced movements I've ever felt in a game. It's just so freaking good. I almost swore. <laughs> I felt a lot of movement from you. Are there only 14 huh? people on kick right now? That makes sense. That no, is what's funny. Up? What's up? You got a little group of people over there. I wonder if I've Some gotten any monetization so far on there. Do you just get it instantly or do you have to meet a requirement? I might have to meet a requirement. I'm not sure. Hey, Chad, like, does uh, anyone Lego know how easy. monetization works on kick? I'm playing Lego Batman 2 right now. Such a great game. <laughs> Dude, it's Batman such a great game. game. What are you snickering about? I've never played Fantastic. it. I've barely, I've only played a couple. Lego you know what? Games. I oh, did I like thoroughly it. enjoy Lego Star Wars, so I'll give you that. Which it's one? A great game. There's like six of them. <laughs> uh, Lego Star Wars 2 PS2. The one with the mystery door that I never got to open. Hmm. Please create a Stripe Connect account in order to enable subscriptions on your channel. Oh, so you just set up a Stripe? Stripe, interesting. Interesting. Right? Processor. I guess we'll deal with that later. After, after stream. Then again, after stream, it's going to be like 6 a.m. and I'm going to be so sleep deprived. <laughs> You're going to keep streaming until 6 a.m. tomorrow? <laughs> well, I have to. It's a mining fiesta. I didn't know you were going to stream the whole fiesta. That's you, you have to. You well, won't. here's what's going to happen. I'm going to probably be on YouTube for another hour and a half. I'm going to end the YouTube stream, send everybody to Twitch. And then we're going to have our after hours where uh, some more mature themes might happen. For Dude, example. I'll be there for that. <laughs> Not Go all. Of the It'll be... I will partake in my my new daily habit of the gummies, but I'm not gonna have that footage on YouTube. <laughs> yeah, try like a Marvel superhero too. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know why that was so funny. Cursing out of context, dude. I want to hear you swear so bad. Can you just do it to shock me? Hey, there's a mechanic for that, you know. If people pay a thousand dollars. There, we have that. We have a setup for that already. If chat really does want to hear no, a swear, want, we can make I that want, happen. I want, I want you to die in a video game, and then, well, I can't say it right now. I'll say it in the after hours, I guess. But I really just want Go like for it. you to. Doesn't matter. I want. I want you the to. After hours. At four. I want you to. <laughs> yeah, at four thirty. <laughs> I want you to freak me out. Like you're just like in Skyblock. We're sitting there quiet, and then you die and go shit. <laughs> that would be really funny. <laughs> like I. It would, I would lose a lot of oxygen. You know, there has been a development in that. Every now and again, it will appear in my thoughts now. Oh, it's starting. Oh, it's, oh my God. It is, it is starting. He's manifesting I gotta, it in I gotta his be mind. careful, chat, because... Four for, years from now, he's gonna say it once in a while. <laughs> there are situations that make me mad, and I'll think it, but I won't say it. But it, that started a, about six months ago-ish. That is so funny. That is so funny. Is there yeah, well, a reason here, he thing, doesn't right? swear? Because I'm an awkward person with social anxiety and yep. I, I, used to have, I used to have the same issue where I didn't swear because of the same reasons. And then I just like started one day and I can't stop. <laughs> <laughs> Once you start, you can't go back. I have another friend that had the same thing as well. They started and they also can't go back after they started. I mean, there's people that congratulate me on having the self-control to not swear ever on my stream. And I'm like, bro, I d it's not a conscious thing. <laughs> it's just my nature. Okay, oh, I found it. This aquamarine for some reason is really annoying to find. Yeah, like self-control, like as if. Like, if you guys knew how many milligrams of delta 9 i have consumed in the past month go ahead and um i'll be right back actually <laughs> that's just like i'm out 
That was the wrong gemstone I was supposed to find. Citrine. I'm dumb. They made Cookie Clicker a real part of the game? Oh yeah, that's been a thing for a while. It doesn't do anything. Which is probably a good thing, considering the rest of the game is kind of already Clicker Simulator. Cookie Clicker. <laughs> You should play actual cookie clicker. Uh, I've played it before. It seems like it's, it's not it, bad. It's fun for like maybe an hour or two, but I got bored of it really fast. Yeah. That makes sense. It's probably about the same as how I would feel. W I mean, fit 30. This is a Walmart shirt I bought for eight bucks. <laughs> You, you've had that shirt every time I've seen you. Yep. Which is so sad. I'm as close as you can get to a cartoon character in real life in terms of like genuine habits and not just trying to be a cartoon character, like just inherent traits. Right. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> Refuel your drill. True. There's no reception in here. I forgot about that. Could probably change the lobbies. Let's go 30. What? No, that's just the thing people say at 30. What are you talking about, Luther? What what has you excited? What what happened? Also, I can't when even find it. When you say it that way, it sounds like you're saying like neuter. Oh, I got portal, that's all? Oh, perfect. All right. Whenever you're ready, I suppose. Can warp me in, potentially. If not, I'll go grab. Oh, there we go. So right out the gate, you're mining the ores. Honestly, that probably makes sense because it resets the cold. There's a third thread about what? Oh, what's up, Duralius? Hey, 30, uh, did you see the new alpha? No, what's going on? He didn't read my bits? Oh, I should probably catch up on those. Uh, Jaden, thank you for the 100 bits. Also, uh, 30, if you didn't see alpha is open, here's what's on it. And then in quotes, blocked URL. <laughs> Denied by Streamlabs. April 9th, Hoppity Chocolate Factory? What are you, what are, what are you on about? Is this like an Easter update? Didn't Easter already happen? No, Cho Easter was yesterday. Chocolate Rabbit Factor. Oh, the door just closed. I was so confused. All right, hold on. I need to play the game for a second before we look at that. Uh, where are the corpses? I must murder them. Oh, I meant that doesn't make sense. They're already dead. I must find them and loot their corpse. There we go. Got the bunch of average loot. Here's the other one. Hello. Scrap, please. Ooh, a red goblin egg. Oh, boy. How'd you, how'd you get key? No, the ones in lapis armor, you don't need a key. It's the tungsten ones where you need a key. Are blue eggs easier to get from corpses? I think so, based on what I've seen. Wait, oh, I was confused. For a second, I'm like, wait, I saw Derelius' messages in Twitch chat, but he's also in YouTube chat. And I was like, oh, because he probably didn't see the... Yeah, we really... Or I didn't see the YouTube chat. We need to fix that. And we won't. It looks like we're going to have to wait until tomorrow's stream for it to fix itself. When are primal dragons coming? I invested so much. That is not advisable. I, I really do hope that, like... If they have to have Primal Dragon, 
I really think it should be equipment, but if they're gonna have to make an armor set, like just, they need to update the way you get it. It should be less RNG dependent in my opinion, and it should not just be more summoning eyes. Like introduce more materials and then <coughs> modify a summoning eye, sure. But like not more summoning eyes, like it's just trash. And the fact that it just completely power creeps all of Crimson Isles should in itself be a reason not to use it. But it's just so, it just doesn't fit. There's nowhere where it fits. They'd have to completely redo the balancing of the entire update to get it to fit. I almost invested all my coins in Corleonite literally last night. I'm so sad. I mean, the price is going to spike when the update's new, but the price will return back to at least close to normal. It'll probably settle about 25% higher than it was after the update hype is over. Wait, what is normal? Like three mil? Or at least it was last night. I don't know because the update dropped, so now demand is spiked. Give me scrap game? Yeah, I know. Scrap is like really rare. And the fact that it's only a chance for one of the things. I'm like 50k, 1.8 mil before. It said 3 mil when I was grinding for Coley and I yesterday. At least VLC was. Perhaps BLC lied. Or I was looking at the stack price. Since I got six of them, that might make a lot more sense. <gasps> I'm so tired. That's going to be me in about 12 hours. That's me right now, man. I haven't slept. Well, I did, but barely. My mining speed is so bad. <laughs> What's it even at right now? It's down to less than 5k. Ugh. <laughs> this is slow. Even with the second best drill in the game. So how do you get the crystals? For the new gems you don't like nucleus runs handle the rest of them but how do you get the new ones you get it in the mine shafts where so it's only a random chance oh so since this is like a ruby mine shaft would there be a ruby gemstone in here probably About to die. Must leave. Ah, run away. Ah. Can you ask Looter how he's getting the mine shafts to spawn? As far as I know, they just decide to. <laughs> <laughs> it just happens when you're mining like anything in this area. Back to commissions. Actually, hmm. I'm trying to think here. How do people like make fun of Facebook but use Instagram? <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> They're the same thing. Same company. <sighs> oh, servers are restarting for a game update. So you need a million collection. Instagram reels are based. I don't know. All I hear about Instagram reels is one of my friends keeps seeing people die on them. 
And that's it. That's the only thing I've ever heard about them. What's the update? Probably some patch for a new. It's typically how update day goes. Hmm. So I've got almost enough Aquamarine for one flawless, which I believe gives sea creature chance, right? The question is how much sea creature chance? I guess we can talk to Geo, right? I'm assuming they updated him. <coughs> or is it this guy? It might be this guy. <laughs> Fredulous? Get a pigeon? I have one. Does it not say what the resource gives? Was I misinformed? I could have sworn that the gemstones told you what they give you. I guess if I hover over the lore, then it will say. The lore? Okay, Onyx is crit damage. Aquamarine is sea creature chance. <laughs> Yo, you croaking in the bed. <laughs> Forging fortune from Citrine and farming fortune from Peridot. The question is how much though? Also, are the gemstone slots on Fermento already unlocked? I guess we're about to find out. It costs Peridot. All right. Fine. <laughs> Blink Lego Batman. Two. <laughs> Great game. Dose. Great game. The second. The sequel. Yeah. The sequel has all the DC superheroes in it. Like, you can play Superman, Flash, Green Lantern. That's so cool. Is he really a lantern? Oh, you need 50k. Alright, so unlocking the first slot. And then we're going to put one of these. Why is, it why is he called the Green Lantern? He doesn't have a lantern that's green at all. Six farming fortune per piece. Green ring doesn't sound as cool. Eh, it's just a ring. It's not terrible. It doesn't sound as cool. Chat, but like I'm... he's not a lantern. <laughs> should I make it a goal to get um, decent peridot on my fermento armor? Should I like do that? Because that's a good amount of farming fortune, not gonna lie. I am trying to finish the garden, after all. I just watched every Iron Man video in a month and I cooked. I mean, what? congratulations for not being sick of my voice by now. <clears throat> oh, in about five minutes, our golden plates are going to be done. He recharges his bring with a green lantern. Wait, really? <clears throat> He recharges the ring with a green lamp. 30, you would know superhero stuff. Not him. Oh. He's like a C tier superhero. We don't really hear about him often. I, I don't know. I, I feel like he's at least B. Maybe. I feel like like Black Window is, I think, a C tier. <laughs> I don't even know. <laughs> Wait, oh, you said, okay. You actually confused it with that, which I think is awesome. <laughs> no, he did that on purpose, but it was enough to trip me up because I have brain rot from Garden. I know he did that on purpose, and it got you, and I love that. Why did it get me, bro? I need, I need a vacation. Black window. I need a vacation. Who? Who? Uh. <laughs> uh. Uh. Can I look at the ebbs? For what? Chocolate factory milestone. What? <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Wonka? <laughs> we get Wonka content in the sky block? No This way. looks like an April Fool's update to Skyblock. Not gonna lie. I mean, look at this. 
The symbol on the ring is also a lantern, and his ring gives off light, which he can use. Prestiging your chocolate to form a factory of will entirely reset it. However, it allows it. Oh my god, it is cookie clicker! It chocolate you... rabbit, <laughs> chocolate production bonuses, chocolate production multiplier. Whoa! Uh, Wait, prestige? It gives Skyblock to... XP! Oh! What is this? What is this? Chocolate prestige 1000. Thousand and twelve. All right, Jaden, requires... send me patch notes. We need to look at this now. Requires a hundred and fifty million chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, <laughs> there's what? no patch notes, bruh. How did y'all find it? Hoppity's collection. <laughs> that that sounds like an April that Fool's sounds so there. trolly. Hoppity, come on. Chocolate factory milestones. Nah, this is fake. There's no way. This, none where, of this looks real, dude. Where are you getting this information from? Jaden's sending it to me. Apparently, it's on Alpha Network right oh, now. Oh, it's on Alpha right now? Oh, damn. That's really funny. I think what do you I'm, do? I think I'm going to guess it's real just because Duralius also brought up the same thing earlier. So, yep. Your YouTube rank Chocolate can join right now. I'm you want honest, a cookie clicker? I'm here for the content that we can actually upload. So like, no. Yeah. He'll, uh, he'll wait. You wanted cookie clicker, didn't you not? Did I? I think so. I don't know. Maybe I'm tired. But... I wanted the garden to be like Farmville, passive instead of <laughs> actively farming. That's what I wanted. Speaking of tired, Fezzy, what's your day list on Spotify? Sound like. My what? Oh, my day list? Yeah. Oh, oh I never looked no. at that. What does it look like? Chat. How do I even find it? <laughs> Chat, I have a screenshot to share with okay. you. Is it a weird day list thing? The, the top result is Quadonka. Uh, it's Quadeca. <laughs> will be uh, Scrapyard, which was a very good album. Jane Remover is there. That's an interesting know, name for a rabbit. There interesting what don't worry about it wow lore lore <laughs> moment oh wait no 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 wait 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 there's there's actually um so dante i believe you can actually technically capture a soul his soul in a a necromancy item but he, there is no mob in the game currently called dante right so uh, other than the uh, how do the you, one how do you know this don't ask <laughs> i don't even remember this sounds I like this. i the fact that you know about this before me is kind of like so if there's a rabbit getting added to the game called dante that's probably why there is evidence of it being capturable soul wise probably there was some video i saw i don't remember what it was called. there's another one called einstein decreases the time it takes to charge your time tower to seven hours I'm gonna be honest, my day list is only filled with a single artist that I've listened to before. All of the other ones I don't even really know. What what was it called though? Oh wait, I didn't realize it had a different name. It has yeah, a different changes, name every day? It changes every uh so there's early mornings, mornings, no. Oh, next update is in a couple hours. Yeah, yeah. So it, I think there's four playlists a day, I want to say, or maybe three. That's kind of cool. Analog oh, Noise Pop Tuesday them, afternoon. <laughs> each of them have different names, and it changes daily. It's it's also, I think Analog is spelled wrong. <laughs> is it a, is it without oh. an E? There's oh, no hey. E. Chat, look, I found a mind chat. Or you. Um, I'm going to wait to... you in Analog? Hey, Looter, you might want to promote me. Hello, this is a mine shaft. You got a mine shaft. I did. Sweet. I like how it appears as just a portal, because that makes sense. Oh, that's important. We just got the glacite amalgamation recipe. That's good. That's used in a lot of recipes. So now I guess we can, uh, once we run out of stuff to forge that's from pre update, we'll start working on those. <coughs> Relic of power, yeah. Oh, this is a, okay. This is, I forgot the name of the gemstone. It's a topaz cave. Ooh. It's 
got the shutters. Did any of you have a Blackberry growing up? No. No. I didn't. I, I heard about it plenty. A, my dad had like a work phone, which is a Blackberry. And yeah. there was there was some interesting games on it, I'd say. Snake. No, no, no. It was uh I sent you patch notes. Alright, I'll look at that later. Corpse. Uh, Skyblock level up. Corpse. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Um. <laughs> so I wonder how much I have to play for us to get a video's worth of content. I think we have at least one already. Well, I'm going to keep going, so let's... Maybe it'd be a good idea to make it a chonkin' episode. Get some... Get some momentum back in the algorithm. So I'll keep going. Well, obviously I'm going to keep going. I followed this channel, but got no channel points. Channel points are earned by follows. They're earned by watch time. Yep. I find it interesting that there's like three updates that have been on Alpha Network that are brand new in the past like month. Despite... Maybe the floodgates are finally opening. Is it interesting or sad? It's definitely <laughs> not sad. It's like, wow, the admins are presenting us with new stuff. That's new. That's weird. It's been like two years. <laughs> Oh that is pretty it hasn't literally been two years, but I consider Feels the last like the last real content drop, in my opinion, was Rift. And that was over a year ago. And if we want to talk about like a successful content drop, it was probably Crimson Isle. Garden, you could you could say. Okay, this update that's on Alpha, I can almost guarantee it was supposed to be an Easter update, but they fell behind schedule. Probably. Yeah, sounds like, there's like bunnies, there's chocolate, candy, Easter egg yeah. hunt mechanic. Yep. Yeah, yep. yeah, yep. Do you think Hytale will release a beta this year? <laughs> That's <laughs> funny. That's a good I, one. You know what? Uh, I don't even think there's going to be one. I think there might be like a closed really... no, beta I, that they might invite no, 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 like no. I've, content I've asked... creators to participate in, but I don't think there's going to be a beta. I would say less than a year ago, me and some staff member for Hytale did have DMs, and it was. Not just DMs, but also publicly, they've said they will be doing a beta. They they have, but I don't believe them. <laughs> <laughs> they said it recently, too. They've said it very recently, and very recently. I don't believe them. I don't believe them. I don't think so. I just don't. I don't know why. What's going to release first? Bro, Luder got hot... three scrap? What? <clears throat> What's going to release first? Hightail or GTA 6? GTA 6. GTA 6. <laughs> GTA 6 is coming out first. so sad. We got oh, another Half-Life game, another GTA. Uh... Helldivers 3. What Hell the <laughs> hell am I? Whoa, that Skybox <clears throat> is crazy. Okay, I know we're literally in a cavern right now, but like, that's a wild screenshot right there. Look at these terrain. Oh, wait, that's Crimson Isle, isn't it? I don't even know. <sighs> Everything is so weird looking. And why is it all green? Whoa, it's so green. Why is it so green? That looked like the deep caverns, yeah. If Hytale released, would you switch to it? Yes. <clears throat> That's been the plan for ever. No, I think I'm actually kind of, you know, this is yeah, fun. I want to live like this forever. Yeah. <laughs> what I will say well, is that Creator Code <laughs> may incentivize me to continue streaming Skyblock and then making the occasional video, but the main You're going to content... get a Hytale Creator Code, so don't worry about it. Hey, why not both? <laughs> Frick you, man. That's Deep Caverns? Oh, I knew that. It's weird that Elden Ring is getting a DLC two years. Nope. Three after it came out. Yeah. And? Like, the game's been out for three years. They've already made, like... It's a great hasn't, game. Stop hasn't, Soft, hasn't Soft from Soft made, like, two new games since then? No, one. Uh, one. Armored Core. Is it just Armored Core? Yeah. They should make a Pokemon game. 
<laughs> from soft Pokemon yeah. game. Hey, you know what? It'd probably be better than Nintendo right now. Probably, yeah, probably. God. I mean, they're both Japanese, right? What a fall from grace, dude. I, I used to love Nintendo, but now they're awful. Dude, they're actually like kind of evil. They're, they're kind of villains, dude. Like it's not they, even like funny Nintendo anymore. 180. They went from like the silly little kids, like uh, like Nintendo company, like they made like Mario and stuff, and now they'll like take income out of you for the rest of your life if you mess with them. <laughs> like, God, they're... I'm gonna die. No. Dude, just Get slash to L. the exit. Is that Elmo? <laughs> Run! Run! No, it was so close. No. Ah. Uh, now, what are the downsides to that? Do I just miss out on the plus one thousand essence? Is that what it is? Yeah. Do Do Probably. I lose any items or what? Also, the footage is uploaded, by the way, Fezzy. I don't know when you plan on doing that, but now that's available for whenever you feel like. Ugh. Very good. What is the update about? Ice. <laughs> and snow. And cold. I only lost out on 1k powder. Well, considering I have 135,000, I think that's fine. I think I can afford to lose that. Okay. Uh, Tungsten Aquamarine. <sighs> You did record the whole tier list this time, right? I did. Nice. Also, I don't think it was as long. That's but it was close. Said. That makes sense because you did kill a lot of armor <laughs> very quickly. I did. <laughs> this game is not very well balanced in the sense of like all of its gear actually mattering. In the sense of like many things. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even remember hearing this song. I don't know how it made it in the playlist. <clears throat> I mean, it's not terrible. It's just not what I, I just, I have zero recollection of this song. Peridot. This way. I just want to be your this is a very, you know what? This song would be perfect for like a Bed Wars montage, like a TNT jump montage or something like that. Like clutch plays, block clutches. I can't believe Bed Wars died. It died so bad. It just fell out. I don't, so I mean, hard. I get it. I've never seen something so close to the mainstream just die so much, so quick. Yeah. It's a shame too. It was one of my favorite games ever made, but then it just got way too sweaty and hacker infested. Yeah. It's because everyone's quit. Like, ready. well, it's because the normies quit. So the only people left are the sweats it's and cheaters. The sweats and hackers. Yeah. That is the fate of all online competitive multiplayer games. Eventually. I mean, same with Skyblock. It's not, no, not necessarily. Skyblock's well, I mean, PVE, it's an MMO, it's different. Yeah, but it's gonna get botted, you know? I mean, it'll get, I mean, let's look be to Twitter other, game. <laughs> I think the fate of Skyblock is that it's just not, at some point, probably like 10 years from now, it's not gonna be profitable anymore and they'll just reach end of service and they shut it down. I don't think it's gonna be like, oh, every single person in the game mm. is a hacker because like, People macroing and like having, you know, alts and like cheating and skyblock, it's all financially driven. It's all financially motivated. So if the game just isn't profitable for Hypixel anymore, it's probably also the case that like selling coins isn't profitable either because there's no demand anymore. So I think ultimately the game's just gonna, I don't know what will happen is imagine if like Hytale kills Minecraft, therefore skyblock. <laughs> That would be a weird timeline. It's just a, it's just a casual tea that had to be made. It's just a crush. Damn. When the servers close, the discussion with Soren resets so you get more scrap. Ooh, I love exploits. How do I get back to the camp? I want the free scrap. Gimme, gimme. I want it. <clears throat> 
Where's the guy? Did he disappear? Wait. Where's the dude? He's not here anymore. <laughs> he left. He's, he's he going just home left him. He's got things to do. I don't know what to tell you. It was a bug. Oh, it only happened to a few people. Never mind. So what do you now that we've been streaming for six and a half hours? What do you guys think of the new uh, music playlist? We've probably played just about everything in the new one. I think the playlist was about six hours long. All I want to say is that they don't really care about us. Not bad. This looks super fun. Oh, done. Again, my standards have dropped so far because of Garden. So I would like, like to think I can that say that yes, this is fun, fantastic. but like, is it actually fun or am I just too far gone? It I also don't know. could be sarcasm, perhaps. Didn't seem like it. Yeah, realistically, they... look at what you're doing. You are mining ice <laughs> with a prismarine shark <laughs> for six hours. <laughs> so hey, realistically, you know this, how fun this can gameplay... that be? This gameplay loop is not as boring as other gameplay loops. That, is that not bode said, well. <laughs> what do you mean that doesn't bode well? It doesn't bode well for the fun factor of the rest of the game. This is higher tier content. <laughs> hey, you know what? It means we're stepping in the right direction. That's what it means. Claim the forges. Oh, true. Yeah, it was sarcasm. Roger. Oh. Maybe I am too far gone. I'm really tired. <laughs> I jumped instead of clicking on him again. This guess, what do you guys think about the new uh, Suicide Squad game? I've, I've heard it's um I've heard it's very bad. Mid. Yeah, same. I've heard that it's I've heard that the backlash is a little overblown. Like it's not the worst game ever made. It's got some redeeming stuff about it, but overall it kind of just is mediocre. Has your motivation for Skyblock decreased in the last couple <laughs> of years? Uh <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> That's a way to put it. <laughs> I mean, you could to, say that. To put it, uh, it's hard to say because like this, it's it's been five years, bro. I, I have completely changed who I am as a person twice since this game has come out. Yes. I've noticed no difference. <laughs> <laughs> Unfortunate. Like this what, is a, a like whole years you know each other now? Something like that. That's almost half a decade. Crazy. And me and Fezzi have known each other. I can't believe twenty nineteen it was five years ago. I can believe it. Like th that's ridiculous. Five years ago was twenty nineteen. Bro, that year just ended. <laughs> it was it was like a lifetime ago, but also like five minutes ago at the same time. I know what you mean. You stinking person. Speaking of Fezzi, have you taken a shower? Yeah. <laughs> okay, because I haven't. Okay. I have not. You could probably tell by my greasy hair. Actually, it doesn't look that bad. It's okay. Where's, uh, <laughs> where's Titan? I don't know. Somewhere in the house. Doing okay, cat okay, things. Doing, yeah, just I, I doing cat things. You can get a legendary accessory from the chocolate factory. 30 likes to Alistair. Are you going to talk <clears throat> about that video you made five years ago about you in the future? Yeah, so here's the thing. I recorded the reaction to it, and I accidentally opened the file at the exact minute that the file was made five years ago. 
exact time and day, five years in the future, by accident, I was supposed to record, like the file's literally called open this on April 4th because of burnout and like me just being like, just burnt. I did it on the 6th and the morning of the 6th because I knew the morning is when I'd have the highest motivation. And it was the exact time the file was made, the exact time. It was very weird. But no, the whole file, the whole recording was essentially like me basically talking about AI and like how I need to basically make my AI chat bot that I was planning on. This is five years ago, by the way, chat. I was way ahead of the game. Like I basically predicted, I wanted to be open AI essentially five years ago. I wanted to be the guy that made like the <clears throat> AI chatbot that became self-aware. Well, that well, five years yet. ago, GPT one or two not... probably existed. I don't know, maybe because we got three. It definitely wasn't public by then. No, I mean no, no, no one no. was even talking no, no. about AI chatbots until like yeah, no, they, literally they, a year and a half ago. <laughs> they were not public. No, definitely not. But Transformers, I think, were a thing. They were just they were budding, and now here they are getting ready to take over the world. But anyway, so in order to actually make that video, I'm gonna have to make a production out of it because just the reaction to old me is not a video. It's a cool detail, but I think it should be thrown in with a video that has a bigger scope talking about me at that time being at my lowest point. So it's gonna be a little bit of commentary and post-production. That video is gonna take a little bit more work. It wasn't as easy was as I thought it was gonna be. 2016 was eight years ago. I always think it was four years ago for some reason. Same. I think that reason decade. is COVID. Yeah. For a lot of people, time just kind of stopped when COVID hit mentally. What about emotionally? I mean, how many people do you know that mentally are in the exact same place they were when COVID started? I know a lot. I don't. Okay. I've heard it's absolutely <laughs> wrecking. <laughs> I've heard it's like really, really bad for like it is. teachers. It is bad, yeah. Like what? You'll hear about students that like because of the pandemic were, are just stunted like permanently. I don't think they've oh, ever sure, seen yeah. pandemic to be honest. I didn't Like hear I any... still think about like, oh, any second the government could just be like, Oh, there's gonna be a lock lockdown again, you know? The... Like that's like a real thing that will always be in my head. There's like a whole generation's education that just got borked because of that. I Gen mean, A's entire like starter part of their education, like school to high school, just got bonked. <laughs> <laughs> just got, it just got like taken away. <laughs> How's your fitness and gym life fitting into your YouTube life working? Oh, it's not. It's not working. <laughs> <laughs> the problem is I have neurodivergent brain and I tend to hyper hyper focus. And this time around that hyper focus is- I tend to hibernate. <laughs> I tend to hyper focus. And my most recent hyper focus has been Max and Garden, which unfortunately is basically an unstoppable, what's the, what's the phrase? An unstoppable projectile hitting an immovable object. Force, unstoppable force. <laughs> what was that noise? <laughs> <laughs> it did. It, the, the Discord just didn't accept whatever noise you made. But no, you have like basically infinite motivation, but for a really stupid task versus a <laughs> task that's really long. That's yeah. what the past month has been for me. Like, I really wish I can control where I get my hyper fixations, like where they go. It's like, if I could just hyper fixate mm -hmm. on like making, I don't know, a buffer of 20 videos, like that'd be nice. <laughs> I wish I could hyper fixate on like sleeping. <laughs> Do I put tiger plushy or bubble gum on my Enderman pet? Plushy. Don't use bubble gum on any pet. What the hell did you just say? What, what is that? <laughs> You just put, it's a pet and you, you give it bubble. Gum. I'm pretty sure. That's the, a bad idea. Hey, these items the were in the game before you quit. I'm pretty sure. Bubble gum? Doesn't, that doesn't mean we got them. <laughs> Was the mythological festival a thing before you quit? No. Oh, never mind. Has it been that long? 
Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. I'm pretty sure that Skyblock has been around like That's longer. Like, that came out in 2020. I'm pretty sure Bernie has been around less than Skyblock is. How's how does that? How do you structure that sentence? I'm trying. Bernie's to say. been <laughs> out of Skyblock for longer than he's been in Skyblock since. There you go. I think yeah. that's what yeah. you're trying yeah. to there say. There you go. Right. Yeah. And we are still here. <laughs> <laughs> The last, the last thing I remember was uh, Enderman Slayers were just released. That's what it was. That's one of my last, like, predominant I'm memories. I'm pretty sure Mythological existed before then. Maybe you just never played that part of the game. Wait, do you mean the, uh, where, where the zookeeper comes and you have to buy pets from him? No, Diana, the mayor, with the Chimera books. And... No, no, no. We're talking about the, the, the Enderman update that had the first, like, big strength nerf. Uh... Well, chat. Well, no, you were talking about how you don't know what bubblegum No, I don't is. know what bubblegum and plushies are. Yeah, those items have been in the game for a very long time. I'm pretty sure they were released at the <laughs> exact same... Okay. Was it All I remember are Turtle Shell and, like... Jerry's 3D sunglasses and all of that stuff. That's I'm pretty mean. sure those items, the items that you were confused about were in the game before you quit. It just probably wasn't something that was relevant to you at the time. That sounds about right. Does Fuzzy have a YouTube channel? It's dead. Fuzzy? Fuzzy. <laughs> I technically do, but it's dead. I don't don't bother. <laughs> There's like three videos on there that are on 30s channel and better. Do you still have YouTube rank? I do. I'm surprised they haven't taken it away yet. <laughs> no, no. Why I... are you surprised? They don't take away YouTube rank for inactivity. They take it away for being problematic. <laughs> yeah. So what you're saying is I should go rob a bank <laughs> and then get convicted and maybe I'll get it. Maybe it'll go away. <laughs> yeah. All right. Finding I keep track of IRL crimes, but sure. Sometimes. <laughs> I can think, think of a, I can think of a few high profile cases in the Minecraft space. I'm not gonna mention. Oh, um, me too. But I'm just like, uh, if it gets publicized. Sure. What if I vlog myself? Did I have that? the weirdest? <laughs> the, <vlog. laughs> the dynamic of meeting YouTubers is so strange because, like, when I finally. It's strange, but in a good way. Like when I went to visit all my YouTube friends in, the, well, not all of them, but a good bit of them from the Hypixel space in like January, <clears throat> there was like, there was almost like, there were talks of like, oh, there's some other YouTubers that like live in Florida that maybe like me and this other person that are in the group could go meet up with since they're local. And then one of them gets canceled. And then it's like, oh, I guess we won't oh. be doing that. <laughs> Oh, one of them got canceled? One of the people that I was going to meet. Oh, gotcha. We'll talk about that. Actually, technically two of them. So that's cool. Yeah, I'm lucky. Oh, yeah, I'm not going to say more than that because I don't like to gossip on stream. But yeah, I was sad. I was like, oh, cool. I get to make some friends that are like local that I get to hang out with on a regular basis. Nope. <laughs> uh oh, a convicted murderer. <laughs> <laughs> so I was, I was a bit sad. Man, it's fallen down and Lego City. Cancel culture. Oh, hey, 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 chat. Tr trust me, these, at least in these instances, it was deserved. Let, they're not victims of cancel culture. They deserved it. Or at least one of them does, out of the people I'm thinking of right now, which I'm, again, not going to say publicly. The thing that, I don't know. My opinion is that humans, we tend to overcompensate whenever there's like an issue and we try to hard correct it. We go too far the other direction. I think that's what cancel culture is. Yeah. Is we've gone, we've taken it a bit too far, but that doesn't mean it's bad. It just means that we need to, you know, hear people out, hear out both sides, you know, like every other crime. <laughs> I don't know. Mm. 
Have you ever considered deleting your Iron Man profile? No. <laughs> because it's my entire existence right now. It's my job, it's my day-to-day, -day, it's my self-worth in some ways, which is bad. It's, <laughs> it's, it's my source of content, it's my source of pain and misery. <laughs> it's everything to me. <laughs> I don't think you guys understand. I've averaged 12 hours a day in this game for the past two months. So, think about that for a second. <laughs> And that's considered oh, progress. Only a second? Okay, I guess I'll stop thinking about it. Oh my god, this guy stinks. Oh my <laughs> god. Do you think Hypixel will release Skyblock on the high tail? No. No. <laughs> no. They might make an MMO, but they're not making a Skyblock. Skyblock is... Uh, high tail is already an RPG, kind of. Well, no, no. not RPG. Uh, uh, um... open, open world. <laughs> No, no, no. Well, it's, it's obviously it's not, a boss survival game, but it's, it's, it's got MMO. RPG elements on it. Yeah, yeah. Within it. I thought you were going to say it's an MMO, and I was like, I hope not. No. <laughs> that would be awful. Why? Because MMOs in general are not a genre that I enjoy at all. <laughs> MMO is... Technically, yeah, there's, a, there's like a... It's a genre, like, you can definitely bundle it like that, but... MMO really just means like a lot of people in a big circle. <laughs> like, I mean, that's what the it, words mean, but it's what the words imply. You know, there are some like... MMO, like what you're probably talking about, like what Skyblock is, is an RPG MMO, technically. Like kind of a fan, like a, like a, you know, there's fantasy elements and stuff. I don't know. How do you have negative That's the root point is, I don't know. <laughs> I mentioned this earlier. The negative gems is because someone bought me gems and I noticed, I didn't know who bought me gems. I just saw the chat message and was like, oh yeah, I'll buy some cookies. And I did. And then the person refunded. What did the say? I haven't been contacted about my negative gem balance. I think I'm just going to buy enough gems to make it positive again. So I don't get in trouble with the admins. <laughs> why would you fault. get in Why this isn't, why would you get in trouble for something that you, that isn't your fault? Yeah. I don't know what's high pixel, man. Like they're gonna I be didn't like, think there was gonna be, gonna be a like, problem. Our system when... glitched out, and you're banned. <laughs> well, it's no, it's not the system glitching out. It's a guy buying me gems and then charge back. Yeah, somebody it. exploited yeah, our system, and it wasn't you. You're banned. To TLDR: Some guy tried to get me banned. That's typically how it. That that's a thing that hasn't worked for years. For the record, I I have direct contact with staff where we could just figure these things out. But yeah, about three years ago, that would have gotten me banned, 100%. Yeah, but don't spend your own money just to like... Well, that. the thing is, I I need it. I need the gems or the bits for cookies because I have a feeling I'm going to need more than 36k bits for the rest of my profile. Yeah, but you'll have to buy double first to like make it to zero and then buy it again. Yeah, but I already redeemed the cookie, so I already got the value out of that money they charged back. Because I, that's why it's a negative balance and not just a zero. It's because I bought stuff with the gems and then they got wiped. Yeah. So you're a liar. Chat, are making, chat you're making this a much bigger thing than it is. It's fine. <laughs> There's this is there's zero stakes to this whatsoever. If the admins have a problem with it, then I could spend the five bucks. Like it's fine. It, it's, it does not have any lasting implications with the channel. I'm sure this happens a lot. I have forgotten what umber is. Oh, it's the clay. It's not like I've been mining these blocks for se six hours, seven hours. Did you see the Fallout show coming out? I assumed the instant that it was announced that it was going to be trash, and so far, it seems like my assumption is going to be correct. <laughs> the amount of retcons already is very sad. It's going to be the Halo show V2, which is disappointing. The only good show is The Last of Us that has been adapted in a video game. Even though... It may not necessarily be... I don't know. I haven't seen it, but I've heard it's... I... I've enjoyed it. I enjoyed the Oh, wait. Pokemon. 
Which one? The animated series. That's that doesn't count. That's based on the games, no no. Ash is red. <laughs> like, it's that the... doesn't count. What do you mean that doesn't count? Yes, that it does. Definitely does. Oh. The show is based on the game, literally. <laughs> Even the regions line up with the new games. I am farming oh, I 30 and mining 45, which I try to do mining, 100%. Oh, I thought the show came out first. No, the game did. The first game did. I think I'm gonna have more jazz in my stream playlist from now on. It's very relaxing. Oh, relaxing. <laughs> When barn fishing? I know I have to do a ton of that. I'm not excited about it. For Hydra heads? For a lot of things, including Hydra heads. I need to get diver armor. I need to get, um, there's a few little things. I need to get sharks, shark kills. So I have to be in attendance with a, I forgot, festival? Shark festival, is that what it's called? I don't remember. Onyx. Is getting the Vondra worth it? Probably. If you get it early enough. If you get it too late, then you might not profit the difference. But considering how they just added like 30% more mining progression, probably. Then again, if they actually make it easier to get, like I've been begging them to do for the past two years, then the price might drop. You know oh, what they 30. should do? The polls, the polls are spoken. What poll? There's a poll? I'm not watching the platforms chat pages directly. I'm looking at like a, a chat widget thing that only shows the chat messages, not anything else. Oh, there is a poll. What's the poll? A golden chicken pet. Is that a thing on the alpha? A golden chicken. Oh, what's up, Yegan? It doesn't matter if it's worth it or not. Just get it if you want it. I mean, that's pretty much the entirety of Skyblock, realistically. It's like, is it worth it? Well, technically everything is, because you need to do all of it to get to, to max the game. It's just a matter of what should you get first. Whoa. Dark cacao truffle consumed to boost your fortune by 60 M? Oh, for 60 minutes. So all the types of fortune? Interesting. Rabbit bro level 50 employee? Bro, what is all of this? <laughs> they really... Bro, I bet the admins are pissed because this is clearly an Easter update and they missed the deadline. This is 100% Easter update.
Did you ever regain T5 revs? I don't know what you mean by that. I got to rev 9 and crafted the Reaper Orb. I don't know if that's a sufficient answer. What was any of that? <laughs> How are we doing with Heart of the Mountain XP? <laughs> We're a third of the way there. Oh boy. So it gives you two tokens in the mountain and forgeable items. Nearly two whole levels of Skyblock XP? Oh my God. Real quick, look at the bottom message. People in guild are already hard of the mountain nine. Ask guild because you're doing something wrong. Why? Have you checked the perks? What perks? Bro, I can't get any of the new perks because you need to have hard of the mountain eight. What are you talking about? I mean, bottom message in DMs. Oh. The chocolate shop comes around every spring in the Skyblock year. Oh, it's like every five days. Interesting. Yeah, I'm really confused. Why is my heart of the mountain going up so freaking slow? That doesn't make any sense. Like, why are people in guild already heart of the mountain nine? Like, what am I doing wrong? Are they spamming Nucleus runs? That might be what it is. Also, I keep on forgetting what I'm supposed to be mining. What I can tell you with certainty is that I'm still gonna be doing Mine of Devon Gold during the Fiesta. I'm not dealing with any of this update crap. Downtime, that's what you're doing wrong. I mean, I can't help it. There's like no other citrine on the map. I have to sit here. It seems like it's Heart of the Mountain, or Heart of the Mountain, Nucleus Runs. Me and two other people are fighting for these right now. Bruh. Just to get this one commission out of the way. They're saying if you get lucky with comms, it's 2,800 per nucleus run. Yeah, but I've done that before. I've done nucleus runs where I redeem the gemstone thing every time. And it's not if it's not a luck thing, it's just a strategy thing. And now I'm getting cold. My speed sucks. My speed sucks. Sorry, that was uh my dog. Uh-huh. Oh, you don't believe me? But Nucleus Runs is the answer? Well, I'm not doing that because that's a massive waste. I don't even have the pet that makes it easier. 
I mean, I'm on Iron Man, bro. I can't afford to just do Nucleus runs to skip a part of the game and have to go grind all the parts again. No way. This lobby appears to be pretty trash. Too much competition. Oh, thank you for upgrading your membership from, uh... Oh, it doesn't say what from, but it says upgraded to Devotee. Thank you, uh, Pretty Good. That's their name. <laughs> I need more Onyx. You need to do a Nucleus run to get the pet. It's like the Helix. I don't think so. I thought you get it from the excavation minigame. It's gonna take me a little bit to memorize the shape of these caves, the layout. You can forge a penguin pet? How? You know, it'd be nice if all that overflow XP that I got actually applied. Because it's still technically XP I earned, but, you know, welcome to Skyblock. Ah, <laughs> ah, uh, uh, that was all. Awesome. Ah, that was awesome. Ah, <laughs> I'm playing the uh, Rocket League. You didn't get overflow XP, you got powder instead. Yes and no. For comms, yes. Nucleus runs, you still technically got Heart of the Mountain XP, but I guess that doesn't matter. Are you only streaming on YouTube? No. It's on, um, oh, are you seeing me react to chat messages that you don't see? It's because I am on YouTube, Twitch, and Kick all at the same time. The kick stream is not monetized currently, which is a bit of an L on my part. I will fix that before next stream. So it's kind of just there for your benefit currently because it has no ads. Man, my navigation is so bad. You know what's funny? I would benefit from a mod that worked like secret waypoints in uh, dungeons, but like for the correct type of gemstone I'm supposed to mine, because like I am so fish brained, I get distracted like immediately. Is bad. Twitch has the worst ads. Yeah. From what I hear, YouTube's isn't as bad, but it's getting there. Because they're fighting ad blockers and doubling down with the number of ads. Which, if I'm being 100% honest, this is an unpopular opinion. But if you're not paying for YouTube, what right do you have to use it? It's, it's a service that costs money to maintain, so realistically, you should be paying for it somehow. So I think it's more than fair to have ads. But that's just me. Yeah, I mean, how else are they supposed to make money? I've, I've been paying for premium for a long time. Yeah, and the thing is, like, like, obviously, yes, I am biased because YouTube Premium gives me more income, technically. But, like... 
I am a consumer of, I have YouTube premium and I've been nothing but satisfied with it because I cancel my Spotify and I still have YouTube music and I get no ads on YouTube and I get to play my YouTube videos with my phone screen off so I could be riding my bike with my phone in my pocket and have podcasts, YouTube videos playing. Like it's nice. I don't know. It's a good service. I like I, it. Yeah. Yeah. I really don't have any complaints. I still have Spotify because I get it super cheap because uh Indian mm. you know, account. Um, but yeah, otherwise, uh, I do listen to like YouTube premium when I need to like for my favorite songs that need to be slowed and reverb. <laughs> Why do you have the ads when you could not have ads? I mean, streaming is my job. <laughs> That's like walking up to the, the guy at McDonald's and it's like, hey, can I have a burger? And he's like, yeah, that'll be two thirty nine. And it's like, but can I just have the burger though? <laughs> and then he's like, uh, no. <laughs> what? Yeah, but, what did he just say? <laughs> no, people are asking why I don't, why I have ads on my stream. And it's like, well, why does anyone have ads in the stream? <laughs> like, cause it's their job. You gotta make money, you know? Okay. <laughs> I was confused by the I was uh, trying to I, well well yeah the analogy was stupid because it was trying to point out you know that it doesn't make sense the what the chatter said. I'm not trying to make fun of the person that said that by the way, okay. but that's just how okay. the world works. Okay. <laughs> I was so confused. <laughs> oh, Jack Roger, thank you for the 5. I miss the original stuff like Survival Island and the modded playthroughs. There's a part of me that misses that too, but at the same time, having a career on YouTube is so much better. <laughs> Everything I was doing back then as like a hobby, I was like low key hoping that like this became my job the entire time. And every time a video would die at 2K views, it would make me that much less hopeful that it would happen, but it did. So there you go. Yo, Benjamin, thank you for the 10 bucks. Consider me, cons <laughs> I almost said consider me this. Consider this me paying for those gems someone took from you. <laughs> well, they never took any from me. They, they, they gave me the gems and then charged back. So it made me think I got gems when I didn't. But technically, as of now, I did get the gems. If anything, Hypixel's the one that took the L because I got my cookies. <laughs> This is a bit funny, but if I do want to buy more gems, which I'm going to have to at some point, then yes, that technically costs me, but it's okay because I still got the gems out of it. Third, I'm going to go sleep and stay in chat. Right? That, that's what you mean. I Discord muffled what you said. Oh, because you were planning to spend that money anyway, right? I was, yeah. Yeah. So okay. it, it's, again, people are making it a much bigger deal than it actually is. It really doesn't matter. But I appreciate the concern. <laughs> but I'll uh, see you in chat, looter. To be honest, I'm probably going to stop the YouTube stream soon. So if you still want to continue watching, I'll be on Twitch and kick. Mainly because I believe it is that time of the day where I consume my gummies. <laughs> Which is a bit mature of a concept for YouTube audiences. That said, if you're below the age of... But Twitch is fine. <laughs> it is. It is, actually. As long as you're not, like, drinking on stream, I believe. Or smoking on stream. I guess the, the technology hasn't quite caught up or no the the platform hasn't quite caught up with the technology of gummies because it's you're just eating candy technically but at the same time you're also dosing so it's like mm -hmm. anyways typical disclaimer for weed <laughs> if you do happen to stop by the twitch stream after i end the youtube one and you watch me eat a gummy that doesn't mean you should too i'm 26 my brain's done cooking so that's not going to negatively impact the literal rest of my life and my that's cognition natural. abilities. So keep that in mind. Anyways, I have to do that every single time I bring it up because I the last thing I want is for someone's life to be 
negatively impacted because of something they saw out of context from me. Because I tend to believe that I've made people's lives better over the years, right? Like with the fitness journey and showing people how to do that and pulling myself out of that situation where I was like in the basement, living in the basement in a ton of debt. But I'm human at the end of the day, you know? I'm not a perfect person. There's things that I would say people probably should emulate from me and there's plenty others that they shouldn't. <laughs> Oh, pretty good. Thank you for the five Canadian. Don't end YouTube stream. Hey, you could just hop over to one of the two other platforms. I'll still be there. And if you don't want ads, there is Kick. If you have Prime, there's Twitch. <laughs> oh, Mavi Clove. Thank you for the Prime speaking up. Hey, 30. Glad to see you streaming again. Yeah, glad to be back, honestly. It's hard to motivate myself sometimes because again i hyper fixated on that goal of just garden so doing literally anything else feels like a waste of time which is awful it's i don't like my brain sometimes and what it does to me it's very annoying just don't listen to it you know what i'm saying <laughs> i did not hear what you said i was reading chat i'm sorry oh okay <laughs> what did you say I said just ignore it. Oh, I try to. In a way, that's kind of the point of me taking the gummies. <laughs> just to kind of forget about it. Oh, Nodded Alpaca. They give it a two. Bought a 3D model. I'll be the funniest VTuber ever. You know what's funny? Me and Fezzy know a guy who actually does that as a job. As a, v a VTuber? Makes 3D models for VTubers. Like one of the people you commissioned it, yeah. It's a very niche job. I heard they're expensive. Like, especially the really detailed ones where it's like, I don't necessarily know how VTuber software works. So like, is there, I would imagine there's a variety of like, there's like levels of how complex a 3D model can get, not only in appearance, but in functionality. Like, like, for example, some 3D models I've seen how, like, they'll have, like, the eyes move. Some are, others they wouldn't. I don't know. Like, some have controllable, like, eyelids, which is weird. I have no idea how that works. Until it turns out I've been a VTuber the whole time. What you're seeing is a... 3D representation of a person that doesn't exist. Brandon figure out the uh Brandon Apple was never real. <laughs> Imagine. The Apple the 3D avatar before Apple. <laughs> <did>. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> this cold mechanic making my mining speed suck is getting real old. <laughs> oh my god. It's cold mechanic. My burps have been getting more violent lately. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Probably the... Well, this week I've had DoorDash like twice instead of the typical one time, so maybe. Why do they always add mechanics that suck? I mean, I don't... <laughs> I feel like there has to be... I don't know. I don't dislike it that much, but it does get kind of old after a while. But it's far from the worst mechanic in Skyblock, so I'm not going to complain. He ignored story time? Oh, 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 did that happen? I'm sorry. Again, I'm the chat feed I'm looking at right here is not Twitch. Or YouTube or Kick. It's none of them. It's all. It's only the chat messages. So the story time didn't even show up for me. But I see it now. Okay, slushy games. Uh, what about? What would the theme be of said story time? You can request a theme. Your prompt is asking a woman out. Well, do you want just a story about a time when that ha when I did that or advice or what? I I'd or imagine advice. a story. 
I don't know if you want my advice. <laughs> <laughs> Not because it'd be bad advice, just because it's like the same generic stuff everybody else says, which is more or less true. To just be yourself. Hey, don't be yourself. <laughs> Um, just I don't need advice because it's you. never going to happen. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> hey, as long as you say that, perhaps. But if you say someday it will happen. I don't know if I believe that mentality of like, oh, speak it into existence. I don't freaking know, man. The brain's a complicated thing. And I acknowledge that saying something's going to happen might be a motivator, but it's not going to like change the the way the universe flows or anything crazy like that <laughs> i don't know manifest it yeah i don't think that's a real thing i think what people call manifesting it is really just them putting themselves in a mindset where they're more likely to accomplish their goal i don't think there's any like spirituality involved i'm not a spiritual person by any means so anything that's like that that's even like slightly like beyond the realm of actual science like jinxing something or bad luck, good luck. Like, I don't, none of that. Anyways, story time. Um, about asking a girl out. Ooh, do you, do you want me to tell a ton of short stories about all the times I failed to do that? Cause that would be funny. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. All right. Oh, wait, hold on. Twitch is getting ads right now. So we'll, we'll give it a like 20, 30 seconds. We'll wait so that the people watching ads don't miss it, which by the way, should probably have the kick stream open. If you, if you're getting, if you're sad about the ads or mad about the ads, I have no incentive to even say that because I'm not even monetized on there yet. But I'm just saying from the viewer perspective. Anyways, um, okay. Ads are done. Okay, let's think. Ooh. Do I go? Okay, I'm gonna try going from longest time ago to most recent, if that makes sense. So the timeline is this, mid-2018, broken up on with girlfriend. Cool, that single again. And then I don't think I even tried to ask a girl out other than a dating app for like over a year maybe even two years oh god i'm starting to lose track of what i'm supposed to mind multitasking um <laughs> let me think bro i i don't i haven't been in a lot of scenarios where i ask a girl out in person it's almost always like an app there was this one time that was really awkward. Okay, screw doing it in order. I'm just gonna talk about whatever comes to mind first. Let's see. Well, there was that one time when I went to visit my mom and we went to a bar. It's a weird dynamic, I know. I think the purpose for me going south was to see a festival with like, not a farmer's market, but like a market of a bunch of like art things. So I was there for that. And then the night of that happening, there was a bar and there was a girl that was around my age that I thought was attractive. And I straight up was like, <laughs> well, what happened was, okay, this is a weird dynamic. There was this dude who looked like he owned the place. Like he just walked around and people were just like, <laughs> I, I hate to say this. There was this guy that weighed like, he looked like he weighed about like 300 pounds, 350 maybe. And he looked like visibly just a guy that's like at the bar, nothing like crazy or special, but like these like 10 out of nine out of 10, 10 out of 10 girls are like interacting with them, talking with them, like patting them on the shoulder. And I'm like, who is this guy? Like, <laughs> he's got, not just girls. There's like guys too. He's got like a group to him <laughs> and he's, and my immediate thought is maybe he's got money or something like what, or he's like really well known in this bar. Like, what is this? And like. He probably has bands, probably. <laughs> but anyway, um, I don't remember what exactly happened, but there was something funny that happened in the bar. And me and one of the girls like noticed it at the same time and laughed about it at, e or like, like with each other in a sense. 
So that was like the icebreaker. Again, it's super vague because I don't even remember what the hell happened. And I'm multitasking, which is making this really hard. Um, yeah, and then I, I was trying to, I was, you know, single at the time. So I was thinking, eh, this girl's nice. I, she seems cool. And I just straight up was like, hey, would you like to go out sometime? And she said, nope. <laughs> she was like, no, sorry. Not literally, nope. But she was like, no, sorry. And I was like, ooh, that's awkward. Which made sense, to be honest. I, um, I was, there was like no build up there was not a lot of chemistry we laughed about one thing that happened one time i don't know this is a weird prompt it's really just gonna be oh i asked her out and she said no <laughs> like, it, like over and over again i don't know i don't have riz okay recipe oh, that's on that's hard man that's hard i'm not even like sad about that to be honest it really doesn't I am. <laughs> Oh wait, oh, this is tungsten. That's not recipe. I don't know. I, I would say I'm at the stage of my life right now where there's just too much crap happening that's not related to dating for me to truly worry about it. You know what I mean? Like, it's not like, oh, I'm perfectly fine being single, but I kind of am. I'm just not thinking about it that much anymore. Which I guess is probably a good thing, because that's like what everybody says about, oh, how do you actually get a yes when you ask out a girl? It's like, well, you kind of have to not give a crap. <laughs> like, that's just how it is. <laughs> and I am starting to unironically hit that don't give a crap stage. Like, I feel kind of bad. I got like three matches on Tinder in the past few days and just... We had a conversation. It was nice. Like, actually went somewhere, talked about the eclipse. And then I just kind of stopped responding. <laughs> I don't know. It's bad. Bro, that... uh, yeah, something. Yeah, it was unfortunate because like I was, I was also speaking to someone since January, and then literally two days before we were supposed to meet, she's like, oh, I kind of already met someone. I'm like, oh, that's so unfortunate. Oh, three months we were basically talking. Oh, that hurts. I've I've know. had those before. Ugh. Just wait I for the girls the to time. ask you out. Oh yeah, like oh. that'll work. <laughs> <laughs> We're not that lucky. <laughs> no, I would have to be the literal Giga Chad. Like, people compliment like some appearance things with me, like sure, but I don't think I'm over that threshold. There's a threshold when it comes to dating apps where it's like the bottom 95% are struggling and the top 5% essentially get whoever they want. I don't think I'm over that threshold. <laughs> I don't know where the threshold is, but I'm not there. Perhaps if I were to, you know, actually go back to the gym, get a six pack, eh, maybe, maybe. And also it, I mean, when it comes to the apps, it's really just looks, but when it comes to like in-person asking someone out, a lot of it is your confidence, a lot. Wait, 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 what did I just redeem? Did I open a mine shaft? Wait. Wait, 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 wait. I opened a mine shaft, where? Chat, help. Where's the mine shaft? No, I don't want to lose it. Can I click a message, a message in chat? Where'd it go? <laughs> a message. They, click no. a massage. <laughs> they stay for like oh it's gone it's freaking gone okay well you know what that clearly shows i need to set up an auto text for it because i completely missed it where is it this auto text because i can't see things create text to action Uh, show text what's a bright color i won't miss purple what's the what's the symbol for either pink or purple in minecraft chat i don't really care it's like and something what's that something <laughs> and d There we go. 
So if I were to paste the message in chat, that didn't work. Sorry. There we go. That Stop should there. be fairly obvious. There it is. Anyways. Ugh. I'm trying to think of other more interesting times I got that I asked a girl out. What's a time where I actually, mm, you know, it's hard because if I try to think about, oh, what are the times when I asked a girl out and she said yes. And it's like, well, that's just, that became a relationship that I've already talked about. Most of them. There was most, just, of the most of them. There was just one girl that- Who was like that... weirdo who was like stalking you or whatever? What? <laughs> there was someone yeah, stalking like, me? Not in real not, life. Not real life, like online. But she like really wanted to meet you or whatever. Oh. Yeah, I remember You know her. what I'm talking about, right? I know who you're talking about. Okay. I, I, we don't have to talk about it. <laughs> yeah, we don't. I, it's probably for the best we don't. I do genuinely hope that she got help because there were some mental issues. And I don't... Gotcha. Yeah. I, I do hope that things are good for her. She probably doesn't wish the same for me. <laughs> to be completely honest. <laughs> when was this? Oh, years ago, dude. First relationship after the big one that ruined me. But we don't need to talk about that. I don't like to gossip about people. I think I said that earlier. Oh. Mm. Mm. oh, did you uh, get to see the eclipse? I tried. I brought my camera out and I put um, an ND filter on it to try and like reduce the amount of, you know. Oh. It, it was not enough. I just saw the sun through the camera lens. There was no eclipse. It was just a ball of light. <laughs> My roommate used to work in construction, so he had a welder's like helmet. Or oh, wow, like that's, a welder's that lens. makes it really easy. <laughs> yeah, it does. It was, it was super, super nice. It was easy to see. But I didn't, I'm in, I'm in Chicago. So it's like, I didn't get the total eclipse, but we got like partial. Wait. Oh, thank you for that um, Prime sub, by the way. CDs69. <laughs> Sanic Twitch, thank you for the Prime as well. Oh, I missed a few of these. Not at Alpaca, thank you for the five. I spent 250 for the model plus rigging plus another 250 because, okay. Because you belong to a certain internet group. costume um oh interesting hey best of luck hopefully everything turns out the way you wanted i'm not saying i'm not uh, obfuscating what you said out of like a way to insult you i'm just a really awkward person and don't like outright saying things like that <laughs> kiwa thank you for the prime and i G Money Live, thank you for the prime. Prime, and I think we're caught up because of that. We are. Maybe I should actually stop fish brain, fish braining. How do I get there, bro? So annoying. Like waypoints are great, but like when you don't know where the mine shaft loops to get there, it's annoying. There we go. Aiken, stop watching 30 stream and focus on the game. <laughs> Is Aiken watching my stream on his stream while playing the update? That would be humorous. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Welcome to stream, Aiken. Oh, and thank you for the, uh, the prime, the dash TM. Citrine is so annoying. It really is. There's like two veins of it and it's hidden behind like a stupid cavern. It's very annoying. The other one that's kind of annoying is Aquamarine. Marine. 
it's funny how quickly the goal for what I'm supposed to mine just leaves my head. It's like, I, I, I press tab and it's like, oh yeah, tungsten. Two seconds go by, what was it? Oh yeah, yeah, tungsten. Two more seconds, wait, 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 what was it? All right, uh, just give me some time. Uh, I... I'll be, be right back. Good luck. Ooh. Oh, I should probably follow through with the thing I said. Uh, all right, everybody watching on YouTube, I believe the time has come for the YouTube stream to die. It just got a thousand likes total. GG. Um, I should probably go back to the camp. But anyways, that's going to be it for the YouTube stream because it is time for me to consume my afternoon gummies. <laughs> And uh, if you would like to consider, if you'd like to continue, consider, if you'd like to continue watching the stream, I'm going to link my Twitch, even though it is already in the description. And if you don't like the Twitch channel because of ads or whatever it is. You can also go to kick.com slash 30 virus where the alt stream is, where there are no ads. So pick your platform of choice and I'll be seeing you guys tomorrow on YouTube. Hopefully if all goes well, I am going to have to slump after the mining fiesta though. It's happening at midnight. So I'll, I'm passing out probably 6 a.m. Uh, that's going to be awful. So that means I'll probably wake up around. Oh, my sleep schedule is going to get absolutely wrecked. Maybe not stream tomorrow. <laughs> I don't know what the hell is going to happen. I, I might have to reset my sleep schedule. Ugh. Let's say a second stream within 48 hours from now. That I can say with decent confidence. All right. Well, anyways, this is your last chance to switch over to another platform. If you're still watching on YouTube, it's your last chance. <laughs> Can you answer my question real quick? Uh, how long does it take to get Heart of the Mountain 7? Depends how you do it, to be honest. I really... I don't have much of a much context, to be 100% honest. All of this was done over a year ago, so the meta has shifted greatly. But I would say Crystal Hollow's commissions are pretty good. And if you really wanted to speedrun it, Nucleus runs while redeeming a gemstone commission every single time you pick up a crystal. I I'd suggest watching my video where I did the Nucleus runs, you know what I mean? Um, anyways, for now, I guess that's it for YouTube. Don't leave if you're on another platform. But for YouTube viewers, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.